What's up? What's up? Let's get this thing up and running. How is everyone doing? Bunch of football on today, of course. <clears throat> What's up, Jacob? Getting this up and running. There we go, there we go. Interesting, no title today, weird. Ah, it does say latent gaming test, of course it does. I don't always say that. <laughs> All right, good to go. YouTube good, Twitch good. Um, music should be good. Check this out quick though. Yeah, it is good. Nice, what's up Spencer? I know, that's the version I had on. That's the version I had on. I saw they were like kicking field goals and then there was like SpongeBob and yeah, it's way better. <laughs> I saw SpongeBob multiple times. I saw Green Slime. I, it's it's something. That's for sure. It is something. Pretty funny stuff, man. Really funny stuff, actually. Really, really funny stuff. <laughs> <clears throat> and then that first game today was... Uh, not quite much of a game, unfortunately. Not quite much of a game. <laughs> More just um, practice for the Buccaneers, I guess. And then they get to advance because they scored more points. But, yeah, that was not really much of a game. <laughs> it was uh, something, though. What's up, present? What's happening? A bunch of Almanac spots have come in recently. Thanks, guys. Unfortunately, but this one's looking like it'll be a game. Present, I also just saw your uh, recent message about the Mothmans. I'll have to do a better job looking out for that as well. I see what you're kind of talking about. It's a little bit tough to identify, but I do see it, I think. Philly blows. <laughs> That's pretty accurate, unfortunately, Jacob. <laughs> they didn't do the best, man. They did not do the best. Unfortunately, another spot just came in there. Three left now on that cosmic and evolving. What's happening, Dan? What's happening, man? Three left now. Sweet. Yeah, they sell for a big premium. Interesting, man. Interesting. Like how much more? <laughs> if you know the exact amount. Just curious. I know like the Mothmans usually get something around like 50 to 60 normal. I think. Get that thrown in the garbage. Ooh, nice, Dan. Nice. Those are always fun. Those are always fun. Kyle did one of those last night, and he, uh, I think he went the, uh, oh, for none of his picks. <laughs> but last night was kind of a weird one. He had, like, you know, like, the Patriots running back and stuff like that, and it was, it was a weird game. Wow. Holy cow, What? <laughs> Jeez, I have multiple Mothmans. I'll have to give them a look. Um, so there is a, there's an error with the Mothmans, Jacob. Um, basically, um, it's like the yellow ink is kind of like a shadow um, on the Mothman. And it like extends a little bit further past the Mothman's shoulders and his head. Um, if you look up Mothman... Error Nightfall on eBay, you'd probably be able to find it. What's up, hey Zeus? What's up, man? Good luck to you tonight. I think you'd be able to find it looking it up that way. Ah, but that's nuts. That's really nuts. Holy cow. Seeing a couple more orders are coming in here tonight. Can you give it a refresh? See where we're at. Two left now on that next one tonight. Sweet. Two left. That is Cosmic and VMAX Climax. 1.5. Only two left there. If you are interested, I'll grab you the link here. <clears throat> that one is filling up quick here tonight. Hey, sounds good, Dan. Sounds good. We will be here ripping. Gonna get the first random going, guys, in just a couple of minutes here. You have one of those, Jacob. It sounds like they're selling for um, a really nice premium right now. Um, a couple hundred dollars, said presents. You'll have to give it a little bit more research on eBay and stuff. But that's, uh, I have to give mine a look now as well. I have two Mothman full hollows, so I'll have to see if I have any luck. 
also maybe having that error. Yeah, I, I like that error stuff though. Some people don't care for it, like I said. I tend to enjoy it. But like I said, some people definitely don't care for that, which is understandable. It's understandable. All right, let me do a little bit of typing quick and then I'll get right into our uh, first random of the night. Appreciate everyone tonight. Should be a fun night, guys. Quite the schedule here for you tonight. You can see it right now on that screen in front of you. All of the breaks that we're going to have going down for you this evening. Should be awesome. And good luck, of course, everyone this evening. So you can see there are about half the breaks or so that are sold out already tonight. And then another handful already have quite a few spots in. So thank you very much for that. Alrighty, guys. Thank you very much. I'm keeping all my Nightfall cards. I haven't... I also have not sold one of my cards when it comes to actually anything MetaZoo. Um, I don't really plan to anytime soon. Although they do have value right now, which is sweet as well. But I don't really plan to sell any of them right now. No. <clears throat> and honestly, like I said as well, um, I don't... Uh, I don't really know what's going to happen with Nightfall in the future. We kind of had this talk the other day as well. You know, who really knows where it's going to go? <laughs> it's, it's almost like impossible to say. Ah, nice, Ryan. Good luck on those. Nice, Ryan. Good luck. Dang, Jacob. That is... That seems extreme. <laughs> that seems extreme. I don't have, like, a bunch of these to, like, look at in hand or anything yet. Um, but that, that seems really extreme. So that could be, um, like, a really nice premium. That's awesome, Jacob. That's sick. Congrats. The poll gets better and better as time goes on with MetaZoo, it seems like. Just keep finding out these crazy things. Oh, look, there's a bat in it. Premium. Look, there's uh, something with yellow ink. Premium. <laughs> it's nuts. What's up, Daniel? What's happening, man? All right, guys, I'm ready to get into the first random tonight. Get this night underway for us. Should be a fun one. Should be a fun one tonight, guys. And appreciate it, as always. One spot left now on our next break tonight. Appreciate that. Just one to go now on that Cosmic and VMAX Climax break. That is breaking next tonight, only about 30 minutes from now. Let's get to the random. Let's get the night going. How you doing, Ryan? How's it going, everyone? Caleb here with Layton Gaming. Doing the random for the first break of the night is the Dual Booster, Fusion Strike, and Evolving Skies. Number 13. Good luck, got the seven names here. Good luck, guys. Let's get this one going tonight. Got uh, six here on the names and then six on the energy. Good luck. Dual booster, get the night going. One, two, three, four, five, six. Got Jesus C at the top, Jacob P at the bottom. Six on energy, good luck. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Got the five-way combo at the top and water at the bottom. Yo, what's up, Sean? How you doing? I don't think I got the refresh. There it goes. Names, energy, perfect. Jesus C at the top. And then should be five-way combo at the top. Yep. All right, Jesus C, the five-way combo. That is firefighting, electric, metal, and basic. Lots to keep up with there. Jacob P, you're going to have that trainer spot. Uh, Jackson B, Psychic. Douglas W, Dark. Daniel H, you're going to have Grass and Dragon. And then Jacob P, Water. All right, let's get this one going. Six o'clock. Time to get the night going, guys. And best of luck here on our first break of the evening, starting it out with some Pokemans. Pokemans. Let's do it. <clears throat> Just get those results onto the website really quick, guys. And we're ready to get this thing on the road tonight. See how we do tonight. Let's find some big alt arts. Let's find some big tag teams later on tonight. We've got some fun um, cosmic eclipse coming up really soon. And then we've got more sun and moon action later as well. Um, so yeah, let's find some nice tag teams tonight, guys. I'm seeing some orders coming on in. So thank you very much. Appreciate that, guys. Let's get the night underway here. <clears throat> ah, yeah, no, Ryan. Yeah, so the only issue, um, or the only reason that the sports side has that um, paid chat is because there were some 
issues with spammers and stuff like that in the past, uh, we haven't really run into those problems ourselves. So yeah, it's free to, free to chat in the community here. Yep, yep, yep. The YouTube chat is definitely a lot more active as well. Sold out there. Very much appreciate that. Let's get the night going. All right, so Ultra Premium. That is the next one now. Five left there on the Ultra Premium. And then we got to show some love to those breaks later on this evening. Here you go. Five left. Ultra Premium. Take your chance at those sick promos. Let's get this first one going here, guys. Thanks for joining. All right, how's it going, everyone? Caleb here with Leighton Gaming. Doing our first break of the evening on Sunday Funday going to be the duel with evolving and fusion break number 13 good luck uh, show you the results quick and we'll get this underway here thanks again everyone who did join uh let's start it with fusion strike tonight i'm feeling fusion strike did just change my knife blade it's feeling extra sharp feeling extra sharp and crispy there <clears throat> yeah exactly ryan it was it was um a decision that actually took like a lot of time but unfortunately, it was one that uh, became essential at, at one point in time. Uh, yes, correct. You do get the figure. Yep, correct. If you order it for rip it or ship it, either one. If you order it for rip it, I will rip it here on the channel following the group breaks tonight. So that would be at about 11 p.m. Eastern. I would get to ripping that. And it would actually be the first personal as well. Um, and then, yes, you do get the figure well protected and stuff like that. Yes, indeed, Nasty. Yes, indeed. A really cool figure to have. And then all the promos, of course, and the contents from the packs. All right, good luck. Fusion Strike to get the night going, guys. Charger Bug, Y Vettel. And appreciated that Cosmic and VMAX break that did already sell out, so thank you very much. Uh, we've got the Ultra Premium left with some spots tonight. We've got that Flesh and Blood break later on tonight. Primeape, Starmie. That's the full case of Tales of Aria. Unlimited print. Um, and then we've got the Triple Sun and Moon Booster. Uh, one that we do not get to do too often. That's got some spots left later on this evening. Uh, really, really fun one there. That is going to feature... Oh, we got Chandelure V. Nice. Fire type hit there. Chandelure. That's going to feature a box of Burning Shadows, a box of Ultra Prism, and a box of Unified Minds. So if you think about those three sets there... Um, it can really, really spread out the hits. Burning Shadows, a huge fire chase. Um, some really nice psychic cards in Unified Minds. Ultra Prism has some great trainer cards. Actually, all of them have some great trainer cards, but uh, Ultra Prism really has some good ones. So, yeah, check that one out later on tonight. And then we got that evolving full case going after that. Uh, those are all the breaks with spots left tonight. Uh, in between that, we've got the Cosmic Break. We've got that uh, Meta Zoo Break tonight, a couple of them. Trainer spot. There you go. Schoolboy. Nice. There you go, Jacob. So quite the schedule and quite a wide variety as well. Sean dropped in the chat there the link for the Ultra Premium. That is the next one with spots. Breaks in about an hour. Sent to Scorch. And I hope everyone's been enjoying the football today. Uh, the first game was uh, not much of a game, like I said, right when I went live tonight. Unfortunately. Electros. Unfortunately, not much of a game. Uh, but, hey, the second one is, is turning out alright so far. Got True Mission Ladius. All right, nothing too nuts in the box so far. A nice schoolboy, though, to get the night going. Trainer card. Fusion packs are being difficult. Got Claydol. Swampert. Hollow. You go water type. And then should be another good game tonight with the Steelers and Chiefs. Marizian. That's got, uh, that's got high scoring written all over it. In my opinion, at least. Chiefs defense is pretty laughable. And the Steelers have a good defense, but... I don't know, man. It's Mahomes, you know. Oh, we got Greed and VMAX. Basic type hit. There you go, Jesus. And that five-way combo. Greed and VMAX. 
And then tomorrow night, guys, is a night of personals. We'll have some more group breaks on Wednesday again after these uh, group breaks tonight. Have those listed for you in the morning. Victini. Uh, Slugma Kangaskhan. I was watching um, some gameplay and some trailers for that new uh, game coming out on Switch pretty soon. Um, the new Pokemon game, Legends Arceus. I'm pretty excited about that. Oh, we got Crab Abominable. There you go, Water. So pretty, pretty excited about that game as well. We'll see how that is. <clears throat> That's crazy, Jacob. Got Luxray. You'll have to keep us updated, Jacob, if you get any action on that thing. I bet you're going to get a lot of views at the very least. Voltorb. Hollow Starmie. Dang, Josh. Yeah, I hear you, man. It can be a process to sort through cards, for sure. You got to have a system down, man, to, to really do it efficiently. It's tough. It's really tough, actually. Especially when you're, like, set building. It can be extremely difficult. Uh, Maructus, at least not extremely difficult, but extremely difficult to do it quickly, you know <clears throat> Extremely difficult to do it quickly Got Dupiter, Claydol uh, Muna, Araquanid so we're talking about, um, Josh, we're talking about the Mothman error. If you go over to the Discord and then in the MetaZoo general chat, you can see um, the pictures that Present was posting. He's talking about, the, um, there's an error with the MetaZoo uh, Nightfall Mothman, where the hollow is sometimes um, like a little bit more yellow and more extended. And I guess those have a premium right now, like a big premium actually. A couple hundred dollars. Ooh, very nice. Fighting type. It's gonna be an alternate art Sanaconda V. There you go. Hey Zeus. Some first break mojo. Congrats, man. Nice. Alternate art snake. Congrats on that, hey Zeus. Very nice. Funny card with the uh, space heater in the picture. There you go. Fighting, hey Zeus, on that uh, first break mojo. Very nice, man. Congrats. Yeah, it's it's pretty nuts, Josh. It's pretty nuts. Um, Toxtricity Hollow, crushing it with the five-way combo, Jesus. Crushing it. Congrats, man. It's that first break mojo. It's how it works sometimes, man. Trubbish Cloister, just how it works sometimes. Farewell, Bell. Yo, what's up, David? What's happening, man? Get these going. Victini, Y Vettel, Frostmoth, got a Tyranitz RV. There you go, Dark Type. Dark Type on that one. And of course, the Evolving Skies is the second box here in this uh, two booster box break. Cosmic coming up next. That is all sold out. Appreciate that, guys. Skitty and Latius. Appreciate that very much. Moving right on to that next. Got Diggersby, Sentis Scorch. So I guess the, the old saying used to be never bet against uh, Belichick in the playoffs. Maybe it's just uh, never bet against Brady. Maybe that's uh, what it should be. <laughs> I am indeed, Josh. I am indeed. Breloom, Butterfree Hollow. Uh, not only am I trying to complete like the standard set that you pull from the packs, I'm also looking to get all of the Nightfall promos, um, and I'm looking to get all of the... Yes, I will, Jacob. Hold on. Uh, Tynamo, Electros, and I'm looking to get all of those like, um, like Nightfall stamp cards and stuff like that. Everything pretty much besides the spoiler pack, and I have one sealed spoiler pack, but I'm looking to get all the cards besides that pretty much. So yeah, I'm going for like a, a big set. And of course, not Old Scratch. <laughs> Unless I was somehow lucky enough to pull that. There you go, Jacob. Thanks, Sean. Got it as well there. Appreciate that. Appreciate 
appreciate that. Nice, Josh. I think I'm somewhere near the same. Ladius. I think I'm like right around a couple dozen as well. And then I have a few more promos. Like I want to get all the release event box promos and stuff like that. There's been a couple of other Nightfall promos as well. Or promos that are like considered Nightfall promos. Apple pie for grass. But yeah, I am indeed looking to uh, complete it as well. I'm getting really close as well. Been making some progress. Yeah, I know, Josh. I hear you. I hear you, man. Ooh, nice one. Water. I'm telling you on VMAX. Packs are heating up. There you go, water. I hear you, though, man. <laughs> no joke. That would really complete it. But that's certainly not a card I would be purchasing, so it would just have to come off luck. Um, Lander is hollow, but if I did pull one, I probably wouldn't sell it. But I also don't plan on ever pulling one. <laughs> At least for myself. Uh, Verizian. <clears throat> Got Star you and Azu Meryl. Nice present saw it on eBay. Nice. All right, let's get the next box of the break going, guys. Evolving skies now. One for one on alt art so far. We'll take it. We'll take it. All right, best of luck. Let's do it. Move the bulk real quick. All right, sweet. Uh, Bravery, Dialga Hollow. Got an Umbreon V. There you go, Dark. Nice. Dark type with another hit there. Good start to the box. Like to see the hits coming out this early. <laughs> right, Josh. I know. That's what I was thinking. So much with ink. Treasure energy. Special energy and a pincer. Yeah, no joke, man. Who thought ink would ever be so influential? Um, we got a Rayquaza VMAX. Nice. Dragon. Congrats. Dragon, not much at all. Infusion. Lots in evolving. Congrats. Good start, Dragon. Rayquaza VMAX for you. Got Pikachu and Apple Pie. Hippopotus and Gorgeous. Got a wishy-washy there. Vigoroth, Florgus Hollow. It is nuts though, man. Just like a slight, slight difference like that with Metazoo can literally make all the difference in the world. Hypno and Tropius, it can make all the differences. It's crazy. <clears throat> Ooh. Very nice. Alternate art. Umbreon V. Boom. Very nice card. Wow. Douglas. Wow. What a start to your night, Douglas. Congrats on that Umbreon. Alternate art. That is a fantastic way to get going tonight. Congrats, man. Great hits. There you go, grab a mag tag for that one. I do have some mag tags already ready. Nice, congrats, man. Great card, Douglas. Very nice. Crushing this break, two alts now. Very nice. Congrats, everyone, doing well on this so far. Awesome centering as well, yes, indeed. Seismitoad, yes, indeed, very well centered. Full face guard, Stoutland. Got a Rayquaza V, dragon type. I feel like your uh, 
eBay listing is gonna get like a lot of views, Jacob. And then I feel like you're gonna get a bunch of low ball offers as well. Shift tree. That's usually what happens on stuff like that when there's like a, a craze that's going on. But we'll see. Maybe I mean people are people are really into medicine right now. Anti hollow. Flesh and blood base later on. Yeah, man. Should be fun, Josh. Got that full case coming up tonight, guys. Flesh and blood tales of Arya. Later on tonight. Some spots as well on that one. That's fair as well, Jacob. That's true. Yeah, it should be good, Josh. Can't wait for that, man. Moon and Sun Badge, Alteria. On the last case, it took a... Uh, it was slow, man. It was slow. The first three boxes were leaving us with a lot of Majestics, some foil Majestics even. And we got to that last box, and we had not only a Legendary, but a Fabled in the box as well. Foil Legendary, that is. Apple Pie. It was, it was a great time. <laughs> it was a great time. Very, very sick. Yeah, Jacob, for sure. Keep these going. Oh, we got a Glaceon VMAX. Nice one, water. There you go, water. Congrats. Solid. Yeah, that's awesome, Josh. I would never expect that either, to be honest. I, I would never expect that. Floetti Raichu Hollow. I, I just wouldn't have. <laughs> Especially after you pull a legendary, it's like, all right, that's gotta be the box. That's gotta be the box, right? box has to be fairly dead at least maybe a foil majestic still uh, which can be nice you know but the odds of like finding another legendary have to be low and yeah i guess fabled was not even not even in my thoughts of thoughts at the time <laughs> and it came on out it's crazy man absolutely crazy what we got this time volt corona there you go fire volt corona v Pretty dang sick though, Josh. It's pretty dang sick. Victini, gorgeous. Spirit Mask. Woo Buffett and Smeargle. Got Cosmic Eclipse and VMAX Climax. The 1.5 booster break up next tonight. That one did sell out pretty much right as I went live. Bunch of spots came in for it. So appreciate that. And good luck on it. Articuno Hollow. Appreciate it and good luck. Elemental badge, my low tick. Nuzleaf Seismitoad. Got an Arctivish. Water once again. Water actually had quite a few hits for not having like a big one. Multiple Vs of Emax. Alright, let's grab like a nice full art or rainbow or gold here at the end. Come on. Oh, full art! Arctivish! Water! <laughs> Speaking of all the things I just said. Arctivish, full art, water. <laughs> That's wild. There you go. That's how it happens, man. Crazy. Alright, what else can the box have in store for us? Shogun and Slacking Hollow for basic. Good old slacking. Uh, Emolga and Talon Flame. Nice. Rabombi. <laughs> Yo, Josh, that's nuts. Stoutland Lilligant. To be fair, you're just probably joining the right ones. Like the full cases and the half cases have some extreme potential. Where you can find, um, you know, two plus legendaries or fabled cards. If you're getting lucky with that many boxes and stuff like that. And um, <clears throat> the thing about it is these breaks only have five to seven spots. So you're narrowing it down uh, between only a few people. And that's really the thing it comes down to. is They don't have a ton of spots on Flesh and Blood. Not a ton of classes in the game itself. Uh, Flip Baby, Alteria, but there are some new classes coming with the new expansion. So, <laughs> that's funny, Josh. 
Yeah, I do remember pulling all of them. Um, the Eye of um, Ohida, or however you pronounce that, that one is a crazy looking card. And Zorark Hollow to close it out. Thanks again, everyone, who did hop in. Fusion and Evolving. That was the Dual Booster number 13. Appreciate that. We'll get those all protected. Sent right out to everyone. Thank you again. Couple of alt arts in the break. That's always fun. Nice to start out the night with a couple of alternate arts. And nice. So the next one is already sold out. We will be moving right onto it. Underway. And that one is now complete. I'm going to upload that quick. And we will be moving right along tonight. Check out that tonight sheet right there in front of you. While I am working on getting the next one uploaded, or the last one uploaded, and the next one set up. So we got five left in the Ultra Premium break. That's going to be breaking uh, pretty soon here, that Ultra Premium. It breaks pretty, pretty soon. Uh, it breaks in about a half hour. If you are interested in that one, I will drop you the link right now for the Ultra Premium. Five left there, guys. Five left. Chase after those sick metal promos. And then, uh, of course, all the hits from the packs. And like I said, appreciate Cosmic selling out. We'll be moving right along to it. Let's grab these last two names. Sweet. And then if you're interested in some of those breaks that you see later on tonight, feel free to grab that second link I just dropped in the chat for you. Uh, the break schedule there. You can grab yourself spots for those later on breaks tonight. Like I said, we got some full ones later. We got the Triple Booster Sun and Moon series. Uh, that's the second time we're doing that one. Remember that features Burning Shadows, Unified Minds, and Ultra Prism. Big hitter sets there with some crazy chase cards. And then we got an Evolving Skies full case as well at the end of the night. <coughs> All right, move that quick. And then Cosmic up next, guys. That box from last night and the VMAX Climax Booster. Pretty, pretty fun variety of stuff tonight. Got a little bit of MetaZoo between all the Pokemon and then some Flesh and Blood later on as well. With a little bit of spots left on the Flesh and Blood still. That is one that you might be interested in. Close that, close that. And let me get these all set up tonight, guys, for the next one. Appreciate everyone hopping in Cosmic. Let's do it. Uh, this is going to be number four here on the Cosmic. <clears throat> Seeing some orders are coming in. I appreciate that. I will update the tonight sheet uh, momentarily. Get this all set up first. Holy cow. Four orders all at once. Appreciate that, guys. And like I said, appreciate the Almanac spots that came in today as well. Very much. What are we? Six days away now, guys. I'm getting excited, man. I'm getting really excited uh, to show you guys some of these crazy hits that are waiting in the Almanac, man. Some crazy stuff. Some stuff that um, you don't get to see every day. That's for sure. That is for sure. And when it comes to gaming, that's that's tough to see as well. Because uh, it's gaming, you know. The point is to actually have multiple of the cards. That way you can go ahead and utilize them in gameplay and stuff like that. That is literally the reason behind it. <laughs> couple there. Couple there as well. Nice. Three left now on that Ultra Premium. Appreciate that. Four left here. And four left also. Oop. Try that again. Four left also on Tales of Aria, I believe. So thank you very much. A couple more spots did just come in. Um, and I'm ready to do the next random as well. Cosmic Eclipse, VMAX Climax. Good luck on this random. How's it going, everyone? Caleb here with Layton Gaming. Doing the random for Cosmic Eclipse and VMAX Climax. 1.5, number four. Good luck, everyone, and thank you for hopping in. Appreciate it. These are always fun. I love ripping Cosmic and VMAX Climax as well. Great time. Nine spots. Let's do it. Uh, eight times here on the names and then the energy. Good luck. Got an eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, uh, seven, and eight. Got Stephen A at the top, Daniel W at the bottom. 
eight. Energy, good luck. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Got trainer at the top and quad combo at the bottom. All right, all right. So let me grab these, pair them up, guys. Names and energy. Here we go. Trainer at the top. All right, perfect. Stephen A with that trainer spot, as well as Psychic and Fire. And then Douglas W with Dark. John Carlo F going to have Dragon. Justin T with Water. Anthony D Grass. Derek M Electric. And Daniel W. Quad combo with Basic Fighting, Fairy, and Metal. All right, good luck. Let's get this one going. Appreciate it. Let me get those results onto the website really quick. And we'll hop right into the next break here, guys. It's so tough to say, Josh, but I don't know. I like how um, affordable it is right now, especially considering like how possible it is to um, to pull the hits. You know, it's not impossible to actually pull these legendaries. Fables are really tough, actually, um, but it's not impossible to pull the legendaries. So I think for that reason, people are always gonna like want to rip this stuff because there's gonna be people playing the game and stuff for for quite a while. I have a feeling. And they're going to want these cards not only for their decks, but also for their collections. So, yeah, I, I think it's going to do well over time. But it's so tough to say because it's just not one of those established TCGs where it's going to go. We don't know what they have planned for it, you know? Whereas, like, Pokemon, we know they have all these other things always planned. There's multiple, like, video games, franchises. They've had um, TV and movie in the past. Um, adding stuff like that to a trading card game can really help it grow. Um, and usually trading card games do get to that point, but it just takes more time. So that that's really the problem with that. Uh, you just don't know how much time it's going to take for them to really get to that point where they're going to be reaching all those audiences, if it ever happens. But at the same time, Flesh and Blood is probably one of the most liked and one of the most playable uh, trading card games right now. So it's going to have a deep following right now for that. <coughs> So that is, it's a, it's a good question though. Yeah, and exactly. The new hero that they did just add is awesome because that shows that they're already looking to, you know, go ahead and try to improve as much as they can and, and keep trying to improve the gameplay. So I think it is awesome that they're already adding new heroes and yeah, stuff like that. It's, it's good to see. Definitely encouraging signs. Um, definitely encouraging signs. But I mean... Um, considering we carry the product, that kind of tells you our opinion. <laughs> Alright, good luck. Let's get into this, guys. Cosmic VMAX Climax, the 1.5. Appreciate it. Everyone who did hop in, let's get it underway tonight. And best of luck, as always. Thank you again, guys. How's it going, everyone? Caleb here with Leighton Gaming. Getting it going, guys, with a Cosmic Eclipse and VMAX Climax 1.5 booster box break. Second one here tonight. This is number four. Here are uh, the results. We just did that random for you. <clears throat> Good luck, everyone. And let's see what we can find. Lots of great cards uh, throughout these sets. So let's see how we do. And lots of great spots to land in the random. Uh, so first, I'll just grab out the rest. This is, of course, the rest of that box from last night. And empty. I will count them out really quick. It'll be 18 packs here. Two, four, six, eight, uh, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18. So there we go. That is all of the Cosmic. This is all of the VMAX. Let's do it. Start it with the VMAX. Good luck. <laughs> <laughs> the combo king this could actually be one dan where the combo could have some life but yeah you do land the combo a fair amount of the time for sure dan w combo king dan parentheses combo king w <laughs> but this is one where it could have some life with just so many hits across cosmic and stuff the secrets <clears throat> specifically but yeah it just always limits you at those like huge huge hits Oh, nice start. Fire. That's going to be sent to Scorch. Character secret. Very nice. 
First pack, Magic, Rose, and Senescorch. There you go, Fire, and then a Cast Form, Reverse Hollow. Very cool. Congrats on that one. Nice hit. Fire type getting it going. Good start for you. Congratulations. <clears throat> First pack, Magic. Let's see what else we can do now. Good luck, guys. Got Zapdos, fighting type, and that is Cafe Master, reverse hollow. Sweet, sweet. Let's keep these going here tonight, everyone. Got an Urshifu V Max. There you go, fighting. Nice hits. Uh, Weedle, reverse hollow. Nice. Two left on Ultra Premium, I think, guys. A couple more just came in. Yeah, only two left now. That is breaking next tonight. If you are interested in the Ultra Premium Break, feel free to check out that link there. Two remaining. That is the next break tonight. Only about 20 minutes away. Only about 20 minutes away. Two to go. Got an Electrode. Got a Zamazenta. And we got a Flareon. Fire off to a hot start. Congrats. I think that was Steven that had fire. Congrats. And Zamazenta. Looking forward to those Cosmic Eclipse, guys. I want to see some secrets. Some really, really cool ones. You guys already know how much I like tag teams. So let's find some of those as well. Gardevoir. Oh, we got Mimikyu VMAX. Psychic type hit. And then we got an Eevee. That is a basic type character rare. Not too bad there, basic. There you go. And Mimikyu VMAX. <clears throat> Ooh, very nice. That's going to be Mustard. Congrats. Rapid Strike Mustard. There you go. Trainer spots. Nice card. Out of VMAX Climax. Congrats on that one. Sent to Scorch as well again. And then a special energy reverse. Nice. The box did have a trainer as well. Always nice to see that. Keep these going. Secret and a trainer so far. Very nice. Find a couple more nice character rares. Come on now. Maybe that Charizard. Got a Zamazenta. Or that's a Zacian there. Zacian V. Metal type. On the Zacian. bit left here on this guys keep it going got frost moth oh nice one umbreon vmax there you go dark nice card uh wishful nets reverse hollow nice congrats on that dark umbreon vmax nice one That is a Moltres, Dark again, and Phalanx, Reverse. Hey, sounds good, Dan. I can uh, distribute those across the break. Can do that. Uh, we got Cresselia, Octillery. Drilladon VMAX is Dragon, and we got a Phalanx. Character rare for fighting. Keep the VMAX Climax separate, and then I can yeah, get those out at the end. Perfect. All right, and Cosmic, guys. Good luck. 18 packs. Looking for some tag teams. Looking for some secret rares, and of course, some rainbow action. Come on, let's find a rainbow, and let's make it a tag team right away. Good luck, everyone. Uh, we got Throw. <laughs> nice. Reverse Hollow. Throw, and Blastolin. Hollow for uh, Psychic there. Very cool card. Very nice. Yeah, that's what I mean, Josh. They've got... Uh, they still are perfect for stuff like that. Same thing, like, I give a lot of mine to, like, my little sister usually. And she, yeah, she really loves them. Even just, like, a, you know, like a nice flying Pikachu V or something like that. Goes a long way. Trevenant. Definitely goes a long way. <clears throat>
Yeah, definitely, Josh. Definitely. Teddy Ursa, Reverse Hollow, Heli Eloisk. But it's nice. Um, I mean, every card shouldn't just be like a massive Pokemon card. You know, that wouldn't make sense if there's only alternate arts and no V cards and stuff. It wouldn't right. It wouldn't be right. So, exactly. You have to have those cards for for others to play with, to learn with, all that stuff. All of that stuff, man. We got a draw energy, reverse energy for um, trainer, special energy there, and Drago. <clears throat> Yeah, that was pretty sweet present. That worked out well. The frog is your dude, man. He is your guy. Got a Swana. Decidueye. That's a hollow there. A Decidueye. Very cool. Will. Exactly, Josh. Exactly. What's this one got for us? Jangmu? And, ooh, wow, that is so sick. Reshiram and Zekrom GX. How about it? Dragon type energy. Beautiful tag team hit. Congrats on that dragon. Wow, that's awesome looking. Reshiram and Zekrom. Very cool. Congrats, dragon. Who's got dragon? Let me give that a look. That's a nice hit there. Not too bad at all. Giancarlo, very nice. It's a great card. Congrats, man. Beauty there. Nice one, Giancarlo. Congrats on that. Beautiful dragon type hit. Nice Vaporeon back there. Love that artwork. Cosmic. Good luck on Cosmic. Keep these going. Rufflet. Wow! Dragon on fire! Nagandal and Guzzlord! Rainbow tag team! There you go, John Carlo! Congrats, man! That is fantastic! There you go, John Carlo! Very nice hit, man! Awesome dragon type! Rainbow tag team! Beauty! You go, John Carlo. Very nice. That's sick. Dragon back to back bangers there for you. Wow. Congratulations, man. John Carlo smashed it. Ooh, fire. That's a Torkoal. Secrets. Nice. Congrats. These packs are heating up. Jeez. There you go, fire. Very nice. I can't wait to rip some more Sun and Moon later. Very, very nice. Congrats on that. There you go. Fire. Torkoal. Whimsicott is the rare. <laughs> right, Randy? Right, man? Whoa, the packs are on fire, guys. Whoa! Trainer! Cynthia and Caitlyn! Boom! Whoa! They are on fire! Four in a row! Big hitters in all of them! Wow! Congrats! That is a big one! Hello there! Stephen A! Wowzers, man! Cynthia and Caitlin on your tag team trainer. That's very nice! Great hit from the set. Congrats. We'll get that one magged up for you. Very nice hit, Steven. And a beautiful card as well. Wow. Congrats, Steven. Big hitter there. Sun and moon, man. Sun and moon. What can I say? If you guys are interested in sun and moon, we do have that break later on tonight. Uh, feel free to take a look at the description here. Take a look at the boxes and stuff involved. Some big hitters, guys. And like I said... Uh, the, the packs kind of spread themselves out there with that break. Unified Minds has some huge Psychic hits. Burning Shadows, huge Fire hits. Uh, we got some huge Trainer action in Ultra Prism. And then all those sets do have some other great hits as well, of course. But yeah, that's going to be a great one later on tonight. If you do like Sun and Moon, you might want to check that out. But these are on fire right now. No way! Another hit! Five in a row! 
Wow, basic. Mega Low Punny and Jigglypuff. Five in a row. Unbelievable. Congratulations, guys. That is nuts. I don't know if I've ever opened five hits in a row. Any set. Congratulations. Basic now. Tag team. That's crazy. Five hits in a row. Whoa. I don't know if that's ever happened. <laughs> Honestly. Not too sure on that. Six in a row. Arceus, Dialga, Palkia, Dragon. Where it all started. What is going on? Six hits in a row. <laughs> oh my goodness. Wow, I've never done that. I can confirm. There's no way I've ever done that. <laughs> There's no way. Oh my goodness, six hits in a row. All of them are really sweet as well. Congratulations, everyone. Let's go. These are on fire right now. Can we keep it up? Cosmic Eclipse coming through. The point five. Jeez. Ooh, it comes to an end after six. Wow, still a very, very nice run there. Six in a row. Congratulations. That is awesome. Oh, wow, another hit here. Got a Volcarona GX for fire. Nice. She's nearly seven in a row there. Great catcher. I've never seen something like this with Cosmic, man. Holy cow. <laughs> We're on fire right now. Jeez, guys. Stoutland, Reverse Hollow, and a Sun Flora. No joke, Josh. The Charizard battling the Venusaur. Like, how does it get better than that? <laughs> In terms of an alternate art. It's just a crazy design. Wow, nice hit. Water. Weevil, secret rare. There you go, water. Weevil. Very cool. Congrats, water. Nice one. There's the rare. Ampaboon. There we go, camera. Yeah, I, I'm just excited, man, because if they have a V, that means eventually there's going to be a VMAX alt. I'm excited for what that's going to be as well, whenever that might be. Coughing and bravery. Jeez, what a half here, guys. The first half was good as well of this box. There was two Charizards in the first half of this box. Two Charizards in the first half. One of them was the full art as well, tag team. Big hits in the whole box. Muck and Drampa. Huge box. Crazy box. Congratulations, everyone who did hop in. That's awesome, guys. Love ripping boxes like this. Why not? Mallow and Lana reverse. And a wishy-washy. Hollow. To end it out. Thank you again, everyone who hopped in. Appreciate that very much. Really fun rip there. We'll get those protected and sent right out to y'all. Very much. Appreciate that, guys. That was sick. Holy cow. I've never pulled six hits in a row like that. <laughs> That's a crazy feeling, guys. Just so much heat all in a row. Nice. Couple more spots are coming in for later on tonight. Appreciate that. Three left there. And six left now on that sun and moon later on tonight. And we still got two on this uh, ultra premium. So we got to get this one sold out, guys. Just two left here on ultra premium now. And we can get right into it. We did just complete that one. Sweet. So two left only here. Let's get these last two spots sold out. And we can move right into the box. Ultra premium time. Uh, scheduled to start in 10 minutes. We have a little bit of time. If you are interested, I just dropped the link in the chat. Two remaining. Ready to go as soon as we're sold out on it, guys. <clears throat> and appreciate that. Like I said, some more just came in for that Tales of Aria full case. And uh, also some more for that triple booster. Sun and Moon later on tonight. Some awesome breaks there. Wow, and that was an awesome break. Let me upload that. That's Cynthia and Caitlyn card. That's a fantastic hit. It's a fantastic hit there, Steven. That's the, that's the type of card that, you know, people are always going to want something like that. Two of the most desirable trainers of all time on the same card, tag team style. 
It's gonna be something, man. It's beautiful. Congrats again. And like I said, just two left, guys, on the Ultra Premium. I'm gonna grab the box. As soon as we are sold out on it, we will get into it. And yup, Dan, I did make a note uh, to distribute that uh, stuff for you from the break. There. Grab the base there from that break. Let me get the Ultra Premium. Just need two slots, guys. And then we got some MetaZoos up next. MetaZoos up next tonight. I said guys two left on the ultra premium as soon as we do get these last two spots can start getting that random underway for you <clears throat> number 21 here on the ultra premium Chase after those big hitter uh, promo cards, of course, and then uh, all the hits from the packs. Grab that. If you are interested, here is the link for it. Two left, guys. Ultra Premium. Celebrations Ultra Premium, of course. All right, do one thing here and we'll be getting into that shortly. Just need those last two spots for it. Appreciate everyone who has hopped in so far and best of luck trying to track down those promos. Do a little bit of typing quick. Yep, that's what I got. Indeed. One left now on the Ultra Premium. Thank you. Appreciate that. One to go. Ultra Premium. Two left on Tales of Aria later tonight. Two left there. That's the full case, guys. 50 bucks a spot on that one. I think it's at $37.99 on the Ultra Premium. One left there. Ultra Premium break. Get that next name into the random. And I just need one more, and then we can get that random underway for you. Good luck, Daniel. Appreciate that. Both Daniels. Daniel H grabbing one in Ultra Premium. Make sure I get this right. Yeah, Daniel H Ultra Premium. Daniel W Tales of Aria. <laughs> you guys are trying to trick me. I swear. Both of them coming in at 649. You guys are trying to trick me. Good try. Not slipping past me. <laughs> That's actually hilarious. Literally the exact same time. <laughs> really funny stuff. Ooh, nice. Jacob, we're grabbing a Hidden Fates for later tonight as well. Thanks, man, and good luck on that. Stocked one more right before going live tonight. I think I have, like, two more. <laughs> we get those, and then they're just gone again. Thank you, everyone. Appreciate that. Sold out on that now. Unfortunately. I wish that was a product we could just, like, always have. <clears throat> appreciate that. Appreciate that. Sold out. Let's get it underway. Do, do, do. And then as you can see, sold out of the next two MetaZoo, two left on Tales of Aria, a little bit of work on the triple booster, but the spots are coming in there. And then four left on that full case later on tonight. 
looking forward to all these breaks that we got coming up some fun stuff here guys ultra premium and then yeah hopping over to some metazoo for a little bit and hopping back over to some flesh and blood and then back to the pokemans so should be a fun night guys and thank you again let's get the next random going ultra premium 21. how's it going everyone caleb here with Layton gaming doing the random for ultra premium number 21. good luck here uh, 10 spots let's do it uh there you go names roll that dice 10 times perfect and of course the energies after this good luck everyone one two three four five six seven eight nine ten got vincent s at the top jacob p at the bottom 10 on energy good luck here i uh, got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten got combo fairy metal pin coin and code at the top basic at the bottom all right one sec grab these and read them off what's up sizzle squad how you doing names energy all right cool guys and best of luck vincent s at the top combo at the top all right vincent s you're gonna have that combo fairy metal you're also gonna get the pin the coin and the code for the box joseph d with water Luis c fighting jacob p with dark uh Luis c trainer spot there you go Luis. you're gonna get that golden pokeball daniel h with psychic scott p fire energy congratulations scott very nice man that is gonna get you that metal charizard congrats man j manel congrats to you as well very nice hit man that's gonna be that pair of golden pikachu cards very sick Daniel H gonna have grass and Jacob P with basic. All right, let's get this one going, guys. Good luck. Let me just get the results onto the website, of course. And we will be breaking number 21 in just a minute. You can see there on the tonight sheet the remaining spots that we do have left for you tonight. Not a ton left. A little bit of work that we need to put into that triple booster sun and moon series remember it does feature burning shadows unified minds and ultra prism all of those boxes are um give or take about 400 dollars. give or take a little bit so some some awesome sets there chance at some huge hits All right, guys, those results are onto the website for you now. Appreciate that. Let's get the ultra premium underway. 6.55 start time. All right, I'll wait one minute. <laughs> There's some water. All right, good luck. Let's get this underway. I think we do, Josh. <laughs> I think we do. I could be incorrect about that. But I think we do. Believe it or not. Let's do this. Like one. How's it going, everyone? Caleb here with Layton Gaming. Next up, guys, got the Ultra Premium number 21. Of course, this is random energy style. Chasing after some of those promos and good stuff like that. As well as the hits from the packs. Here are the results from the random there good luck let's get it underway here everyone best of luck here ultra premium time um get that knife and get it going good luck okay josh sounds good i have to ask um rich about some more details about that one unfortunately that's not one i have like all the info on but yes i can ask about that for you I think Crucible is one of the boxes that we have a first out of. I think we have one Crucible and one Welcome to Rate, if I remember right. Uh, first out. Pokeball here. That goes out to the trainer spot, Luis. Congrats on your Pokeball. Gold card, of course. And then Electric, Jamin. You get the pair of Pikachus. Very nice. Pikachu V. Uh, but yeah, Josh, I can uh, have a chat with Rich and let you know. And then we can find a time to break that for you if you are interested. All right, a bunch of celebrations, of course. Got a golden medal, Pikachu. That is fantastic looking. There you go, Jamin. Of course, that's the base set design there. Base set, uh, yellow cheeks. And then we got the Charizard. Scott P, congrats, man. 
That is fantastic. You crushed it in the Ultra Premium. There you go, Scott. Nice Charizard. First one of the evening. Very nice. And there is the pin. This one here goes out to that uh, combo spot, Vincent. And we got the coin as well for you, Vincent. A few more packs on that last drawer. Going to be uh, three chilling, three vivid, two darkness ablaze. Uh, this here code will go out to that uh, spot for Vincent. Move the box quick, guys. Get this going. Put it on my stack of ultra premiums there. Good luck, let's do it. Started out with the celebrations tonight. Yeah, Josh, if I forget, you could just shoot me a DM as well on Discord. But I'll try to get back to you um, within the next couple days or so. Full art Pikachu. Potentially we could do that as soon as Monday if you really wanted. Um, if you wanted to wait a little bit longer, that's also all right. everyone let's find some sweet cards surfing pikachu vmax electric do, do, do. keep these going here guys bunch of celebrations then we'll hop to some sword and shields oh, i was gonna say there's something there don fan prime nice here you go fighting good card there I, was say, I knew there was something stuck Surfing Pikachu. There you go, Electric. Nice. Very solid hits. Metazoo up next tonight. Rocket Zapdos there. Electric. Crushing it. Jamin. Congrats. Electric, always a good one to land in the Ultra Premium. Always. And just two left now, everyone, on that Tales of Aria full case. Only two remaining. That is breaking later on tonight if you are interested in the flesh and blood tcg feel free to check the link i just dropped in the chat for you two remaining uh that breaks in about an hour or so so feel free to check out that link got flying pikachu v electric nice <clears throat> like i said only two left there tales of aria uh professor's research next celebrations here guys Clefa, there you go, basic. Reprints of that Clefa card there. Basic, type on that one. Keep these going. Got a Surfing Pikachu VMAX Electric. Ooh, a Blastoise now. Water, nice one. Blastoise is so awesome. There you go, water and surfing Pikachu. He literally has cannons on his on his uh, shell or his back. That's so crazy. <laughs> and surfing Pikachu is electric. Pretty nuts to think about something like that. Like, how can a Pokemon have cannons attached to him? <laughs> that seems it seems unfair. <clears throat> Keep going here. Ooh, Mewtwo EX. Very nice. And then you got Mewtwo. Mewtwo is like 80 feet tall. <laughs> there you go, Psychic. Very nice. Tough to hit that Mewtwo EX. Pikachu Full Art. Feels like every pack has had a hit so far. That's nice. None of those only hollow packs. Always fun to have a box like that. Wow! <laughs> Scott, you crushed it, man. Charizard Hollow. Boom. Wow. Scott, congratulations. You smashed it, man. You had the promo, of course, the metal Charizard. And now you got yourself that there Hollow Charizard. Congrats, Scott. A couple of the uh, OG reprints to add to your collection, man. That's awesome, Scott. You did really awesome on the break. Congrats, we'll get that one magged. That's awesome. Two of those um, reprint Charizards to add all in one break, Scott. Congratulations, man. Beautiful hits. It's been a good ultra premium. A lot of good hits. Mewtwo's tough to hit, Charizard. A lot of other hits in these celebrations. Dark Gyarados had a Blastoise earlier. Oop, and that was a Pikachu behind Dark Gyarados. 
for electric. Two on the celebrations left. It's been a good break, congrats. That's awesome, Scott. Flying Pikachu VMAX. Absolutely smash the Ultra Premium. Nice, Daniel. That'll work. Pikachu Full Art. Like I said, it's pretty tough to hit, Daniel. It's pretty tough to hit. All right, let's get to the Chilling Rain. Good luck here. A few Chilling Rain packs. Let's do this. Malamar, Obama Snow. Rugged Helmet and a Code Card. Another Chilling Rain. Graplox, Volcrona, Steeny. Another Chilling. Wow! Wow, fire! No way! Scott! Rainbow, Blaziken VMAX! Unbelievable break, Scott. Another big fire type hit. Congrats. That's crazy, Scott. There you go, man. Oh, yeah! <laughs> it can't even make that up. That's crazy. I don't know if I've ever hit this card from uh, Chilling Rain. Really tough hits. And Scott, there you go. Coming your way. Blaziken VMAX Rainbow. Unbelievable. You absolutely crushed it on the break, Scott. Congratulations again, man. I've never seen I've never seen someone crush an ultra premium that hard. That is crazy. There you go, man. Wow. Executor, Lycan Rock. We're into the vivid voltage now. Good luck. Electric is excited for these. Come on, Jamin. See that beautiful full art of that beautiful rainbow. Good luck. Got Leon and Mudsdale. And one more Vivid and then a couple of Darkness. What could possibly be in those Darkness Ablaze? Oh, well first we got a Galarian Dark Manitan V. There you go, Water. Two Darkness, good luck here. What could these possibly have inside? Wow, <laughs> what is going on? This Ultra Premium has been nuts! Rainbow! Eternatus VMAX! Dark type! I think that was Jacob. Oh my goodness. This has been a crazy Ultra Premium, guys. Congrats, Dark. Holy cow, we're just gonna get every secret rare? This is nuts. Congratulations, there you go. It's our flying out of this Ultra Premium. Number 21. Good one. And the last pack. Could it have anything else nuts? Carnivine and a Mimikyu. Awesome break, guys. Congrats again if you did do well in that one. Uh, we'll get those all protected and sent right out to you. That was unbelievable. <laughs> wow. I've never seen an Ultra Premium have that many hits. In terms of, like, big rainbows, in terms of stuff like that. Usually you just don't see them like that. It's just not how the Ultra Premiums are. You get those promos and stuff like that. But man, oh man, that was a good one. All right, let's be moving on to the next one now. Jeez, I can't believe it. <laughs> Number 21, one to remember. Yeah, no kidding, Ryan. No kidding. Wow. Of course we had the promos in the box. That's already where the fun begins. Um, and the fun was not ending until we got to pretty much the last pack there. Craziness, guys. Couple of MetaZoo breaks up next now tonight. Couple of MetaZoo breaks. Awesome. And if you are interested, guys, in some of these upcoming breaks tonight, I'm going to drop you a link right now to the break schedule. You can see there we've got just a couple left here tonight. So we've got two left on the Tales of Arya. That's a full case. Four booster box full case um, of Tales of Arya Unlimited. Two left. That's only 50 bucks a spot. Uh, then we got the Triple Booster, Sun and Moon Series 3. Uh, that's a three booster box break that features Ultra Prism, Unified Minds, and Burning Shadows. 
Really fun one later on tonight. A bunch more Sun and Moon packs, guys. Can't wait for those. And then we got a full case of Evolving to end out the number, or end out the night with lucky number seven. Ultra Premium Break, full case, or uh, Evolving full case, number seven. Lucky number seven. So I did just drop the link to the break schedule. You can purchase all the slots there. That was something. That was truly something. <laughs> Congratulations again if you did well there. Scott, that was, that was something. Got the Cryptid Nation box. MetaZoo breaks next. Uh, Nightfall will be right after Cryptid Nation. Cryptid Nation first. Speaking of Cryptid Nation first, we're hoping to have some more Cryptid Nation first within a week or two. What's up, Hax? What's going on, man? How you doing? Get this random setup, guys. Typing would be helpful. There we go. What are we on here? Number nine on the Cryptid Nation. We get it underway in just a minute. Oh, nice, man. You'll have to tell me what it is. You'll have to tell me what it is. I saw a couple of your posts earlier today as well. I didn't really have a time uh, time to deeply dive into them. Ooh, anything gold star is crazy. Anything gold star is crazy, man. Congrats on that. That's awesome. That's sick. If you're looking to move some of those golden Snorlaxes, if any of them are, like, really, really minty, let me know. Like, I want one that could gem. Otherwise, I'll probably just end up buying a gem. But I didn't really give it a good look. I saw you posted, like, a lot, a lot of stuff. So I'll give it all a better look later on. Yeah, sounds good, Hex. Sounds good. <laughs> yeah, Ryan, we should be getting some more. I just don't know the exact date yet. It takes a little bit of time usually um, for us to get some more after we do run out. But, yep. Nice. Sounds good, Hex. Sounds good, man. Sweet. Appreciate that as always. All right, let's do this, guys. I'll do that next random quick. Um, and then I'm going to go fill up on water and we'll keep going tonight. But let me do that next random here first. Good luck, your Cryptid Nation second ed. Uh, like I said, this year is going to be number nine. Get this underway. Box topper random to start. How's it going, everyone? Caleb here with Layton Gaming. Going to be doing that random for Cryptid Nation second ed booster box break number nine. This is the random pack style, four packs per spot. Good luck. So we got the nine names here. We're going to start it out with the box topper random here tonight. Good luck, Cryptid Nation second ed number nine. So uh, roll the dice quick. Got ourselves a seven, so we're gonna do um, seven times on the random. The name at the top wins the box topper. I will rip that at the end of the box for you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I uh, got Anthony D at the top, Luis C at the bottom. All right, all right. Um, so Anthony D, congrats. You got the box topper. Forgot that was the box topper, there you go. Anthony, congrats. Let's hop over to the names now, and then we will do the names and the order. Good luck here. Roll the dice for these two. Going to be 10 on the names and then 10 on the order. Good luck here. I will read those all off to you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Luis C at the top, Jamin L at the bottom. 10 on the order. And then, like I said, Anthony, congrats on that box topper. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Got three at the top, eight at the bottom. All right, let me grab these, read them off. Names, order. Perfect, guys. That's the last one. Delete that quick for you. And here we go. Luis C. Three. Perfect. Sort this quick. Dontre M should be first, it looks like. Sort this for you guys quick. 
Perfect, Dontre. I'm gonna get it going. First four for you. Daniel W, next set. Luis C, uh, third set there. Anthony D, four. Daniel H, five. Luis C, six and seven. Jamin L, eight. And Dontre M, nine. And then it was Anthony D on that box topper. Uh, congrats, everyone. Appreciate it as always. We will get right into the break. Good stuff, guys. Thank you again and appreciate it. Get those results onto the website for you quick. Uh, number nine, pack style. And Anthony, like I said, congrats on the box topper. Good luck, everyone, here on the break. I'll get it going in three minutes as scheduled. Let me fill up on water quick. Uh, if you are interested in some flesh and blood, just two spots left on that full case later on tonight. Full case break of flesh and blood, Tales of Arya Unlimited. Later on tonight, just two spots left. If you are interested, feel free to check out the link I just dropped in the description for you. I'll be right back, guys, and we'll get it underway for you. All right, everyone, good luck on Crypto Nation 2nd Edition here. Appreciate it, everyone. Let's get it underway for you. Good luck, on. <clears throat> How's it going, everyone? Caleb here with Layton Gaming. Next break of the night is going to be a Crypto Nation 2nd Edition booster box. This is break number nine. Pack style, of course. Just did that random for you. There are your results. You can see uh, the order there that I will be ripping your packs in. Remember, you get four packs per spot. And you can see on the bottom, Anthony D was the box topper winner. All right, good luck. Let's get this box underway. Crypto Nation 2nd Edition. Let's do this. <clears throat> really? The new knife plate even? Really? I thought for sure. <laughs> All right, Anthony D, there you go. I will probably just leave these in here, honestly. It seems easier that way than taking it out. Get that seal off. That's going to annoy me. <laughs> All right, there we go. First four, Dontre. Good luck, Dontre. Let's do it, man. Best of luck. Pull up that result sheet. Funny, man. Nice reverse hollow to get it going. 
There you go, man. Funny man. Solid start. Don Shrek. Yeah, congrats on that, Anthony. Congrats. Sinkhole Sam. Full hollow. Very nice. Congrats on that. Sinkhole Sam there. Very solid. So it looks like the 49ers are, are going to take the win. Looks like they got the win. Jersey Devil full. Congrats. Heating up. There you go, man. Nice, Dontre. Great stuff. East of Busco, Reverse Hollow. All right, that does it for Dontre. Uh, next up is going to be Dan. Dan, one, two, three, four. Good luck, Dan. Next four here. Beast of Busco, nice start, Dan. Full hollow. Congrats on the turtle. Nice one. Let me write out a real quick one through nine as well. They are slowly coming back. I know they are. Big jammer. But I, I don't know, man. I saw that they just had gotten within a touchdown. I just, I don't know. But yeah, I, I know Lane is at the game. He's probably thinking that. He's probably excited right now, thinking his team's got some life. So we'll see. We'll see. We're getting to the meat and bones, that's for sure. Getting into it. Giant Salamander reverse, Dan. Snallygaster reverse. And one more. Luis up next. Fresno Nightcrawlers, nice space pants. Reverse hollow. All right, Dan, that does it. Luis, next bundle. Good luck, man. He's going one, two, and three, four. Let's do it, Luis. <clears throat> Chupacabra full. Nice one. Bunny man reverse. Not bad. Definitely take a nice reverse bunny man. Gigi bird reverse hollow. And a ghost deer reverse hollow. All right, that closes it out. Luis for your first one there. Anthony D, the next four. Good luck, Anthony. One, two, three, and four. Perfect. Let's do it, Anthony D. Box topper will rip at the end. <clears throat> that's true, Sean. There's more time than I think. Yeah, that's true. Chessy full. Nice start. There you go. Congrats, Anthony. There is plenty of time. Piazza bird pack. Good luck on it. Nice start. Got a Tizarok full. There you go. Another cool card there. Congrats, Tizarok full. Yo, what's up, Mike? What's up? How you doing tonight? Watching some football, probably. Wow, Mermaid Scales full. You're crushing it, Anthony. Three for three on the fulls. And the last pack, Anthony. Slide Rock Bolter. Nice full hollow. Congrats. There you go. Nice, man. Four for four. I do not, Mike. I do not. I bet it's decent, though. I bet it's decent. I know TCG Player, the prices are starting to be established. They're starting to be established. Got four here. Perfect. Good luck. This is going to be Daniel H. Fifth uh, set here. Good luck, Daniel. Got a Beast of Busco Reverse. I would assume that pays for the pack, Mike, whatever you spent on the pack, given it wasn't like a billion dollars. <laughs> I would assume that definitely pays for the pack. Joint Snake Reverse. That's a pretty sweet card. I like that one, though, Mike. Hey, no problem, Anthony. Piazza Bird Reverse. Nice. Anytime you can really get a full hollow instead of a reverse, you're pretty happy. Uh, but then, yeah, I would say that growth is in that upper tier. Growth had a lot of love in uh, first head. Mermaid scales reverse on the back. All right, there you go. That was number five, Daniel H. Luis C, number six. 
Good luck, Luis. Another set here. One, two, three, four. Good luck, guys. Luis coming up now. Keep going through the box. Dave the Blue Ox. Nice, Luis. Congrats on your full. Very nice. Love this card. Congrats on that one. There you go, man. Great start. Got a Funeral Mountain Reverse. <clears throat> Space Penguins. Reverse Hollow. Nice. Not one we see too often. And a Mermaid Scales. Reverse Hollow. There you go, Luis. All right. Number seven also going to be Luis. Good luck, Luis. Number seven as well for you. Let's do it, man. Best of luck and appreciate it, Luis. One, two, three, four. Let's do it. Babe the Blue Ox. Reverse solo. Very nice. Seeing some more spots coming in as well, guys. Thank you. Appreciate that. I'm looking forward to these breaks we've got coming up tonight. Some really fun stuff coming up this evening, guys. Really fun. Ooh, Walking Sam reverse. Nice. I like the Walking Sam in reverse. Nice little shiny skeleton, man. Really cool there. Luis. <clears throat> Hoop Snake. Nice. Just literally a circle. <laughs> shiny circle. And wow, nice ending, Luis. Uncle Sam full. Congrats. I love this card. Very nice. Luis, I wish I knew what he was like riding on though. I don't know what that is. What is he riding on? Someone probably knows. <laughs> there you go, Luis, number seven. All right, coming up next, number eight. Got Jamin. Good luck, Jamin. Jamin's been loving MetaZoo. I know he has been absolutely loving it. Good amount of MetaZoo coming in for, I think it's a snail. I think so, yeah. Eternal Snowflake Reverse. It looked like a snail. I just didn't know if there was like, um, like a reason behind that. Like, is there a reason he's riding on the snail? I guess I should have phrased that a little bit differently. Walking Sam reverse. Is that, um, <clears throat> is that something, you know, that is like, uh, one of those political cartoon jokes or whatever. Lake Worth monster reverse. Yeah, since it's Obnoxious 9, makes sense, Edwin, makes sense. Ah, I guess, I guess, present. Yeah, I guess. Slide Rock Bolts are reverse. I, I, yeah, I, I figure there's something, though. There you go, Jamin, that closes it out. Dontre. I know, I said it. I said it, Anthony. That's all it took was me to start hating on the Cowboys. And now they're, they're clicking all of a sudden. <laughs> all right, good luck here. Dontre. Closing out the box, and then Anthony with the box top. Chaos Crystal, nice one. Very nice. But yeah, Mike, anytime you can get any of those um, obnoxious nine cards, they're really solid, Mike. There's nine of them, of course. And if you're confused on what the obnoxious nine is, uh, it's, it's pretty simple, actually. It's just a card that's only in full hollow that should be in reverse, based on, like, what they print in reverse hollow. It should be in reverse. Um, but with the design of the card, there's nothing that they could make for the foil in reverse. Uh, so for that reason, it's only Bigfoot. Nice. Reverse. For that reason, it's only in full. And then it's considered an obnoxious nine card. So it's kind of cool. And they usually have a little premium uh, compared to the other hollows. And then same with Nightfall. They have that as well. It's called Unlucky 13. And there's once again, 13 cards that are only in full hollow that should be in reverse based on like how they print and set rules. Uh, but it is only in full. So there you go. Growth. Full hollow. <laughs> Perfect. I needed one to talk about it more. So here you go. So what would they really make reverse? I guess you could argue like the plant. Uh, but yeah, it wouldn't look that nice, that clean. Uh, so for that reason, they keep it only in full hollow. So there you go. Dantre. Speaking of the devil. Growth. And the last pack. Uh, but there's going to be nine of those total. Ghost Train is another one I can remember right off the top of my head. Wow, and a Bigfoot full. That felt really nice at the end, Dontre. Congrats on those. 
That felt really nice at the end, man. Awesome hits, Dontre. Box stopper. Let's do it. Anthony D on the box topper. Good luck, man. I think it's called Unlucky 13, Dan. I think it's called Unlucky 13. I could be incorrect. I believe that's what it's called. <clears throat> Ooh, meteor shower. There you go, Anthony. Got a meteor shower for you. Very cool. Thank you again. Uh, appreciate it, everyone. We'll get those all protected and sent right out to you guys. Thanks for joining. That was Cryptid Nation, uh, second edition booster number nine. Very cool. All right, so that was number nine. This is Anthony D. Uh, Anthony D had the fourth spot. It doesn't surprise me that some are below that, Edwin. It doesn't surprise me that some are below that, honestly. Just because with MetaZoo, sometimes we do see that whitening and stuff on the cards, to be honest. We do see that, so it doesn't surprise me too much. All right, guys, let me update the Tonight Sheet. I saw a couple of different orders come in here. A couple of orders for later, nice. Sweet. Bunch of orders just came in. So we're at one left now, guys. Tales of Arya. That breaks next, actually. We did just complete that one. Um, so we're at that. And complete now. One left now on that one, Tales of Arya. We are at five left on that Sun and Moon. And we are at three left on that full case. Awesome. So that um, next break, Tales of Arya Unlimited with some spots. One left there. That breaks in about 25 minutes, guys. If you are interested, I can grab you the link for that one right now. Full case of Tales of Arya. That'll be the first link in the chat here. Um, and then the second link I'm going to drop, guys, is a Pokemon group break. If you're looking for Pokemon's Sun and Moon series, uh, booster box right here. That three booster box break. That is the second link in the chat. Five left on that. Some spots are coming in for it. Ultra Prism, Burning Shadows, and Unified Minds. Check out the uh, boxes. Check out the combos with the second link for that Pokemon break. Like I said, if you're interested in that last Tales of Aria spot, top link. Last Tales of Aria spot is gone. Sean grabbed it. Thank you, Sean. Gonzo there. Sold out. So just those two remaining at the end of the night. Pokemans only. <clears throat> I'm only calling it Pokemon now. <laughs> Dislike if you want. Uh, just kidding. That would be, that'd be a little bit ridiculous. Yeah, me too, Edwin, me too. I wouldn't, I couldn't care less. Same, same. It could be, it could be folded in half. No, that would be disappointing, but <laughs> even if it was, that would be even crazier, but yeah. No, if, even if it came back like PSA 6 or something. Yeah, it would be just crazy to have the opportunity to actually see one come out of a pack that we opened. Exactly. Nightfall. Nightfall number eight. Number eight on the nightfall. Good luck. Here's our chance. <laughs> Here is our chance, guys. Names and pack order. Sweet. all typed in and good luck on it guys nightfall <clears throat> and I do appreciate that tales of Arya just selling out thank you very much for that guys good luck on that I'm gonna type that one in really quick and we'll get to the next random tonight Sean L David G of you, Jimmy C. Now H. Louis C. Josh H. Cool. All 
All right, good luck on the random here, everyone. Appreciate it as always. How's it going, everyone? Caleb here with Leighton Gaming. Going to be doing the random, guys, for Nightfall Booster Box break number eight. Good luck. Remember, this is that pack style break uh, where you get four packs per slot. And then also remember, Nightfall does not have um, the box topper, of course. Just one sec right now, the one through nine uh, for the packs. And let's get into it. There's your spots, nine of them. Here we go. Let me roll the dice, guys. Five. We'll do the names five times, and then we will do the order five times. Match those up. Let you know what you got. Good luck. One, two, three, four, five. Got Matt S at the top, Daniel W at the bottom. Five. Pack order here. One, two, three, four, five. Got seven at the top, nine at the bottom. Okay, one sec, I'll match those up, sort them, let you know what you have. Matt S, seven, perfect. And sort quick, do, do, do. column B. Sweet, Louis C, gonna have one and two. Ryan K, you're gonna have three. Uh, Jamin L, four. Uh, Ryan K, five. Fifth set, of course. Louis C with the sixth set. Matt S, seven. Daniel H, eight. And Daniel W, nine. All right, good luck. Let's get this one underway here. In just about two or three minutes, we can get this one going, guys. Gotta get the results posted and stuff like that. Box break eight pack style. There we go. All right, guys, that order is on the website for you. It looks like it, Sean. It looks like it. Um, Lane has been really silent in our group chat. He's at the game right now, he's a huge Cowboys fan. He's been really silent, so he's probably getting a little bit worried. <clears throat> Although he said, um, he said at halftime that the guy in front of him who was throwing his uh, his chicken tenders onto the field, I said, "Wow, that's got to be ex that's expensive, man. <laughs> that's expensive. Chicken tenders at a football game? That's like fifteen dollars. I don't think I'd be throwing those on the field. That's pretty dang expensive." What's up, Sizzle? That would be <laughs> would be pretty bold. <clears throat> not uh, not for me, <laughs> not for me. All right, and then up after this, guys, we've got that nightfall, and then we got that triple booster sun and moon series. Check that one out right here, guys, with this link I just dropped in the chat. Sun and moon series booster box break that has burning shadows, unified minds, and ultra prism. <clears throat> that one breaks in about an hour or so. So feel free to check that link out that I just dropped in chat for you. Yeah, I'm sorry, Sean. I did it to you. I did it. That'll happen. Good luck on this one, guys. Nightfall time. Nightfall time. <laughs> How's it going, everyone? Caleb here with Leighton Gaming. This time, guys, going to be doing that Nightfall booster box break. This is a first edition, of course. And of course, it is random pack style. So you get four packs per slot. Here are your uh, results. This is break number eight. Break number eight, four packs per slot. Good luck, let's get this underway. <clears throat> and appreciate it as always, everyone uh, who did hop in. Let's get this box going. All right, good luck. <clears throat> Luis C starting out, bundle one. Old Scratch hunting. And I'd like to see a nice Mothman full tonight. A couple of them. Try to pull one of those error ones, maybe. All right, Luis, four of them. Good luck, man. Get this underway here tonight. No way, guys. Oh, man. Oh. Unbelievable. So, this is a god pack here, guys. This here would be a god pack. It has been months since we've pulled a god pack uh, from Nightfall. 
Oh man, Old Scratch is in 10 God Packs. Old Scratch is in 10 God Packs. Oh my goodness. Whoo! Whoo! The adrenaline is going nuts. <laughs> so there are 100 Old Scratch cards in existence. 100 in existence. Um, it's said and it's rumored to be that Old Scratch, 10 of his 100 are in God Packs. Oh man, Luis, let's get this going, man. God Pack time to start out the box. Pack number one, Luis. Holy cow. <laughs> Good luck, Luis. Oh man. Got a Luffer Lang, Murphy Bro, Mud Monster, Lightning Alley. All right, into some foals now. Momo. Werewolf of Defiance Reverse. Wow, Mothman full. Boom. Let's go. Luis. Full Mothman. Turtle Bottoms Monster Reverse. Veggie Man. Wendigo full. Boom. Wow. Luis. Twin Meteor. Full. Thunderbird. Obsidian Obelisk. Full hollow. Holy cow. The adrenaline was going right there. Oh my goodness. Luis. That's incredible, man. Ho ho ho. Wendigo. Full. And a Mothman. To start out the box. Holy cow. The heart rate was pumping there for a second, man. Unbelievable. That's still an incredible pack. A hundred dollar plus pack there. Easily. Um, all right. Let me know if this Mothman has the error. I'm not good at identifying this. I don't think so, though. I don't think so. Wow. What a start, though. Holy cow. Let me get all these sleeved up. I know, Dan. I've heard that as well. That's why my hands are a bit shaky right now. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I heard that as well in the past. I've he also heard what Dan just said. Um, could also be a God Pack can, that can contain Old Scratch. Like, if you have a God Pack in the box, Old Scratch could be somewhere else. Hiding. Holy cow, we'll get those last two mag, Luis. Oh, man. <laughs> First pack. Oh, man. Congrats. Luis. And then a couple more reverses at the start. Dude, that upside down card at the back of the pack... I think my heart rate went up like over like a hundred. <laughs> Honestly. Holy cow. All right, let's keep going, guys. Good luck. This could be a nuts box. Come on. Let's make it happen tonight. Momo reverse. <clears throat> let's make it happen. Could it be the night, man? And he finally comes out for us. Stalactus reverse. Grim Reaper. Nice reverse. There you go. Closing out bundle one, Luis. Wow. What a start, man. <laughs> there you go, Luis. That was number one, believe it or not. Number two, Luis. Well, this should be fun. I bet everyone else is excited. That's got some packs in this box coming up. That you guys are uh, pretty hyped up right now. Twin Meteor. That's a full hollow. There you go. Number two is Luis as well. This is, uh, this is quite the rush. Oh, man. Let's make something crazy happen in the box, guys. Come on. Napa Rebounds Reverse. Permafrost Reverse. Also not looking great for the Cowboys. Side note. Last one here, Luis. Ocean Cellar full. Nice. Back to some fulls now. Good to see. Good to see. Back to some fulls. Very nice. <laughs> yeah, Ryan. It's it's kind of... After pulling a God Pack, that's the thing. There's There's been rumors that if you have a God Pack, you could potentially have an old scratch seated in the box as well. So it's, it's crazy. And then you can also have... Um, Ryan, good luck. Here you are. Three. Uh, I might have missed it. Yeah, let me check it out. Let me check it out. Thank you, Sean. Appreciate that. Uh, yeah, no problem. No problem, uh, Jamal. It's going to be probably about right after the personal start tonight, about 11 p.m. Eastern, Jamal. About 11 p.m. Eastern. 
What's up, Darth? Got a Murphy Bro Mud Monster Reverse Hollow. Thank you, Sean. Appreciate that. Missed it in that pandemonium. Got a Thunderbird full. There you go. Nice Thunderbird. Congrats on that, Ryan. Next pack here, man. <clears throat> Kinderhook Blob Reverse. The Mini Snorlax. I'll keep these going here. Last one, Ryan. One Reverse. Nice. All right, all right, Jamin. Four. Good luck. One, two, three. Four. Just the opportunity to pull a God Pack, man. It's been so long. It's legitimately been months since pulling a God Pack. Legitimately months. Uh, banana, or Tahamin Reverse, excuse me. Not Banana Man. There you go, Jamin. Start it out. Got Headless Nun, Reverse Hollow. Sleep for that one, Jamin. Lightning Alley, Full Hollow. So no need to worry, Jamal. No need to worry. Uh, every single break that we do, Jamal, we record every single break. They all get uploaded to the YouTube channel, Layton Gaming. Uh, Layton Gaming on YouTube. All of the breaks still get uploaded to YouTube. So yeah, feel free to check it out when you wake up. It'll be first thing when you wake up tomorrow morning. It will be on the YouTube channel. Every single break we do does get uploaded. Layton Gaming on YouTube. Thank you. Sean just dropped that link. Werewolf of Defiance. Reverse Hollow. All right, there you go, Jamin. Ryan. Got you up again here, number five. Good luck, Ryan. One, two, three, four. And appreciate the order, Jamal. Thank you, man. Good luck, Ryan. Got a beast of Blade and Bro reverse. <clears throat> Few fold it. Reverse hollow. Let's get back over to those fulls now. Ooh, that's a good reverse. We'll take that. Mothman reverse. Congrats. Very nice. Very nice, Ryan. There you go, man. Great card. Reverse Mothman. And your last pack. Back to Luis after this. With Devil of Cool Country. Reverse hollow. All right. Closing it out there, Ryan. Thank you again, Ryan. Luis up next tonight. Three, four, good luck. <clears throat> Red Ghost, very nice full hollow. Congrats there on that one. Good start there. On the six, Luis. Got a Grafton Monster. Reverse Hollow. Hey, my pleasure, Ryan. My pleasure. Thanks for hanging out with us, man. Napa Rebobs. Reverse Hollow. All right, Box. Come back to life a little bit. We need some fulls. We need some fulls here as we get to the end. Looking for one full in specific. Obsidian. Reverse. All right, Luis, that closes it out. That was a kind of a cold one there, but you did have the God Pack earlier, so not too many complaints. All right, Matt, good luck. Uh, it's not the last one, Ryan. We're going to have more group breaks, but there's not going to be more personals till tomorrow. And we had a God Pack to start this box, Ryan. The first time in months that we've had a God Pack. There'll be more personals available tomorrow night. Check around 545. Um, for some personals of it. And there will also be group breaks listed for Wednesday featuring Nightfall. Uh, there will not be any Nightfall stock tonight, though. Old Book's Crying Tree Reverse. Nice. Matt. Daniel H. up next. After Matt. Axe Handle Hound Reverse. Napper Bob's reverse solo. That's that's hilarious, Ryan.
That's hilarious. <laughs> That's how it happens sometimes, though. Red Ghost. There we go. Full. Nice. Grabbed a full at the end for you, Matt. Congrats on the Red Ghost. Nice, man. That was number seven. Daniel H. Number eight. Yeah, they took care of business at the end, Sean. I didn't jinx them. I thought I might have, but I did not. <laughs> All right. Good luck, Daniel H. Jack Frost. Reverse hollow. And Daniel W. to close out the box here, guys. Good luck. Red Ghost. Reverse hollow, Daniel. So many red ghosts. What the heck? Ah, nice, Ryan. Nice. Wallow Lake Crustacean Reverse. Um, I'm not sure if we're going to have that amount to supply that many shipments for about one to two weeks but then we might after that again <clears throat> actually it's likely we will after that last one daniel h headless horseman nice reverse man congrats daniel h nice one at the end headless horseman all right dan closing it out what can we do with the last four packs? Good luck, Dan. Let's do it, man. Empty box. The God Pack box. Oh, big hitter at the end for Dan. Let's see it, guys. The candles are around. Lightning split full. Here we go. Red Ghost. Reverse hollow. So many red ghosts. I'm feeling good about the last pack, man. Not sure why. First and last, I'm hoping. Momo! All right, Momo, what can you bring us at the end? Hoping for that first and last pack magic. Good luck, Dan. Let's close it out, man. Something huge. Got an Alaskan Vortex full. No old scratch in the box, but we had a god pack again, guys. That's nuts, man. I can't believe it. I almost forgot MetaZoo god packs even existed. It's literally been probably two months since we hit our last one, and we've been steadily opening MetaZoo. So congrats again, Luis. That was quite the way to start out the box. Um, there was a Mothman in the bundle, and there was, um, or the pack, and like I said, there was a... Uh, Wendigo also there. That was incredibly fun, guys. Thank you again. Appreciate it. We'll get those all right out to you. The rest of the box had a lot of reverses, unfortunately, but man, man, was it so hot at the start. Can't complain too much. Congrats again, Luis. That was sweet. That was sweet. All right, guys. On to Tales of Aria next. Yeah, exactly, Ryan. That single pack right there. Exactly, you said it. You said it, my man. That's exactly what I said. $100 plus pack, I would say. Just with the Mothman and the Wendigo. The other's not anything too crazy, but those two will get you there. Confidently. So nice, man. I, I can't believe it. It's been a little bit since we saw one. They have returned. They're back. It's also like the first box out of that case, so... Interesting. Hope for more good things to come. Alright, guys. Five left on that Sun and Moon. Three left on that full case. Got the Tales of Aria full case up now. If you're interested in that triple booster, Sun and Moon, check out the link I just dropped in chat. Five remaining there, guys. Let's get that one sold out. It does break next tonight. Ultra Prism, Burning Shadows, and Unified Minds. Feel free to check the link that I had just dropped in the chat. The second link there in chat is uh, Sean's link. That is going to be the TCG player set list for Flesh and Blood. And I'm going to get that random set up for the full case. Tales of Aria. What are we on here? Number, uh... 
Number three, full case. Sweet, guys. So you can see it there. We've got that Evolving Skies full case. Three left. And we've got that triple booster. Sun and Moon boosters. Burning Unified Ultra Prism. Five left there. Let's get those last two breaks sold out. Congrats again to Luis on the God Pack. That was incredible stuff. It's been a minute, man. I thought, I thought our days of God Packs in Nightfall were over. I thought they were all but beyond us. We have found them again. <laughs> 755, all right, let me get the random going. Good luck here. How's it going, everyone? Caleb here with Leighton Gaming. Got that full case of Tales of Aria coming up now. Unlimited, let me do the random for you. Number three, full case. Here we go, seven spots, good luck. Uh, four here on the names and then four on the classes. Best of luck, everyone. One, two, three, four. Got Josh H at the top, Daniel W at the bottom. Four on classes, not names, classes. <laughs> there we go. Good luck here. Got one, two, three, four. Got Elemental at the top, Rune Blade at the bottom. Okay, match these up. I missed a big play, it sounds like. There you go, Josh H. Elemental. All right, Josh H. Elemental. Jimmy C. Gonna have Guardian. Daniel H. with Earth. Uh, Sean L. Lightning and Generic. Louis C. Ranger. David G. with Ice. Daniel W. with Rune Blade. Good luck. Let's get this one underway, everyone. Best of luck here. Appreciate you guys for hopping in the full case of Tales of Aria. Good luck on it. Yeah, Flesh and Blood is pretty sweet. It is pretty sweet. You'll get to watch a full case of it here, so get a good uh, good idea of how much you like it. <laughs> All right, guys, those results are on the website. And best of luck here on this one. We'll get it going in one minute. One minute. And like I said, just two breaks left tonight with some spots. Next break tonight is going to be that triple booster. Unified Ultra Prism. Burning Shadows. Let's get that one sold out, guys. I'd appreciate that. Breaking that one next tonight here in about uh, 45 minutes or so. About 45 minutes. Do that. Nice, do that, do that. All right, best of luck. Ready to start this full case. Should be a good time. Let me get another pack of sleeves before we get too far. Find some legendaries. Maybe that big fabled card. I would be down. How's it going, everyone? Caleb here with Leighton Gaming. Got our next break of the night. Gonna be a Tales of Aria. Um, unlimited case. Good luck here, guys. Tales of Aria Unlimited. This is case number three. And here are your results. Just did the random for you. Uh, we don't really have any great way to get stuff like that, Ryan unfortunately it would be fun but yeah there's no way we can really get anything like that <clears throat> get the case opened up i missed it there we go yeah there we go got it and get it on the top of course it's four booster boxes in the case here four of them I would love to rip those though, Ryan, just because they're like so cool. But 
Yeah, unfortunately, no way for us to really land stuff like that. A couple of Tales of Aria Unlimited, guys, and a couple more. Four total. Good luck here on the break. Get this one underway. <clears throat> Got the extra sharp knife out tonight. Extra sharp. Let's get this going. Stack there. Stack there. And empty. Yeah, fair enough, Ryan. Fair enough. Yeah, there's certain, like, promos that MetaZoom does and stuff like that that uh, that stuff just does, like, not get really offered to hobby shops in any way at all. <clears throat> it's just direct-to-consumer pretty much all of it. But yeah, I appreciate it, Ryan. Got a Buzz Bolt foil common. But yeah, I hear you. I wish we could have them just because they are um, fantastic, fantastic um, things to have. Like, they're really cool. I like that you get the promo card with it as well. And the pins actually look really nice. I think a lot of people are into the design of the beasties and stuff like that. So people definitely go for that stuff. Turn Timber. Rites of Lightning. That's a foil rare for Elemental. Nice. Briar token at the back. Supposed to grow. Force of Nature. Nice Majestic. There you go, Elemental. Very nice. And a Shock Striker. Foil Common. Good start. Elemental with a Force of Nature. Good stuff. Congrats on that. Got a Foil Common Rejuvenate. There you go, Elemental. Uh, foil rare, elemental, cold wave. There you go, elemental. I know, Jacob, for real. <laughs> I didn't either. I didn't either, man. But yeah, thanks, man. I was happy to see it. Rights of replenishment, foil common. It's literally been multiple months, Jacob. Legitimately been multiple months. <laughs> yeah, you said it, Sean. That was not great to see there. Not the best ending at all. Lightning Press, Foil Rare, Lightning Slot, Embodiment of Lightning. They could have done a little bit better there at the end, I think, Sean. That was not the play. Light it up. There you go, Elemental. Majestic. Autumn's Touch, Foil Common. Nice. Big Pokemon break up next tonight, guys. Got that triple booster. Sun and Moon series. If you are interested, feel free to check the link I just dropped in the description or the uh, chat there. We'll be moving on to that one next tonight. Check that link that I just dropped in the chat for your uh, spots for the next break. Foil Common Arcanic Shockwave. Definitely not one that we get to do too often. Those uh, Sun and Moon triples don't have a ton of those boxes around. So if it is one that you're interested in, check the link I just dropped in the chat for you. Uh, purchase your spots right there. Ooh, Foil Majestic Winter's Whale. Nice one. Congrats, Elemental. I think it was hilarious, says Mike. <laughs> Very nice. Yeah, same, Sean. Me too. But I hear you. You just like to see, like, you know, a better ending, for sure. To put it, to put it simply. Got the rare cold wave and pulse of candle hold. There you go, Earth. Very nice. Let me check that majestic. Was there uh Yes, exactly. I thought so. So this one's gonna be a random between Elemental and Guardian at the end. Thought so. Foil common break ground. Look at that at the end, guys. Right, like I said, between Elemental and Guardian. You can see there the two slots on the foil majestic. Get that at the end for you. That random going. Uh, turn Timber and Foil Common out tomorrow. Earth Slots. That's gonna, yeah, that's gonna be bad. That's gonna be bad, Dan. <laughs> Terra Sunder, Majestic, Guardian. That's gonna be really bad. Entwine Ice, Foil Common. I didn't fully see that part. 
That's gonna be really bad. <laughs> really bad. Oh no. The ref decided the game. Oh man. Channel Thunder Steep Majestic. Lightning. Foil Majestic. Two in the box. Congrats, Lightning. There you go. Nice card there. Yeah, that as well, Sean, didn't make a lot of sense. That as well. So you can't really, like, fully blame them. But at the same time, the ref has, has his job, you know? <laughs> He's got his job to do. Got a foil rare ice quake. Yeah, exactly. You got to get out of bounds there. You do have to. Couple there for lightning, rares, foil common, elemental. You're hoping Kansas City wins, Mike. I'd be pretty surprised if Pittsburgh took the win. I didn't like, I liked Pittsburgh going into the playoffs. I do not like their first round matchup. Got foil rare, evergreen. Their first round matchup is just pretty dang brutal, unfortunately. So like I said, I liked them going into it, but now it's uh, not the best for them. Got Snapshot and got Entwiner, Foil Common. Keep these Tales of Arya going, guys. Looking for a big Legendary for you. Foil Common Rejuvenate, Elemental Slot. Fighting Gale, Channel Lake Frigid, nice. Majestic, there you go, Ice. Ice slot there on that Majestic. Couple of rares and chill to the bone, foil common, Ice. Hero at the back, or a token I should say. Ash Freeze Majestic, that's Elemental. Nice one. Invigorate Foil Common. There you go. Cool Flash Freeze card. There you go, Elemental. Fighting Gale and Burgeoning Foil Common for Earth. There's one left in this box. Flash, Inspire Lightning, Foil Common. Let's get on to the next one, guys. Good luck. I'm not sure if anyone had the chance to um, watch that video that um, Alpha Investments put out yesterday, Rudy, about the Logan Paul situation. It's a pretty dang good video, though. Uh, one of his biggest like talking points in the video was basically that you shouldn't really let people um do a job that they're not equipped to do and yeah i feel like that's something that most people probably already agreed with before this but it's an essential reminder sometimes and then another one of his uh pretty big talking points as well was that if it seems too good to be true it's probably too good to be true uh, also another thing that is, I think is always important to remember, especially in like a hobby like this. Uh, explosive growth for elemental. But there was a lot of other talking points in the video besides just that. But those were a couple of the things that he kept hammering down. And yeah, if you guys haven't got the opportunity to watch it yet, it's it's a pretty good one. You might want to check it out sometime uh, after the stream or whatever. Exposed to the elements, majestic elemental. There you go. And veil of flash, foil common. <clears throat> but it was still like a classical, you know, Rudy style video where uh, there's lots of lots of jokes and stuff like that throughout the video. So it makes it plenty entertaining throughout. Foil Common, Winter's Grasp. I liked at the end of the video, um, for no reason at all, there was still a, a low blow at um, Collectibles Guru. <laughs> for no reason at all. We had to bring up Collectibles Guru again, which was pretty funny. Uh, Volatire, Strike Twice, that is a Majestic for Elemental. 
and ball lightning foil common i was <laughs> i was laughing quite a bit when uh collectibles guru kind of took like a a stray bullet he wasn't even um involved in this current situation in any way but uh in the past he had kind of made a fool out of himself when it comes to high-end collectibles in the pokemon world so he, he's still catching stray bullets from that which is kind of funny it's wine ice elemental But I liked how Rudy's talking points were not necessarily um, about the actual situation itself. Um, plenty of people have described what the actual situation is, what happened, stuff like that. Amulet of Earth, Foil Common. And I like that he doesn't always take his approaches like that with the video, rather than just like restating the situation, what happened. Um, he's kind of talking about what you can learn from situations like this. So I think that's a, I think it's a great approach. Entangle, Foil Common, Elemental. I think it's a great approach because, I mean, any, like I said, lots of content creators will make those videos talking about what happened. But he, he's talking about the lessons we should be taking away. And that's why I really always appreciate this content. Icequake. And we got the Snapshot, Foil Rare, Elemental. Get the Russian Spammer. Get this still. I think there's multiple people, Ryan, that are definitely still not out of the woods, though. Yeah. Like, talking about the actual situation now itself. Uh, foil Common, Frazzle. I think there's, yeah, multiple people, like you said, Ryan, that are unfortunately not quite... Uh, not quite clear of this yet. Unfortunately, like I said. Turn Timber, Sting of Sorcery, Majestic, Rune Blade, and it's Wine Ice, Foil Common. So it's, you know... It's one of those things where it's going to take a little bit more time to develop. Yeah, the Bulbasaur, Ryan. Or whatever the heck the Pokemon was. I think it was Bulbasaur. Um, yeah, funny stuff. <laughs> yeah, Dan, I know. I know. And you try to send, like, a legitimate offer as well. That seems, like, fair for the market price, you know? Flash, Foil Rare Lightning. You try to find like the market price and you're actually sending like a legit offer. Yeah, that's that's happened to me as well. It's unfortunate always. Uh, foil common shock striker for lightning. Yeah, like it's a really reasonable offer. <laughs> yeah, what the heck, Dan? That's so bad. That's so bad. That's really bad. Come on, that's no way to go about. Uh, trying to strike a deal like that. Strength of Sequoia, Foil Common. Like, at that point, don't even have best offer. Just have it at buy it now only. Um, if you're not going to field any offers that are reasonable, you might as well just keep it buy it now. It saves you time. It saves the buyer time. All of that stuff. Evergreen. Ooh, Flicker Wisp. Foil Majestic. That one is between Elemental and Rune Blade. Random at the end there. Good luck on that elemental and rune blade. Foil majestic. But yeah, I, I hear you, man. I hear you, Dan. <laughs> it's getting you're losing hope a little bit. I think I think you're gonna get it done though still. I saw your list today. It looked really, really like yeah, you're getting it down a little bit. Lightning press. Not a ton left for sure. But I would assume it's like a lot of secrets. All secrets, probably actually. Light it up, Majestic. Code of Frost. That is a... Uh, maybe a Rainbow Foil Common. I think so. I think so. Code of Frost, Rainbow Foil Common. I believe. I believe. Ice Spot there. I'll sleeve it. I believe it is. Congrats. It's tough to see on these. I believe so, though. Congrats on that. Oh yeah, Dan, I've seen that that Umbreon VMAX is actually selling, like, quite expensive. That Umbreon VMAX. Polar Blast. It is, Sean, thank you. I, I can never exactly tell. It's really, really small differences with this stuff here. Weavice, Snapshot, Foil Common Mulch, Elemental. I can never quite tell. Pulse of Candlehold, Majestic, Earth, and Weave Lightning, Foil Rare. 
I think you're probably right on that, Dan. I think you're probably right. Turn Timber and Foil Common Frazzle. I feel like that's correct. I feel like there's some of them that are just, you know, those secrets are just... There's one in every box you have to remember, but there's so many that you can pull, so it makes certain ones more expensive for the time being. Just because of that. Awakening Majestic. There has to be that top tier still. They can't all be the exact same. Uh, Earth Lore Surge Foil Common. And there's usually things like that that establish themselves as just the time goes on a little bit. Comes a little bit more firm and stuff. You'd think, Ryan. You'd think, yeah. You'd think. Sometimes, though, Ryan, I will tell you. Uh, Biting Gale Foil Rare for Elemental. Like, that is usually 100% true, Ryan. But there's always a small handful of cards that are, like, the top, top hits from um, both the English set and then the Japanese counterpart whatever that might be, that the Japanese will actually like have a little spike um, because people will enjoy it so much in English and they'll look to maybe get that next copy. And there'll be a certain a certain tier of cards, maybe like Galler Friends or something like that, that will actually do a little bit better. But it's gotta be one of those really, really special ones. Strength of Sequoia Foil Common. That is well, Ryan, that, that is well. Then it just like triples in price. <laughs> if it doesn't get printed in English, yeah. Then it like triples in price, exactly. Rights of Lightning and Dazzling Crescendo, Foil Common. Uh, that could be an exaggeration, but it, it will go up uh, significantly because of the fact that then that's the only card. So. Yeah, I know, Dan. That's the worst part. That's the worst part about buying the singles for VMAX Climax. And any Japanese singles, they're almost always um, coming from Japan uh, for the most part. There's a couple of other places that they come from. Germany as well is very popular actually for VMAX Climax singles. I'm not sure why that is, uh, but most of those countries are more popular than the US actually. So it's tough. I know exactly, Dan, that's correct. That's correct. Ice Quake and Twine Earth, Foil Common Elemental. That's very correct. Like, initially, you will say that. Like, yeah, people are, uh, they just don't have it here. Um, but now it's been like a couple of months, so people certainly have it at this point. But yeah, they're choosing not to sell, I guess. Not too many um, US sellers on eBay. Glacial Footsteps, Foil Common. Now, part of that is probably just because of how great the arts are. People want this stuff for their collection. Not really too concerned about the value of it right now. They'd rather just um they'd rather just uh hold on to it. Enjoy it for their collection itself. Sting of sorcery, majestic, and I'm seeing some legendary action. Oh boy. Crown of seeds, earth spot! Wow! That's gonna be a foil legendary! Crown of seeds! Boom! I think that was Daniel H. Congrats, let me give it another check. Wow, Daniel, yes, very nice hit, man. Crown of Seeds, Foil Legendary. Congrats, Daniel, awesome card. Let's go, man. Wow, very nice hit. There you go. Congratulations on that, Daniel. Crushed it with the Earth Spot. Crown of Seeds, Foil Legendary. Beautiful, man. We'll get that magged up for you, Daniel. Awesome card. Awesome card there. And Sting of Sorcery was the Majestic. There you go, Daniel. Congrats on it. Great stuff. Earth, not too much to chase after besides that card. So there you go. Congratulations, man. Very nice. And a beautiful hit. First Legendary out of the case. Um, there we go, Rare. Explosive Growth and Frazzle, Foil Common. Yeah, the Discord has been very helpful for that as well, but yeah, even just like the YouTube chat as well. There's been some trades executed sometimes um, in, the in the chat and stuff. Strength of Sequoia again, Foil Common. Hm. 
but I don't want to buy them. <laughs> That's funny. Summer Witch Shelter, Electrify Foil Common. I feel like the reason you don't want to buy them present is because then it's going to feel like you don't have to ever touch Evolving Skies again. Maybe you're not ready to give it up yet. <laughs> so that's kind of funny. That's kind of funny. Ice Storm Majestic. There you go, Elemental. And Blizzard Bolt for a common Elemental. There you go. Nice, Ryan. Good choices. Nice. Wow, what a pack. <laughs> Better be a fabled in here. Pretty much true. That's funny, present. <laughs> That's funny, man. Fighting Gale, foil rare for elemental. Fair enough, man. It's such a sweet set. Oh, and the Mothman. Nice, nice. Yeah, I got you. Yeah, that's the first dead Mothman. Ooh, very nice. Ice hit. Blizzard. Foil Majestic. Here we go, Ice. Nice Blizzard card. Congrats on that. Uh, I set that there. All right, guys. Check out that next break we got tonight. Remember, it does break next. Triple Booster with Burning Shadows, Ultra Prism, and Unified Minds. Um, and you can also, with that link I just dropped, you can see the breakdown of the spots um, in the break as well. With uh, the link I just dropped in the chat, that would also be how you purchase your spots. That is the next one going tonight. Let's get that one filled up, guys. We can keep moving right along then. Appreciate that. Terra Sunder, another Majestic for Guardian. Shock Striker. Terra Sunder, pretty good one for uh, the actual trading card game itself. Nice. Depending on your deck and class, of course. So, tomorrow, Foil Common Earth. There you go. Appreciate everyone who has hopped into that break so far. We'll have that one coming up next tonight. And then after that, we got that full case of evolving boosters at the end of the night. Big chases in uh, all these breaks here to close out the night. Sigil of Suffering, foil rare. Nice. Makes sense, Ryan. Yep. Awakening, another Majestic, very nice Elemental. Cracker Jacks, Foil Common. Yeah, I think that's just a Foil Common. You gotta look at these like 18 times to see if it's a Rainbow Foil. Nice Elemental hits. Uh, let me move some base quick. sealed box about half of this one left as well a couple of rares foil common thump seismic surge bolt and shot weave ice and amulet of ice foil common nice lexi hero at the back of lightning and inspire lightning foil common elemental there you go elemental slots keep these going here guys weaver frost fang snapshot foil rare for elemental explosive growth frost fang and a Rites of Lightning, Foil Rare Elemental. Exposed to the Elements, nice and majestic hit. There you go, Elemental. And Weave Ice. That is a Foil Rare for Ice. 
And of course, guys, if you haven't had a chance to join our Discord yet, I'm going to drop you the link right now for the Latent Gaming Discord. Great spot to really stay up to date. Anything Latent Gaming, also just to uh, hang out. We're always chatting about whatever's hot. I mean, there's been a lot of news in the trading card game and uh, sports card world over the last couple of days. Some of it even carries over to the trading cards and stuff. So, always a fun place to be. Heaven's Claws, Foil Common. Talking about lots of different stuff in the Discord. A great spot to stay informed as well, like I said. Volatire, strike twice majestic. There you go, Elemental. Very nice. Twine Lightning, Foil Common. Thump, Embodiment of Lightning. <laughs> nice, Ryan. It's it's good stuff, man. It's really good stuff, actually, Ryan. Fun rip, man, for sure. Definitely check out the group breaks sometime in the future, Ryan. We'll have um another round of group breaks listed by the time you wake up tomorrow for Wednesday. So, embolden foil rare. There will be some flesh and blood on that uh, group break list for you. Keep these going yeah arcane rising is a really popular one uh, maybe we will do another arcane rising on wednesday got ice quake and we got thump foil common it's got some really nice artwork but tales of aria's got some sweet artwork as well it's got um kind of almost like that wintry vibe with the artwork in the set like fall and winter cards a lot of the time lightning press signal of suffering and invigorates foil common all right, last one, guys. Good luck. One legendary so far. Let's see if we can uh, grab another here at the end. I also just uh, stabbed Pikachu with the knife, so hopefully uh, Pikachu does not start bleeding on the table because I just uh, I just stabbed him with the knife on accident. He got a little <laughs> a little bump there. <clears throat> All right, and empty, of course. Good luck, guys. Last one here. Let's do this. Just my garbage bag that looks like a mess. Get this going. Ah, Blossoming Spellblade. Nice majestic elemental hit. An evergreen foil rare. Crack Bugle token. Nice. Uh, and Twine Earth, Foil Common. Yeah, let's see one more Legendary here as we do close out the break. Let's see one more Dance open for the Spellbound Creepers. Uh, Ice Quake and Foil Common rejuvenates for Elemental. Nice. Nice, yeah. Yeah, that's a, that, that was a good one, Ryan, to watch. Um, that was for Eric a while back. We did one of each unlimited box. Yep. <laughs> that was for Eric about two weeks ago or so. We did one of each unlimited box. There was a sweet break. And at the very end, we had a fabled card. So it was awesome. But yeah, that's a good way to do it. That gives you a great look. Uh, Weed Lightning Foil Rare. That was like super late. It was like 1.15 a.m. Um, <laughs> Eric came on. He's like, do you have time for like five flesh and blood boxes? I was like, yeah, sure, I guess. It'll probably take me right up to two. And then he ordered one of each unlimited. I was like, well, that's going to be pretty fun. I'm down. <laughs> Gives us a look at all of it. Uh, chill to the bone. Foil common for ice. Super late into the stream, though. Like I said, just wrapping it up. Fun one to end the night. Like one of the last packs, we had a uh, really, really big hit. Big fabled from Tales of Aria. Ooh, Majestic Awakening Elemental. And Invigorates. Foil common. All right, guys, come on. One more legendary here. Hoping for it. Hoping for it. Let's see it. One more legendary. Good luck, everyone. Frost Fang, Evergreen, and a foil common versioning. Nice. Seismic Surge. Cold Wave Flash. Wow! Shock Charmers! 
Foil Legendary. Lightning. Another one. Boom. Congrats. Who's got lightning? Lightning, Sean. There you go, Sean. Nice shock charmers. Congrats on your foil legendary. Oh, wow. That one is nice. Holy cow. Get that in the lighting. Get that right. Hold on. Oh, yeah. Wow. Look at that. Holy. That is sweet looking. If you hold it like out of the light, you can't even see it either. Go like that. You can't see it at all. I mean, look at it now. Look at it now. Oh, my goodness. Holy cow. That's crazy. Oh, <laughs> that's nice looking, Sean. There you go. Beauty. Congrats. That is nice. Let me grab a mag tag for that one. Beautiful. I don't know if we've hit that one. Ah, uh, never mind. Dan said he has it in cold foil. Maybe we did. <laughs> Maybe we did. Wow, that is sweet. Very nice, Sean. Congrats. We'll get that magged up. So two legendaries in the case. Nice, another great case. Two legendaries feels really good, guys, with this stuff. One is great. If you can get one. Uh, two is really nice, though. Congrats there, Sean. Nice, man. Got Ice Storm Majestic and Inspired Lightning Foil Common. And guys, we've been trying to get a couple more Tales of Aria first dead boxes. It, it, literally just impossible right now. Uh, pretty much just impossible for us, unfortunately. One of the reasons I'm really looking forward to the new set, though. What's up, Flip? How you doing? Explosive growth. Weave lightning. And a buzz bolt. Foil common. Briar token. All right. And remember, guys, got that triple booster break up next. If you are interested in that one, it is breaking next tonight. Check the link. I did just drop in the chat for you. Lots of great energies to land and lots of big cards to chase after. A couple of tag teams and Unified Minds. Burning Shadows is going to have that huge Charizard hit. Uh, Ultra Prism has massive trainers. So they all kind of have their own uh, unique um, addition to the break. Rights of Lightning, Foil Rare. Uh, if you would like to be in addition to the break, feel free to check out the link. I just dropped in the chat. Breaking next tonight. Got a Frost Fang and a Shock Striker. Foil Common. Cleaning all day, dang, Flip. Sorry, man. Yeah, that's never the best days, but they're essential days as well. Days that have to happen, but uh, days that aren't the most fun. Ah, oh, Flip! Flip, Flip, we hit a God Pack earlier tonight. Our first pack of uh, the Nightfall Booster Box. First pack of the Nightfall Booster Box. We hit a God Pack. That was nuts, man. I forgot to tell you. First pack. It's been months, Flip. Months since we hit a God Pack. We hit one in our first pack tonight of Nightfall. No old scratch in the box. You'd be hearing about it. Channel Mountain Heroic. There you go, Earth. Majestic and an Overflex. Foil common for Ranger. Nice. Old him behind that. So that was... That was awesome. Earlier. Yeah, it's been a while, Flip. That's what I mean. It's been a while, man. Single of Suffering, Embolden, and a Thump. Foil common. It was the first pack out of the box. First pack. <laughs> yeah, man. Because I know that there's a chance that old scratch can be in there. I know there's a chance. So it it's one of those things. Could I be holding that card? That ticket. That golden ticket. Lightning surge. Foil common. Uh, it was it was from a booster box flip. It was one of those pack style breaks. Pack style breaks where there's nine slots to the break. I do the random and stuff. And then we did one booster. One of the pack style. The ones you don't like compared to Digit. So Luis got a hot start to the box. In the uh, pack, there was a Mothman full and a Wendigo full. So it was still a great pack. Mothman full and Wendigo full. Evergreen foil rare. There you go, Earth. So that was pretty dang sweet. <laughs> yeah, my hands were a little bit shaky for sure. I caught it as well. They were a little bit. Definitely true. Ooh, wow. Very nice. Earth hit. Foil Majestic. Channel Mount Heroic. Wow, nice Foil Majestic. Congrats there. Beautiful card. Wow. Really beautiful card. Holy cow. 
That's one of my favorite flesh and blood cards ever. Just, that's really nice. Just awesome design. Just like a really cool nature scene. Congrats there. Yes, it did, Reach. Yes, it did. Uh, that one should be uploaded to the channel already. Um, if it's not, let me know. I can also give it a look here, see if it is indeed uploaded real quick. Okay, so it looks like it failed to upload. So just give me a second, Reach. I will upload it in just a minute after this break here. Thanks for letting me know. Uh, but yeah, just give me about two minutes, like I said, to finish out this break. Three minutes. I'll get that one uploading then. It'll be up in about five minutes. Uh, if you wanted to, you could scroll back a little bit right now into live. But yes, I can get that uploading in just a minute here for you. Sorry about that. And Chilling Ice Vine, foil common. Nice. Very solid. Keep this going, guys. Good luck. Ice Quake. Ooh, Honing Hood. Foil common. There you go, Ranger. Another hero, or another uh, token there. Weaver, Pulse of Altaven, Majestic, Lightning. There you go, and Electrify, Foil Common. Keep these going, guys. A little bit left at the end of the box here. Appreciate it. Let's close this one out with another nice hit. Come on. Uh, Weave Ice, Signal of Suffering. And we got Winter's Bite, Foil Common, Ice. A little bit remaining, and then I will do those randoms at the end. We'll be moving right along to the next break here tonight then, guys. Thank you again. Appreciate it. Uh, Ice Quake. Ooh, Majestic Fulminate. There you go, Elemental. It's Wine Ice. Foil Common. Yeah, I saw those, Flip. I saw those. I saw there was going to be a small amount at Collecticon as well, whatever the heck that means. So that's kind of sick. That's kind of sick. That would be a couple of days early. I think Collecticon is the 28th and 29th of February. Or the 27th and 28th. Unless there is a 29th. I don't know if there's a 29th this year. <laughs> there might be. Uh, Frost Fang. Ice Quake. Foil rare for ice. Oh, that's nice, Flip. That is nice. I didn't even realize that, to be honest with you. I didn't even realize. That's sweet. I'm glad they did that. I really liked how they did that in Nightfall. Rights of Lightning and an Entangle. Foil common for Elemental. All right, guys, I'm going to do two randoms now quick. Uh, one of these is going to be for Flicker Wisp. This will be between Elemental and Rune Blade. Foil Majestic. And then the next one will be a Winter's Whale between Elemental and Guardian. Good luck. Also a Foil Majestic. So let me get these set up really quick. And then I will flash you over to the random screen. Just one minute. Get these set up for you. Uh, so we're starting out with Flicker Wisp. This is break three. Um, slots on that is Elemental. Rune Blade. And then the next random will be for uh, Winter's Whale. Uh, break three. That one is between Elemental and Guardian. No, it's going to be a different hollow pattern, but just like the concept of it. All right, good luck. Got Elemental and Rune Blade on the Flicker Wisp. Let's roll the dice. Uh, eight times. So we will do both of these randoms here eight times. Good luck. The name on top wins. Yeah, exactly, Ryan. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Name on top wins at eight. Uh, elemental, you got yourself that Flicker Wisp. There you go, Elemental. Take that one quick. And let's get on to the Winter's Whale now. Good luck here. Uh, eight times. Name on top wins. This is between Elemental and Guardian. Perfect. Good luck. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Got Guardian at the top. There you go. Guardian. You got yourself that Winter's Will weapon card. 
Foil Majestic. All right, thanks again, everyone. Appreciate you joining that one. We'll get those cards all protected and sent right out to you guys. All right, thank you again. And let me update here the tonight sheet, see where we are at. Got a couple of spots remaining here in these next breaks tonight, guys. Got four left now, thank you. Four left on our next break tonight and one left there at the end of the night, awesome. So not much left here, but we do have to get this next one sold out. If you are interested, um, feel free to check out the link I'm about to drop in the description. Holy cow, Blair, that was you? Oh my goodness, <laughs> dude, that was a crazy break. Congrats on that, wow. Congrats on that, that's incredible. That was you, man, that was a nuts break for fire. All right, guys, so four left here on this triple booster. Good luck, four left. If you do wanna hop in, Feel free to grab one of these last few spots. Four to go. Come on, Dan, come on. You can't even make that up, man. You can't even make that up. <laughs> no. No, you can't even make that stuff up. Like, how does that happen, man? That's so frustrating. All right, let me do a little bit of uploading. I have to upload that Cryptid Nation second edition break from earlier as well, quick. And then I'm gonna upload the full case as well, quick, guys. Like I said, if you are interested, feel free to check out the link I just dropped in the chat. Remember, guys, I'm going to grab those boxes right now. It is Unified Minds, Burning Shadows, and Ultra Prism. Some great choices and some great chase cards. So good luck. If you do decide to hop in, check the link in the chat. Let's get that sold out, ready to start breaking as soon as we are sold out on it. Oh, wow. Nice, Ryan. Nice. That would be pretty fun, man. <laughs> and that would also be something sweet to have as well, in addition. Really sweet to have. All right, so like I said, as soon as we're sold out, this next one is going to get underway tonight. Four remaining. I did just drop the link in the chat for you if you want to grab one of these last four spots. Get it underway then after that. All right, let me do some uploading quick, guys. And appreciate everyone tonight. It's been a fun night. I'm looking forward to this break. Some awesome sets here. So let's get this one sold out, guys. We can start ripping it then. Unified, Ultra Prism, and Burning Shadows. Like I said, each of these uh, boxes kind of brings their own thing to the break. Ultra Prism, really good for trainers. Unified Minds, really nice tag teams. Some big Psychic and Electric hits. Uh, a couple of other energies as well in Unified. Burning Shadows, that huge hit with the Charizard to chase after. So Fire Spot, big boost there. Really fun break, guys. And it comes at just a fraction of what one of these boxes would normally cost. Uh, of course, usually these are about $400 each. Got three of them in the break for you. All right, one sec, just uploading, guys. There we go, that's the Cryptid Nation video. Gotta get that one uploaded. The same video that you watched, Ryan, probably also popped up in my recommended. I bet it was the same one. Cause I was thinking the same thing, man. It was just a horrible video. Like just not good. <laughs> just straight up not good, man. Unfortunately. All right, so four to go, guys. Let's get this one sold out. Get right to it then. Four to go. I did just drop the link in the chat. Let me move the cards from that last one. Let's get this one sold out, everyone. <clears throat> get right to it. Four remaining now. Yeah, they are beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Love these sets, man. Let's see if we can grab something big. Lots of big ones. That Burning Shadows Charizard PSA 10? I saw the most recent sale. Finally, there was a PSA 10 that sold. It sold for freaking $2,500. It's nuts, man. That's crazy for a, a Pokemon set that's only two years old. 
stuff doesn't happen that much. Nice, I think we're at three left. Another spot just came in there, appreciate that. We are at three left now, guys. Awesome. Let's keep this going. Three left. <clears throat> Wide variety of chase cards here. Get this random uh, set up for what I got so far. Triple Sun and Moon Booster. Three names. Energy. Yeah, I think I think that was potentially the one I watched, Ryan. <laughs> potentially. That's funny, man. Sometimes, you know, people try, but it just they have to have like a better plan as to how they're gonna go about it. It felt like it was jumping around a lot. David G, Tarek M. I hear ya. Jimmy C. I hear you though. All right, got the eight energies there. Three to go, guys. If you are interested, feel free to check out the link in the chat. Three left here. Let's get this sold out. that quick and then let me type in the full case from later on as well quick while I'm waiting for these last couple of spots tonight three left guys Wow flip geez that's some crazy progress for you congrats congrats flip Congrats on that, man. Do, do, do. The Evolving Skies full case sold out as well. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. He's just trying to get, I think he's trying to get like 12 of each Mothman and then 12 Wendigos as well. So, pretty sweet. Pretty sweet collection that he's working on. Trying to fill out a full 12 binder page of each. That would be pretty dang cool to look at. <laughs> All right. Like I said, guys, three left. As soon as we are sold out, we're going to get this one moving tonight. Three to go now on this break here. Three Sun and Moon boxes. Good stuff. Good potential here. Check them out. Burning Shadows Unified and Ultra Prism. Three left here. Then, like I said, that full case is sold out now as well. So just these three spots left, and we can get the night continuing here. <clears throat> Yeah, those are the ones you're looking for always. And then, oh, nice. So you just needed a couple more for the set as well. Nice, nice. Gotcha, gotcha. Gotcha. That's nice, man. Refresh that. Let's 
sweet. And I've got everything typed in. Just need the last three names now. Everything else should be all typed in and all ready to go. So if you are thinking about joining this one, I can show you a little breakdown of it quick. So you can see here, it's got eight different spots. Trainer spot, like I said, big hitters, um, really across the sets, but Ultra Prism specifically. Psychic is going to be really, really good in Unified Minds. You got the Mewtwo and Mew, big cards to chase after there. Fire type, big hits, um, going to be in Burning Shadows. Got that Rainbow Charizard. Water and Grass are those energies that kind of find their way in both of the sets. Uh, Dragon's got a handful of nice tag teams in Unified, and then some sweet cards as well. There's a nice Dragonite Rainbow um, to chase after. And then the Triple Combo is actually pretty solid. Um, they have quite a few hits across the energies. Um, throughout these boxes so that is a breakdown of the spots and then like I said it is ultra prism burning shadows and unified breakdown of that break right there and like I said three left on it if you are interested I'm gonna drop the link in the chat right now for you we just need to sell this one out and we can get it ripping three left <clears throat> Triple Sun and Moon, number two, Sunday night. Sweet. Set that there, just this quick. I think Funkos are pretty cool. I always catch myself like looking at Funkos when I see them. I've never actually ever bought even one. <laughs> Never even bought one of them, but I always see myself looking at them and, and thinking they are really cool. But yeah, honestly, I've never actually purchased one, which as weird as it sounds, it's true. As weird as it does sound, it is true. I've never purchased one, but I do really like the look of them and stuff. <clears throat> gotcha, Ryan. Yeah, it's. I think they're cool, but I don't know, man. There's just not... Um, not a huge like rarity factor to a lot of them as well like there is and there isn't there's those specially printed and uh, specially released only at certain stores but I think there's still like cooler collectibles out there right now than Funkos but I do like the the concept of it and I like how many uh, partnerships they have as well it seems like literally like every major brand um, partners with Funko which is nuts like every major brand so it's pretty crazy to think about something like that. <clears throat> nice present, you got a couple of them. Nice. Oh, nice flip, that one's cool. Rudy from the movie, that's nice. That's a cool card, that's a cool card. <laughs> cool Funko to have. That is a cool Funko for sure. Very nice, man. Very nice. All right, guys, like I said, three remaining. Three remaining. If you're interested in one of these spots, you can find it with the link right there. I'm in the chat. Three left. Lil Wayne, that's pretty cool, Kyle. Have you enjoyed his new album that he just released? I'll listen to a little bit already. I wasn't really enjoying the start, but the back end had some nice songs. Lil Wayne, that's pretty funny. <laughs> too many Funkos for Ryan. <laughs> that's funny, Ryan. Too many. <laughs> yeah, I guess that's why maybe I'm scared to start. <laughs> maybe if I just never start, then uh, then I'll never, uh, you know, have to get to that point where I have too many Funkos. <laughs> that's funny. That is funny. Oh, yeah, that's sick. That's sick. From Destiny, that's cool, Nick. That's cool. Like I said, that's the cool thing about Funkos is they literally have, like, partnerships with every company, man. Like, every company has has a Funko, it seems like, nowadays, which is pretty dang cool. Um, but I don't know what I don't know what's not appealing to me about them, because I like a lot of the concepts associated with it still. Ah, that's pretty sweet, Ryan. That's pretty sweet. You didn't struggle too much with finding the big ones. Nice. That's crazy, Ryan. That is a lot. Holy cow. 
I mean, you can have 250 cards, Ryan, um, you know, in like a, a handful like this, a stack like that. 250 Funkos, like, that might not even like fit on this entire table here. <laughs> so that, that's pretty crazy, Ryan. That's pretty crazy. <clears throat> that's nuts. Like I said, you can fit 250 cards in your hand easily. But 250 Funkos is just, uh, is nuts. Literally nuts. Yeah, that's, that's correct, I think, Kyle. That's correct. One of my friends and I were talking about that the other day. Um, that is correct, I think, what you had said right there. It's, it's crazy, though, Kyle. A crazy story attached to it, for sure. Uh, they're in the other room, Jacob. They're on the personals table in the other room. I did not leave them in here. Oh, for sure, Flip, yeah. For sure, man. I, I couldn't even imagine, honestly. Like, I don't know where I would put that many Funkos. <laughs> what? That's nuts, present. Quadruple bat? That's crazy. The heck? Three left, guys. Three left, Sun and Moon series. Three left. There's the boxes for you right there. And like I said, three remaining. If you are interested in one of these last three spots, check that link I just dropped there. Can start ripping it as soon as we are sold out. Let's get this one sold out, guys. Yeah, no problem, Jacob. No problem. I figured I would just put them right in the other room right away, though. And like I said, Jacob, it took me like five minutes, but I sleeved like a bunch of the hits and stuff. So those will all get top loaded. I know I didn't do a lot on camera besides the really big ones, but yeah, no problem, man. My pleasure, Jacob. My pleasure. That was so sick. <laughs> I can't believe it. I was looking up the comps on those cards last night, Jacob. Felt like you probably doubled up or so. That's really nice on Mosaic. Only. Only. <laughs> That's funny. <clears throat> that is funny. Nice gambit. Yeah, that's that's sick, Dan. That's sick. Fair, Ryan. Fair. It's just even even just like selling them off like that, Ryan, can take uh can take some time for sure. It can take some time and it can be a process, unfortunately. Selling stuff off like that in such a such a big amount, you know. Unless you find like a nice lot deal or something. Selling off individuals like that will certainly take the time. But it can be worth it as well, of course. Of course, putting money back in your pocket that way. <clears throat> putting money back in your pocket. All right, guys, ready to rip as soon as I get the last three spots in the Ultra Prism, Burning Shadows, and Unified Minds. Triple booster box break. Three Sun Moon sets here, guys. Three of them. Should be a good time. Looking forward to this break. Let's just get it sold out. Like I said, we have three remaining. Three to go. Feel free to check the link I just dropped um, in the chat for you right there. Scheduled to start just a few minutes ago, but that is no problem. Gonna get it going right as soon as we are sold out. Three left, guys. <clears throat> Let's pull some huge hits, man. Fair, Ryan. Fair. I think you said you collected sports as well last night. So, yeah, fair enough. <laughs> fair enough. <clears throat> Refresh that. Ah, that's smart, Ryan. That's smart. I guess people are probably looking for it um, in lots like that as well. So that would definitely be a good way to go about it for sure. Really smart, Ryan.
really smart. Discord quick. Ah, Ryan. Or, uh, Sean, I bet. I bet. Send me some screenshots or something if you have time, Sean. I bet, though. I bet he's had some crazy situations in the past, honestly. I would not be surprised. <laughs> Unfortunately. Yeah, same Ryan, same. When they were like paired up. That was so much nicer. I really preferred that, uh, Ryan, compared to what they have right now. I thought it was much, much better um, having it paired up like that. I thought that that was significantly better. I agree with you, man. 100% there. 100%. Oh, nice, Kyle. Awesome. Yeah, we'd love to have you up here sometime. Right outside Orlando, of course, in Altamont. So, yeah, we'd love to have you up here sometime, Kyle. That'd be fantastic, man. We'd love that. Nice. Two lefts. Sweet. Daniel, good luck. Hey, Daniel, congrats. I don't know if you saw earlier, Daniel. We had that uh, big hit for you earlier tonight. Um, out of that flesh and blood break. Congrats on that, Daniel. Crown of Seeds. Beautiful card. Congrats again. Nice. Two left, guys. Thanks, Daniel. Appreciate it, man. And good luck to you. Daniel H. Grabbing one up. Two to go, guys. Two to go. We can get it started as soon as we are uh, filled up here. Two left. Nice, Daniel. Yeah, you crushed it on that break. You did really well. You did really well. Big legendary pull for you. <clears throat> Crown of Seeds. Really cool stuff. Uh, crown of seeds crown of seeds foil legendary oh nice so you've been up to apopka then kyle very cool nice jacob you're the man closing it out thanks jacob appreciate that sold out man thank you again jacob awesome now i can just type thanks jacob good luck man Fun stuff here with the sun and moon. Not one we get to do too often. Um, just because of the fact that we don't really have like a ton of these sun and moon boxes ever on hand. Usually when we get them, we get like one or two at a time. So kind of like hoard them back and save them for a break like this. So looking forward to it, guys, and good luck. Thank you, though, Jacob, for closing it out. I heard about that. I heard about that, Ryan. And then the same thing happened with chilling. Yeah. I heard about this. The same thing had happened with Chilling Rain as well. <laughs> but that's actually pretty common. That's pretty common. With Pokemon, they're not always like the tightest of seal. Sometimes it is a little bit loose. All right, guys, let's get right to the random. And thanks for selling it out. Appreciate that. Let's do this here. How's it going, everyone? Caleb here with Layton Gaming. Doing that triple sun and moon booster box random. Good luck. There's a lot of great spots to land here. Like I said, each box in this break kind of adds their own touch. They all have um, big hits and stuff like that, but all of them kind of come for different energy or trainer and stuff like that. So really fun break and good luck. Got the eight names. Here's the eight spots. Let's roll the dice. Uh, nine here, good luck. And thanks Daniel Jacob for closing it out. Appreciate that guys. Let's get this going. Nine times on the names. Let's do this. One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine. Got Jimmy C at the top, Jacob P at the bottom. Nine on energy. Let's do it. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight there. And nine. Final round. Trainer at the top, psychic at the bottom. All right, I'll grab this, guys, and let you know what you have. Uh, where are we at? Names, energy. Looks like someone else was doing 
a random at the same time. That's the last one. Delete that quick. And good luck. Jimmy C at the top. Trainer at the top. Nice, Jimmy. Congrats. Jimmy going to be going after those trainers, especially in Ultra Prism. Uh, Daniel H. Nice, man. Congrats, Daniel. Grabbing yourself fire. That's a huge chase for you in um, the uh, Burning Shadows. Good luck, man. Justin T. Water. You'll have some action everywhere. Paul W. Triple Combo. You will also have some action everywhere. Jacob P. with that other triple combo. David G. Grass. There you go. Derek M. Dragon. And Jacob P. Psychic Energy. Good luck. Let's get this underway. And thank you again. Nice one there at the end, Jacob. Psychic. Good to get for Unified, of course. Like I said, this one's pretty fun because each box kind of has their own addition to the break. Uh, three booster break two. Yeah, that's a nice one, Daniel. Not like a lot of crazy hits besides Burning Shadows, Daniel, but a huge one in Burning Shadows. You get that whole box of Burning Shadows to chase the Rainbow Zard. One we've never hit as well, I must mention. <laughs> one we've never hit and one that I'm pretty much dying to see. Let's get right to it, guys. Good luck on it. And thank you for joining. Good luck. How's it going, everyone? Caleb here with Layton Gaming. All right, fun one to start, guys. Let's do it. Sun and Moon, the triple booster. Burning Shadows. Unified Mind. Ultra Prism. We'll start it with Ultra Prism. Save these two for the end. Pikachu's down in the back again. Come on, Pikachu. You gotta stay awake, man. Been talking about this. And here's your results, guys. Just got those onto the website as well. Alright, good luck, everyone. Let's find some huge hits. We're starting it out with some Ultra Prism. And then, like I said, that Evolving Sky is full case. That breaks next tonight. That is already sold out. So thank you very much for that. Appreciate that as well. <coughs> Appreciate that very much. Good luck, everyone. Let's do it. We have not, Nick. That's never happened to us. Um, to my knowledge, at least. <laughs> I should say that. Uh, the gaming side and stuff like that, that has never happened to us. Uh, I don't know if it's ever happened on the sports side. Of course, that's been around for like 10 years, so I have no idea, to be honest. Uh, but gaming, no, that has never happened. Of course, I probably just jinxed us somehow, but... <laughs> Yeah, it's a, it's a legitimate thing nowadays, but yeah, we have a lot of really trusted people that uh, we do our business with, so. <clears throat> That's the reasoning behind that. Let's get these going, guys. Snova Reverse. And Alolan Executor, nice. Uh, Cosmo. Ultra Prism, like I said, is the first box here. Ultra Prism has a lot of nice cards. Biggest are going to be the trainers, though. Some huge trainers. Huge trainers. Especially if we could see Lily. Electabuzz, Drapion. Yeah, for sure, Nick. For sure. But like I said, in the <laughs> in the uh, modern day world, it's unfortunately something that's not too uncommon, Nick. Unfortunately, like I said. You see it happening more and more, it feels like. Uh, fan wrote him. Yeah, for real, Ryan. For real. No luck on that. <laughs> no luck on that. Exactly, Sean. That's all something that just comes with time as well. Um, Rich kind of had found out that after a while of being in the sports world that um, some of his largest sports distributors also were in the gaming world. So he already had some of those uh, relationships established prior to latent gaming even really becoming a thought. So, yep. <clears throat> that was one of the big parts of putting this all together, though. It's tough to get product nowadays. Stunky. That's hilarious. Stunky. And Shaman. Non-hollow. But exactly, Sean. You said it. Empoleon Reverse. And Empoleon Rare. Nice. Well, Empoleon. That's my dude in Shining Pearl, Empoleon. Crushing through the game with him. He's been uh, crushing it for me. Alright, first hit coming up, guys. Good luck on it. Got a Dialga GX. Starting out. Nice. I just love seeing the hits from Sun and Moon, man. 
Bringing out some different cards, some different Pokemon potentially that we don't always see ripping some of those uh, modern Sword and Shield sets. Dialga GX, there you go, Dragon, to get it going. Congrats on that. Nice hit. Let's find the big cards now, guys. Good luck. Magnemite, Reverse Hollow, Alolan Sand Slash. going here. Ooh, very nice. That is a Prism Star. Prism Star card. Soul Galio. Very cool. Metal. Soul Galio Prism Star. Unfortunately, not a concept that's around anymore. Mo Rotom. I wish they still had Prism Stars. They look really nice. like a fancier hollow and then you can see that like medallion um, at the bottom of the card as well soul galio kind of um, like amazing rares a concept that was around temporarily but never really took off fully got rotom reverse tapu lele oh i gotta toss that on in a minute here nick forgot that game already started Maybe they're talking about the foil on the box. Nice Eevee there, basic. They might be talking about the foiling or the hollow on the box, Ryan. I don't know. Shaman. It's a good question, Ryan. I'm not sure. Really good question. Keep these going here, guys. Electric Memory. Ooh, nice one. Grass. Leafeon GX. Very cool. Oh, wow, David. That's a nice bet. That's a good start for you. <laughs> nice Leafeon. There you go, Grass. Good start for you for sure, David. That's, that's always correct, Ryan. They love to do that on their social media, their Discord, all of the above. Yep. Rosalia. Drampa Hollow. Nice one. Basic. <laughs> Nick and David are not quite on the same page there. You guys forgot to correlate your bets. Not quite on the same page there. Yeah, not looking fantastic, Nick. You're correct. But lots of time still. Obama Snow. Punch Crow. You need some scoring. <laughs> David, you don't need the scoring, though. <laughs> you don't need the scoring. All right, next pack. Good luck, guys. See something flashy back there. Ooh, very cool. That is a full art Celesteela GX. That is sick. Jacob. Or who is it on that metal spot? I think it was Jacob. Could be wrong. Metal. Oh, Paul. Excuse me. Paul with metal. Very nice. The other triple combo. Wow. Check that out, Paul. Celesteela. One of my favorite Pokemons. <laughs> Look at him, man. Sella Stila Full Art. Very cool, Paul. Nice hit, man. And that triple combo. Very nice. It's the one you don't see every day there, that's for sure. Great detail. He's got that little mustache. Really funny card. It is a ton. Yeah, that's correct, David. I probably would have sided with you there. I hadn't even looked at the lines or anything, but that is a ton of points. Got a print plup and a Hippodon. I sell a steal. Very cool. Luxio, Rose Raid. That game was nuts, man. That game was nuts, Ryan. Last one of the first half here, guys. Not what I expected, Ryan, that's for sure. Uh, Pokemon Fan Club, Reverse Hollow, and Frost Rotom. All right, second half, guys. Good luck. Ultra Prism. Uh, I don't know what we should do next. Unified or Burning Shadows? Hmm. I think we'll do Burning Shadows next. Burning Shadows next here. Ooh, see something flashy. Ooh, very cool. Whoa. Rainbow. Feromosa GX. That is sick looking. 
grass type. Very cool card. Wow, look at that rainbow background pattern as well. Fair Omosa. That is a rainbow GX. There you go, grass. Wow, awesome card. <laughs> Certainly one we've never seen on the channel before. Uh, likely one that the grass spot did not have in their collection. Very cool. Look at that. Awesome details on that guy. I love checking out some of the older cards we don't get to see too often. Very nice. Piplup and a Lowland Sand Slash. Oh, nice, David. There you go. Congrats. Nice card. Really cool card. The Jackson Mahomes effect is wearing off on Patrick. It's wearing off. All right, Gabbit. Cosmog Infinerate. Very cool. That's a hollow. Fire. There you go. Nice rainbow. Let's find a gold here in the box as well. Maybe a full art trainer. All those things. Mars. Salazzle. Yeah, that's a nice grass type hit. Grass and water are kind of going to be those energies that got a little bit of something in all the sets. So not a bad one to land at all. Fan Rotom. Frost Rotom. That's right. The Rotoms are in a Sun and Moon series. That's right. <laughs> right flip, right. Is it box topper time? This guy. <laughs> this guy. All right, next pack, guys. Got ourselves a, ooh, nice. Prism Star, super boost energy. Funky looking special energy hit there for Jimmy. Really funky looking. There you go. Ooh, and a Glaceon, nice. Water. Nice. I just love seeing these designs we don't always see. Check out the colors here. It's like a magic card. Very cool. And then Glaceon GX. Water type there on the Glaceon. There's uh, many Glaceons we've seen on the channel. Most of them um, coming out of Evolving Skies. Nice to see one out of Ultra Prism. We got here Palkia, nice, very cool. Had Dialga earlier. There you go, Dragon Palkia GX. Nice one. Congrats, Derek. Another one for you. Very cool GX there. Uh, no, Ryan. I do know the answer to that. There will not be box toppers. Whatever that short print card might be, Ryan. It'll be obtainable in every single pack, much like Nightfall. Uh, there will not be box toppers. So do you know the answer? Don't remember when they released that, but they did already release that info. Garchomp, nice one. Very cool. I always loved Garchomp. Nice. So I think a lot of people are happy about that. The Nightfall style of pulling the short print compared to the Cryptid Nation style of pulling the short prints. Skateboard, Magarna, nice. Yeah, box toppers are kind of whatever. I kind of agree with that. Box toppers are kind of whatever. It's awesome if you do hit the chase card, and there's like one or two other cards that look fantastic, but the rest of them are kind of a buzzkill, unfortunately. Magnemite, Luxray, that's a hollow. Wow, cool looking card, Electric. Camera thinks so as well. Nice, there you go. I do like the concept of it. I think it could be better executed, Ryan. I like the concept, though. It could be better executed. Like, they could do way better on certain box toppers. Like, stars, ocean. Those are really lacking compared to some of the other ones. So, I would just like to see a little bit more effort, I guess. If they wanted to go ahead and use that strategy. Wash Rotom. I just feel like, like I said, that they could do better on stuff like that. Ooh, Chief's touchdown. There you go, Nick. Sorry, David. <laughs> You're still looking all right, though, David, with that 13. So, not too stressed yet. Low punny. Araquanid. 
like I said, I do like them. I just think that there's a couple, um, about half of them. Oh, wow, that was a flashy play. What the heck? He just underhanded that. <laughs> That's crazy. Wow. Oh, Mahomes. Whoa, very cool, Jimmy. Full art trainer, Volkner. That is sick, Jimmy. Congrats. There you go, man, out of Ultra Prism. Volkner, full art trainer. That is certainly another card I've never pulled before. Very sick. Congrats. Really nice. Congrats on that, Jimmy. This has been a good box. Had a rainbow and now a nice trainer. The trainer cards specifically in Sun and Moon as well, Dan, are great. Are great in Sun and Moon. Congrats, Jimmy. Nice one, man. Some really awesome trainers in these sets. You got red and blue in one of the sets. You got um, Cynthia across some, Lily across some. Uh, Salandit, Electrive. But overall, a solid box here, guys. Congrats. Got that rainbow, got that trainer. That's nice. Had some other hits as well. Let's see if we can grab one or two more here at the end. Good luck, everyone. Good start, though. Executor, Heat, Rotom. Sun and Moon sets definitely um, known to have just a little bit less. A little bit less. Um, in terms of, like, your overall hits. Just a little bit less. Not too much of a difference. Lunala. Very cool. Psychic. Prism Star Lunala. Nice. There you go. Psychic. Type Null behind that. I, I wish it was Loch Ness Monster, Dan. I don't think it's going to be Loch Ness Monster, though. I saw that they were releasing an exclusive Loch Ness Monster card in, I think it was the UK. I could be wrong about that location, but there was an exclusive one coming to cert a certain region. It might have been the UK. I don't remember, um, but I wish it was, man. Loch Ness Monster would be so sick to have a card of, especially to chase after like that. Hippodon, Magmortar. No one wants to place their bet as New Scratch. <laughs> no New Scratch. And the last one of Ultra Prism. We'll do Unified. Or no, we'll do uh, Burning Shadows next. We'll do Burning Shadows. Save Unified for the end. Heat Ran Hollow. Nice. Ooh, that would be sweet present. All right, let's do Burning Shadows. Good luck. Move that quick. Get into it. That's what I thought as well, Ryan. That's what I thought as well. Something along those lines. Yep. I thought that as well. All right. Yeah, Daniel, exactly. This is your box now. Exactly. Really hoping, man, to see that big rainbow, Daniel. It's one I've never had the opportunity to hold. So really hoping for it for you. Good luck, man. Exactly. This is a big one, though, for fire. Huge chase here. Hootoot. Nine tails. Especially if it does happen to come out of the pack in mint condition. I, do, I, um, I agree with that flip, but they already had Bigfoot. But I agree with that. That was what I was like thinking in my head. But then I was like, wait, they have Bigfoot. Shinotic. But other than that, I wish it could be Bigfoot still. Charmeleon reverse. Very cool. Eradicate. Charmeleon Reverse Hollow. Sandy Gas and Bruxish. Turtinator, nice. Palo Sand Non Hollow. That would be sick, Ryan. Oh my goodness, that would be crazy, Ryan. Got Tapu Fini GX. Water. There you go, water. 
Yeah, that would be super fantastic, Ryan. I hope that could happen, man. Genuinely, I hope that could happen. There'd be some nuts stuff, man. Alright, come on, man. Getting ready for a big hit for Daniel. Salazzle GX. There you go, fire. Salazzle. Hopefully it's a fire box. There we go. Goes him up. Reverse. Persian. Rare. Ooh, nearly a huge play for Kansas City again. Wow. This is the game I'm looking for, though. 7-7 seven, seven right now. This is what I'm looking for. Rabombi, Pasmussen. That's kind of what I had thought, Ryan. That's what I had seen, and that's what I had thought. Once they got their way over to Europe. That's what I thought, man. Yep. Thought so. As you Merrill. Which means that it might be kind of tough to get those cards here. So, they're probably going to have some great value, I have a feeling. If they are indeed tough to acquire over here. Slow King, Reverse Rare. Very cool. Arachnid. Acerola at the back. Porygon. Oh, very cool. Another trainer. That's going to be Kiawi. Or Kiao. Very nice. Full Art Trainer. Jimmy. Congrats. Another one now. Kiawi. Very cool. Yes, Dan. Yes, sir. There you go, Jimmy. That looks awesome as well. Nice, man. Good card to pull out of burning. Congrats on that one. Keep these going here, guys. There he is again at the back of the pack. Uh, Raiolu, beware. Kiaway, Kiaway. Look at it again. Kiaway, I could see that. I could definitely see that, Ross. Thank you. Simisei, try Chew Hollow. Very nice. Cool card there, electric. He's going, guys. Good luck on him. Another hit here, it looks like. Oh, very nice looking card. That's a full art. Tapu Fini GX. Nice one, water. Fancy looking water type hit there. Congrats on your Tapu Fini. Full art hit for water. Very cool card. Wishful Baton at the end. Solid first half. Closing it out. Couple left in the first half still. Araquanid and Turtonator. Heat more. Caterpie. Electros. Alright, last one. Half number one. Good luck here. Burning Shadows, Whirlipede, and Hair across there. Half number two of Burning. Good luck. No rainbow yet. Let's find it in the second half. We did have a trainer, though. Nice to see that. Did have a trainer. Got Escape Rope Reverse. Darkrai Hollow. Very nice. Very uh, very solid card for Dark. Yo, what's up, Chris? What's up, man? We are um, ripping through right now. Uh, the triple sun and moon breaks. So we started with Ultra Prism. Right now we're working on a Burning Shadows booster. And then we got a Unified Minds booster at the end. So we started out with Ultra. Working on Burning Shadows right now. And then Unified Minds after. <clears throat> and then we got an Evolving Skies full case coming up after. 
Uh, cure the up. Crabominable. Nice. Yeah, they are tough to pull, Ross. Yeah, in terms of the pull rate, correct. Hence why they have such an extreme value. Um, some of those bigger cards, like the Rainbow Charizard and stuff. Exactly, though. It is one of the toughest ever sets uh, in terms of hitting the big chase. Yep, I would agree. Pan Sage, Mudsdale. Hence why that one is... I mean, like I said, I think the last sold uh, Rainbow Charizard I saw was a PSA 10 for 2500 which is... Or, like, right around that, which is pretty dang extreme. Electros, Tan Growth. But it comes with the rarity, of course, of pulling one. Lolan Vulpix Reverse, Kingdra Hollow, very nice. That's not even bad, Ross. That's not even bad. I think a Burning Shadows pack on the market is like a $10 pack, so it's not bad at all. Rhyhorn Reverse. Ooh, Fairy type getting in on the fun. Gardevoir GX. Here you go, Fairy. Nice card, Gardevoir GX. Camera does not like Gardevoir. <laughs> Come on. Yeah, I don't think it's going to work with Gardevoir. <laughs> Too much going on. They said nope. Get it back into focus with an energy. Come on, camera. Grab it. I think it's grabbing Pikachu. Get out of here. There it goes. Nice. There's that Gardevoir again. Beauty for Fairy. Sorry, Pikachu. Making the camera funky, man. Got Gloom, Ladian. Vanipede Reverse, Malamar, non hollow. Bufflint. The Burning Shadows packs as well, they kind of just like fall apart. They're like butter. <laughs> really easy to open. Fairy Cross Reverse. That's a reverse rare and Toxicroak. Cool looking Pikachu at the start of the pack. Wishful Baton. Ooh, wow! That is sick looking! Rainbow! Salazzle GX! Wow, not the fire type rainbow we were hoping for, but still, Salazzle GX. Rainbow rare for fire. Congrats! Two for two on rainbows. That's very nice in Sun and Moon. Two for two on rainbows and trainers. It's actually really good. Congrats, I actually love the look of Salazzle here. Congrats on that, Daniel. Nice. Comes from Salandit, of course. Wow, really cool. That is a clean looking card. Once again, it's got a really nice rainbow background. Look at the background. Nice, Daniel, congrats. Nice rainbow fire hit. Not quite the rainbow fire hit, but still a sweet looking card. And one I've never pulled before, very nice. Congrats, Daniel. Nice one. Really good stuff there. Dusclops, Sloking. Bodybuilding Dumbbells. Ooh, Hollow Gyarados. Nice one, Water. Hollow Gyarados, very cool. So 
close out the burning, and then we've got a unified mines, guys. Look on the rust here. Soul Rock Weevil. Nice. Tormenting Spray. Got Ladyba and Scolipede Rare. Electabuzz. Electrive. Butterfree. Oh, wow, the Chiefs are alive and well, it looks like. Jeez. Alive and well all of a sudden. Uh, Cutie Fly. Dusk Nor. That's a hollow. Psychic type on that hollow. Then we got two remaining on the Burning Shadows, and then we will get to Unified Minds to close this breakout, guys. Good luck on the rest here. Let's find another nice rainbow as we close out the break. Electric Heracross. Charmeleon and the last. Burning Shadows pack. Good luck on the end. Metapod and Electros. Yeah, I was going to say, Nick, you still need one more, though. <laughs> All right, and let's close it out, guys. Unified Minds. Good luck. Get this box going. Of Unified Minds. Best of luck here. Lots of awesome tag teams. You got the Mew and Mewtwo. Um, and a handful of others as well in the set. But Mewtwo and Mew is going to be one of the most sick, I would say. All right. Closing it out, guys. Unified Minds. Good luck. Hey, Sizzle, how's it going? Uh, see Waddle, Salazzle, Lion Nuts. Move that a little bit. Uh, Young Goose, Scrafty. Slackoth Reverse, very cool. Hoopa Hollow, nice. That's fair, David, that's fair. Yeah, that's a good point. That's a good point. It wouldn't. Move on to the next one, right? Let's take it, move on to the next one. Yeah, that is true. It wasn't looking so great just a few minutes ago. Uh, we got Mag Mortar. Catcher, nice reverse. Gladius. Misty's favor. Forgot that's in the set. Jeez, that's a crazy card to hit. Misty's favor. Got a Noibat. Ooh, that's awesome. Psychic. Jirachi GX. Nice. Congrats, Psychic. Awesome, Jirachi. Another one we don't see too many cards of. Only in Vivid Voltage, really. That amazing rare. Nice one there, Psychic. Jirachi GX, very cool. What was that play by Big Ben? That handoff was horrible. I'm a little bit behind, probably. <laughs> that handoff was awful. Like the 140 mark. Uh, Talonflame and Archeops, nice, fighting. Dynamo Reverse, Steelix, Bib Bibarel. Yeah, I was going to say, Ryan, I caught like the, the very end of it. I just saw the handoff. I didn't see the snap, but the handoff was laughable. Ooh, cool Pikachu again for Electric. Magnemite Obama Snow. Just like, what is going on here? All right, feeling a hit in this one. Good luck, guys. Let's find it. There's that hit at. Uh, Lurantis, that is a Sil Valley Hollow for basic. 
There you go, basic. Swad. Payukamuku. Oh, I saw the play right there, Nick. Araquanid. I saw the play right there. <clears throat> you do indeed have a chance. Yeah, they need the field goal. That's crazy, Nick. That one was looking really unfortunate after the first quarter, Nick. Pretty much like one of those where you almost forget about it. Move on. <laughs> but yeah, somehow it has life now. Necrozma. Neuvern. Come on, it's been a little bit of a colder Unified. Let's pick up the Unified box a little bit. Other boxes were treating us right. Had the Rainbow and Trainers. Hair in each. Let's do that now with Unified. Come on. Ooh, Tyree killed that. Had to hurt. Got. Wow, nice hit. Dragonite EX. Or uh, GX, excuse me. Dragonite GX. Congrats. Very nice. There you go. Dragon Energy. Very cool on your Dragonites. Congrats on that one. Nice card. I think he had Chiefs minus seven first half. So that's what it's sitting at right now. <laughs> uh, Cosmog, Gumshoes. But like I said, it was, ooh, Pokey Maniac. That's cool, forgot that's in the set. Like I said, that was one that was looking really unfortunate after the first quarter. Now it's looking just fine. Drapion Reverse, Zerkatry. Come on, Unify, there we go. Uh, Haxorus? Wow, that's awesome! Full Art Aerodactyl! Nice! That is sick! Congrats, fighting. Aerodactyl full art. Wow, that is flashy. Look at that, guys. Full art Aerodactyl. Very cool. Congrats, fighting. Looks great there. Aerodactyl GX. Wow, very sick. Yo, what's up, Brett? How's it going, man? How are you doing, Brett? Congrats on your Aerodactyl GX. Very nice. Fighting. Ah, gotcha, Nick. Gotcha. Yeah, always nice to get halfway. Exactly. Makes you feel pretty good. <laughs> For sure, man. All right. Little bit remaining on the first half. Nice Aerodactyl fighting type. Congrats. Heating up another hit here. Whoa! <laughs> no way! Rainbow Aerodactyl GX! <laughs> no way! Solid. Congrats! Fighting! Very nice, Jacob. Couple of Aerodactyls coming your way. That's a sick Pokemon, man. Congrats. A full art following that up with the rainbow. Very nice, man. There you go, Jacob. Nice hits. Really nice hit. Congrats on that, Jacob. Couple in a row on those Aerodactyls. Unidentified Fossil. Thanks, Brett. It's been a fun night, man. It's been a fun evening. Appreciate you, man. Plants Quiz Show, Driftblim. Second half, guys. Good luck. Every box has had a rainbow. That's really good with sun and moon. You could definitely go like one for three, two for three in terms of rainbows. So it's nice to see every box have one. Lucario fighting again. That's awesome. The stuff you like to see. Let's see if we can grab a trainer out of this one. The first two also had trainers. We still need our first tag team. There it is. Raichu and Alolan Raichu. Nice one. Electric. Nice. Paul. Congrats on your Raichu and Alolan Raichu. 
beautiful card. That's Raichu there on the left. Alolan Raichu, the darker colored one on the right. Very cool, Paul. Electric on that triple combo. Nice, man. There you go. Solid card there. Touchdown. I missed it. I flipped over to the results. I missed the touchdown. Refresh. Open. Hone Edge. Excadrill. Yo, nice, Nick. Congrats. Congrats. It stays alive. Kelsey, though, man. Kelsey and Hill are just pretty much impossible to cover. So... Yeah, you just don't need the kick return, Nick. No kick return. Type Null, Leavni. Should just be a Neil, though. <laughs> but that's quite the comeback there, Nick. Quite the comeback. All right, and a little bit left, guys. We got about 10 more unified packs. Shroomish. Terrakeen, that's a hollow. Terrakeen, hollow. Munchlax at the back. Pikachu there. Pit Dove, Reverse, Salazzle. That Salazzle earlier for Daniel. Oh, wow, that was a huge play by Kelsey. Just saw it again. Grimsley, Frostlass, Hollow for water. Final score over 47. Well, now that's looking better and better with... Uh, more points being added there at the end of the half. So nice. Um, ooh, nice one. Psychic. Latios GX. There you go, Jacob. Nice Psychic type hit. Congrats on your Latios GX. Nice card there. Type Null. Uh, let me move this stack of codes really quick. Up everywhere. Wow, that's really nice, Nick. Good luck. That is nice. Hopefully, it uh, stays on track for you, man. Blizzard Town Reverse Stadium and a Drift Limb. Evolving Full Case up next tonight, and then Personals, guys. Dual Blade and Zygarde. Dang, dang, Dan. That's always the worst when you need something, but then the players hurt. That's always the worst. Can't even, like, cheer for anything, man. Tauros, Honchcrow. Cool, Honchcrow coming up in the new set. Check that one out. Coach Trainer. Nice. Pikachu on there. Scraggy, Drapion. Come on, one more big hit at the end of the unified box. Good luck. Last, Alolan Marowak. That's sweet. There you go, Psychic. Exactly, Brett. One more boom. Exactly. Yan Mega Toxapex. I want to see one more really nice card from Unified here. As we do get to the end of it. Turtwega and Lipart. Pretty cool turtle card there. Toxapex. Ooh, Hollow Celebi. Nice. Really cool. Here you go, David. Definitely not one you see every day. Hollow Celebi. Nice. Oh, we got two packs left. Good luck to you guys. No way! Aerodactyl GX! <laughs> He's everywhere in the box. Aerodactyl kind of box. 
Well, there you go. Fighting. That's awesome. You got a whole trio of Aerodactyls. Three different ones. There you go. Aerodactyl GX. And the last pack here, guys. Good luck on it. Let's see what we got at the end. Got a Pikachu there, Wyvettel, and a Moongus. Three Loon. All right, thanks again, everyone, for joining that triple Sun and Moon booster box break. We appreciate that, guys. We'll get those all protected and sent right out to you. Thank you again. Really fun stuff with that one. I love having the chance to rip some of those Sun and Moon sets. Hey, thanks, Daniel. I'm glad you had fun, man. Glad you had fun. Like I said, don't always get the opportunity to rip so much um, sun and moon like that at one time. So thank you again, guys, for filling that one up. And hope you enjoyed. That was a good time. Three rainbows. That's really nice. Three rainbows is really nice for three sun and moon boxes. It can be tough to find rainbows that consistently. Can be tough. So nice to see him popping out like that. All right, that leaves us with just the Evolving Skies full case here tonight, guys. I'm going to get it all set up for you. I will do that random, and then I'm going to go get some water before we get into it. But sweet there. Thank you again, guys. Dragon on the next break, Daniel, you're hoping for? Do my best. Do my very best. <laughs> That's a good one to land. Dark is also a really, really elite energy to have for this uh, break, this next one. Hey, Ryan, thank you, man. Appreciate it. Personal's all night tomorrow, so yep, feel free to stop by. Um, 6 p.m. to 2 a.m. tomorrow night. The whole night, we're just ripping personals. Uh, maybe an on-the-fly break, but yeah, pretty much all personals. But sweet, Ryan, thanks for hanging out with us. Appreciate it. Hope you enjoyed the Sun and Moon packs. It's fun ripping those, man. Here we go, that evolving full case. Sweet. Beautiful evolving full case. Oh, how I've missed you. Nice couple of orders are coming in for personals as well. Thank you guys on those personal orders. Appreciate those. Let me get that evolving full case set up the random quick. Like I said, I'll do the random quick. And then I'm just gonna fill up on water and we'll get right to it. Lucky number seven on the full case breaks. What can it have for us? Got the seven names. Seven energy. Good luck on it, everyone. All right, let's do this. How's it going, everyone? Caleb here with Layton Gaming. Next break of the night, gonna be Evolving Skies. Full case, uh, six booster box break number seven. Good luck, let's get this one going here. Appreciate you guys as always. That's the energies, that's the names. Here we go. It is a seven spot break. Let's get this underway. Roll the dice. Uh, five here on the names and then the energy. Get ourselves one, two, three, four, and five. Got Nicole B at the top, Justin T at the bottom. Five on energy. Good luck here. I will match them up, read them off. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, grass at the top, Psychic at the bottom. Names and energy. Good luck. There we go. There's one. There is two. All right. Nicole B, you're going to have grass energy. Daniel H with that trainer spot. Jacob P, quad combo, electric, basic, fire and fighting. Uh, David G, you're going to have dark energy. Kyle M with dragon energy. Jamin L, water, and Justin T, psychic energy. Good luck. We'll get this one going in just a minute, guys. Appreciate you all joining. Let me get those results on to the website quick. First time you've gotten trainer, Daniel. Wow, that's surprising. That's surprising. 
<laughs> You've gone a long time without landing it, I would say. Well, hopefully we can grab you a couple of cards to add to your collection. Maybe a couple of really cool ones, hopefully. We can get those golds, those rainbow trainers. Uh, the gold is our items and stadiums, of course. Rainbow trainers and then full art trainers as well. Usually get grass, that's funny. <laughs> that is funny. Trainer's not bad. I wouldn't say it's huge and evolving. It's not bad, but it's not huge. I would say that the top is Dark Psychic and Dragon by a good bit. Dark Psychic and Dragon, definitely the top. Water and Grass shortly after that, and Trainer probably falls in that tier. All right, I'll be right back, and we can get it going, guys. Get my water bottle. Thank you again. Appreciate it. Yeah, it's not one of the top ones. Like, it's not good, but um, it's not horrible. There's other sets where Trainer can definitely be better, though. All right, I'll be right back. That seems true, actually, what David said. That seems really true. <clears throat> what David said seems really true, actually. Trainer seems to do really well when there are no alt arts. That seems really true. Like, if there's not an alt art in the box, then maybe there's going to be a trainer. I feel like that's somewhat correct. Ah, uh, yes, yeah, so we have personals coming up after that, Mike. Personals after that tonight. Uh, so... Personals queue tonight is not too bad. I'm going to check it quick before we get into this. Actually, it's decently long. Uh, Cryptid Nation 2nd Edition, a pair of those in Personals. Um, a Hidden Fate CTB in Personals. Sword and Shield Booster Pack Mixer in Personals. 
uh, Charizard Chaser, and three more Charizard Chasers. Nice. So yes, at about 11, about an hour from now. Okay, so it'll take about an hour to rip. Okay, guys, good luck. Let's get to it. <laughs> fair, Ryan, fair. Tough to turn it off, man. It's a great product to watch. Tough to turn it off. All right, good luck. Let's do it. How's it going, everyone? Caleb here with Layton Gaming. This time for Evol uh, this time we're gonna be ripping the Evolving Skies booster box. <laughs> I'm not sure what I was going for there. Um, appreciate you guys as always for joining. Here is the full case. You can see it on the top left as well. Um, and here are your results. Just did that random for you. <clears throat> All right, good luck. Let's do it. Yeah, that's awesome, Ryan. We'll have that shipped out to you, I think, maybe leaving tomorrow? I don't remember. I think early tomorrow that leaves us. All right, good luck. Let me get this case ripped open quick. Here we go, Evolving Skies inside. Not G.I. Joe, believe it or not. No G.I. Joe in this case. Only Evolving Skies. Dang it. Dang it, man. Here we go. One more. There we go. Empty, of course. That's six. G.I. Joe not included. Unfortunately. <laughs> uh, let me move these a little bit over. And good luck. Show you the results one more time. In case you missed it. And let's get it underway, everyone. Best of luck here. Let's do this. Let's do this. <laughs> fair, oh fair. I guess I'm making an early assumption. <laughs> oh man. And evolving skies. Look at that. No GI Joe. Dang it. All right, good luck. GI Joe might even be more valuable at this point. <laughs> Believe it or not. It's just nuts, man. How do these things happen? Started out with the Trevenant VMAX tonight. There we go, Grass, first hit, out. Trevenant VMAX, to get going on the full case. Move that there, move that there. Yeah, ready to rip, 216 Evolving Skies packs, guys. Good luck on these 216, of course, in that full case. And like I said, personals following this start at 11. If you're looking for a personal, get that order in. Uh, the queue is about one hour right now. I'll be ripping until two at the very latest. If you're not looking to wait until the uh, end of the night tonight, feel free to catch us again tomorrow for another round of personals starting at 6 p.m. That's kind of funny, Jacob. Dagon, Talonflame. The funny thing about that, Jacob, is I like have no order that I pull those booster boxes out of the case in. Like I kind of just grab them. So it's likely that I'm grabbing a different booster box to open first every time. Crustal, wishy-washy. So that's just like super, super random, Jacob. But I feel like I remember that on the last case. <laughs> I feel like you're right. Uh, Glaceon, here you go, water. Glaceon B. Yeah, I swear I remember that now that you say it. It's pretty funny. Uh, Snow Leaf Badge, Tropius. See how many alt arts we can find in the case. Hopefully a few guys. Lantern, Altaria. Seen anywhere between one and seven in a full case. So you just never know until you get to the end. Uh, chilling Rain, Brett. Chilling Rain. <clears throat> Ooh, Zanaya's Resolve. There you go. Full art trainer. Nice. Good start. There you go, Daniel. Zanaya's Resolve. Full art trainer for you. Very cool. Nice start, man. Yeah, Chilling Rain's got that guy, Brett. Chilling Rain's got a handful of other great sets as well. Or great cards. You got the Calyrex alt arts. You've got the Legendary Bird alt arts. Uh, Thievel. Yeah, we shall see, Jacob. We shall see. Zorarkalo. <coughs> Let's 
see if that theory does improve, uh, indeed prove to be correct. Shall see. Teddy Ursang, Sharpedo. Ice Q at the back. Stoutland Smeargle. Got very nice. Rainbow, Leafeon, VMAX. Congrats. Grass spot, great start. There you go. Congrats on that one. Nice start, Nicole. Very cool card there. Rainbow, Leafeon. Nice. It's been a great box so far, guys. Let's keep this up. Trainer and a rainbow already. Nice. VMAX as well. Solid stuff so far. Hypno, Zapdos Hollow. Congrats on that one, Grass. Uh, Ampharos. <clears throat> Another Ampharos and Gorgeous. Drampa. Got a full art Noivern. Very nice dragon type hits. Congrats, dragon. Making the way around to a bunch of different energies here at the start. Congrats on that one, dragon type. Lots of energies getting in on the fun already. Nice. Sharpedo and Sharpedo. Couple there. Got a Trevenant V. Grass type. Uh, Fletchender, Apple Pie. Hydrogen Hollow for Dragon. Here you go, Dragon Sight. Hydrogen. Gorgeous Pincer. Uh, Marshadow Shadow Hollow, Psychic. Chiefs got out to a very slow start, but they are taking care of business now. Uh, Talon Flame there. They are absolutely taking care of business all of a sudden. Uh, got a Derilodon V Max. Nice. Dragon Sight. Another one for you. Derilodon V Max. Wow. Big touchdown there. Jeez. Psyduck, Redrago, Hollow. Lucky Ice Poppin', Flapple. Uh, Moon and Sun Badge, Ampharos. I didn't get a good look at it yet. Uh... Jacob, I didn't get a good look at the end of the play for Tyreek Hill there. Oh, it does look like his elbow definitely hit. <laughs> the cartwheel is more impressive. Fair, Brett. <laughs> Fair. I don't disagree, man. That guy is a crazy athlete. Uh, Drampa. And got a big teeny hollow. Just an absolutely ridiculous athlete, the stuff he can do. You'll often see him, like, field a punt and then start running backwards. Uh, Sableye Lilligant. Or, like, running sideways instead of just going forward like most. Crazy, man. Got some extreme confidence to do stuff like that. Got a SB on V. Psychic. Snow Leaf Badge. And we got two left in the box. 
Uh, Fletchling, Appleton. Zuelius. Flababy and Feeble. All right, next box, good luck. Move the ball quick. Sun badge, Gigalith. Full face guard there. Ah, uh, Pincer. Good old Pincer. <clears throat> Moltres hollow. There you go, Dark. Moltres, nice. Guys, like I said, I will be ripping the personals tonight following uh, Rubber Gloves and Smeargle. Following this group break here, this is our last group break of the evening. Uh, personals begin after this, like I said. And those will be going for a few hours. So if you're looking for something uh, to rip for a personal, I would encourage you to get an order in soon. LatenGaming.com uh, for a personal. The current queue is about one hour. So if you do place an order, it would rip about midnight Eastern time. Um, and if you're not down to wait for... Um, that time tonight uh, we do have personals again tomorrow night starting at 6 p.m. Eastern so if you do place an order um, anytime after the stream tonight uh, up until the stream tomorrow of course anti hollow it would rip tomorrow night then for you starting at 6 p.m. and of course it is Sunday night so some people probably getting ready to go back to work and stuff tomorrow so might not be staying up till the end of the night let's give you that option as well we got a Leafeon. There you go, grass type. Best Pokemon card I've ever opened. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> That's tough. That's pretty tough. Maybe the Hidden Fates Charizard. Hidden Fates Charizard is definitely up there. I've pulled a couple of Evolutions Charizards, the Hollow, that I think would be PSA 10s. Altaria. Not sure if um, any of those have actually been graded a PSA 10 yet. Uh, that would be a pretty big one if it did grade a 10. But the, uh, ooh, Glaceon V, full art, water. Nice, congrats water. Beautiful full art Glaceon. That's probably one of the bigger ones, I would say. That Hidden Fates Charizard. The shiny, of course. What about you, Kate? No way, the lineman touchdown, oh my goodness. A lineman touchdown. Marie Thievel. Oof, the Steelers defenders look hurt. <laughs> the lineman touchdown. I've never seen such an extreme celebration. Wow. Golduck Sharpedo. Got Rayquaza. There you go, Dragon. Rayquaza V. Nice. Flame and Redrago Hollow. Yeah, Chiefs are taking care of business right now, guys. They are taking care of business. Uh, Smeargle again. Pumpkaboo and Froze. Hypno. Keep these going, guys. Wubat and Gorgeous. Dialga Hollow. All right, that closes out that half. Box two. Second half here. Yeah, that's what I was just thinking, Ryan. It's kind of sad to think that most quarterbacks, Rajaliki Hollow, lose their last game. Most quarterbacks lose their last game. Tough to think about that, but 
That's what it's looking like for Big Ben here tonight. I was just thinking about that. Those quarterbacks do unfortunately lose that last one. Wishy-washy. I still can't believe the lineman just got a touchdown. It's one of the best defenses in the league. <laughs> uh, Stoutland, Stoutland, couple. Got Garbage RV. Very nice. Elway and Manning, some of the only ones to ever do it, Jacob. Gotcha. I didn't know if there was any examples. But like I said, that would leave most other quarterbacks with uh, their career ending on a loss. But Elway and Manning sounds like a couple that broke that rule. Nice. I didn't even know that, honestly. Totally forgot that they had retired... Uh, it's surprising that Peyton retired after a Super Bowl. Tropius. No way. The Chiefs just got the ball back on a fumble there. No way they have the ball. If that was a fumble, that is game over. Amphros. Wow, very nice. Turfield Stadium. Bold card. Congrats, Daniel. I love gold. Beautiful gold turf field stadium. Nice, Daniel. <clears throat> Congrats, couple of them. Couple of hits coming your way now. Nice trainer earlier. And a gold there. Oh, that is for sure gotta be a fumble, right? No way that's not. Jeez. <laughs> Unbelievable. Got Glaceon VMAX for water. There you go. <laughs> no way, there's another touchdown right after. Yeah, I'm like a minute behind, Brett. I'm like a minute behind or a two minutes behind, maybe. <laughs> oh, man. Game over. Sharpedo Flapple. Unfortunately, too. Unfortunately. Uh, Tentacruel and Talon Flame. Wishy-washy there. Uh, big teeny hollow. Guys, remember the Almanac breaks about six days from today. Almanac will be breaking six days from today. Gorgeous. Pincer. Huge cards to chase after in the volume number two of the Gaming Almanac. Um, and yeah, like I said, six days away now. Getting closer and closer, slowly but surely. Uh, Elteria. Yeah, he's gonna get like, it's gonna be a blowout, it looks like, Sean. That's what I mean, it's gonna be a bad one. Elteria, Stoutland. That's why I already declared game over here, <laughs> unfortunately. Yeah, we gotta hit David a nice Umbreon, um, considering his, uh, Bet is no longer any good. Espion B. Very nice. Is there an all English almanac? Uh, probably not. Probably not. It takes quite a while to put together an almanac. Zygarde Hollow. So it's very unlikely we would ever have one that's just all English. I mean, it's probably only... I would say it's probably 80% English. I'd say it's probably 80% English, something like that. Cragnal, Sharpedo, uh, but yeah, certainly not all. And I think it would be pretty tough to build one all English. <clears throat> all right, let's do this. Next one here. Dang, sorry, Chris. Yeah, you gotta kind of look away, man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. The next uh, almanac that we do have planned, Jacob, is gonna be volume three. That's gonna be like a no rules almanac, kind of, where there's gonna be some other TCGs there's going to be some non-graded stuff. There's going to be some sealed stuff. So it would be quite a while before we ever got to um, an all-English almanac at this point. It would at least have to be in volume number four at this point. Um, but then it would even be weird to go back 
uh, because the next one, like I said, is going to have those other uh, TCGs included, which will be really exciting. Some meta zoo and flesh and blood and stuff. Yeah, I would estimate that this next one's about 80% English. Uh, copycat Goler. He started out for Psychic. Nice. Maybe even a little bit more. Maybe 85%. 85 of the 100 cards. Pumpkaboo, Flapple. Uh, those other ones would be... It's like three Chinese cards and like 12 Japanese, I think. Something about that. Shift tree. Maybe 15 Japanese. Maybe 10 Japanese. Something like that. But I think there's three Chinese. And then nothing else besides English beyond that. Zygarde and Tai Hollow. Nice, David. Well, hopefully it's just the Steelers that get a bunch of garbage time, David. And then they can somehow grab that, you know, grab the loss by like 12 or something. Elteria. <clears throat> so certainly not dead yet, but getting tougher and tougher as the Chiefs just keep looking better and better in this game. Bebass, my low tick. Come on, ults. Come on, come on. I uh, got Volcarona V. Very nice. <coughs> there it is. Felt that one coming. No, that that's fair. That's fair, actually. They cannot, Jacob. <laughs> Uh, Sylveon VMAX. Nice. Psychic type hit there. That is true, man. They can't gain a yard. There you go. Sylveon VMAX. Raichu Hollow. Electric type. <clears throat> Boost Shake. Talon Flame. <clears throat> uh, Flapple. Salamance, Seismitoad. Yeah, they've had their struggles this year, Jacob. They have. They just barely snuck in. They really had a hot streak at the end of the year. Hippodon, Thievel. Articuno Hollow. None yet, Brett. None yet. Rainbows and gold so far. We had a Leafy on Rainbow. Sharpedo there. Had a Leafy on Rainbow. A couple of Full Art Trainers. Um, gold Stadium. Or one full art trainer, Gold Stadium. Rayquaza V. Yeah, probably closing in on one, I would think. Probably closing in. Hypothetically. Rainbow Leafeon taking home the, the big prize right now, though. Pincer. Pincer and Flapple. Second half here, guys. Box three. Personals will be ripping after this break here tonight, guys. Uh, apple pie, apple pie. Couple there. Crystal cave. You're guessing Metacham, and you're guessing one. Floetti, Sharpedo. I'm going to guess three still. I think we're still going to get to that three somehow. That's my guess. You're thinking one. Got Snow Leaf Badge. Giggle it. Thinking we're going to heat up. <clears throat> Cragnal. Ludicolo Hollow. Water type there. My low ticket Drampa. 
We're calling a rainbow aroma lady as well. <laughs> You're making some really bold predictions, some very specific predictions. Got a Glaceon VMAX. Another one there. <laughs> Fresco and Noivern. I like the Noivern. That's the Batman card. Good guess, yeah. Got Papla Toad Gorgeous. Uh, my low tick. Got Lycan Rock V. Fighting type there. Lycan Rock. Nice one, fighting. What's up, JN? How's your night going, JN? Nuzleaf Lilligant. How is your night going? Dialga Hollow. Nice, good to hear. Teddy Ursa, Stoutland. Lillipop Shift Tree. <clears throat> Digging Gloves. Oh, we're ripping Evolving Skies right now. It's a group break, random energy style. We're ripping Evolving Skies, full case. I rip packs. Do what you're seeing right now. This is, this is, uh, I'm on the clock. <laughs> Sweet Coon Full Art, nice. Congrats, Water. Very nice card. There you go, Water. Congrats on that. Very solid hit. Great Full Art. There you go, Water. I've seen a lot of Full Arts so far. They're popping out. I don't know, Brett. I don't know the reason, but... I think you're right with saying there's got to be a reason. Exactly. Uh, Golduck, Florgasalo. I feel like you're correct on that. There has to be a reason. I feel like that's right, but <clears throat> I don't know what it is. Someone might know. Toy Catcher, Ampharos. But it is strange. I feel like no other quarterbacks do that. I would think, at least. Talonflame and Lilligans. All right, move some codes and move some uh, energies quick. We'll keep these going. All right, guys, second half coming up here. Good luck. Let's get it going. Second half. <laughs> Magnet says Jacob. Yeah, NFL gloves are like magnets. That is true. It's hard to it's hard to lose uh, control of the ball, lose grip. That is that is pretty correct. Those gloves are crazy. That was a pretty dang good throw, though. Pikachu reverse, Trampa. Very solid. Bass, Sharpedo. Uh, I think you're talking about Champion's Path with the shiny Charizard and the rainbow Charizard. Champion's Path. Eldegoss, Apple Pie. Should be the set that you're talking about. It's got the rainbow Charizard V Max and it's got the shiny Charizard V in uh, Champion's Path. Well, there you go, David. Another touchdown. Nice. Umbreon V. There you go. Dark. Nice. They're vacuums for football, as Brett said. <laughs> That's funny. That's funny. Yeah, football gloves are legit when it comes to that. Oh, we got the rainbow trash man. Dark type. Rainbow garbage, David. Nice. Speaking of garbage, garbage time, David. Just uh, cashed you your bets. And a nice rainbow piece of trash for you, David. Congrats. On your trash. There you go. Love the rainbow Garbodor. Am I having a good day? I'm having a great day. Having a great day. Boost shake, pincer. Haplitzo. Nice, David. Congrats on the rainbow garbage. 
got Stormy Mountains, Ludico, Low Hollow. What about you, JN? Are you having a good day? Keep this going. Come on. All right, guess not. <clears throat> Ooh, we got Sylveon VMAX, Psychic type. There you go. Sylveon VMAX for you. Got a shift tree and a talent flame. Heritier. Give away some codes for a little bit as well here. Uh, Zora Flapple. Nice Flareon VMAX. There's a new VMAX. Fire type on the Flareon. Congrats, Fire. Flareon VMAX. Very cool. Congrats on that one. Stormy Mountains. Carvana. Amphros. Eevee. Shift Tree. Personals up after this tonight, everyone. Thank you. If you are looking for a personal, uh, remember to get that order in soon. Lilligan's there at the back. No alts yet, Ryan. No alts yet. Zero. Zilch. We are at a couple of rainbows, though. Two rainbows now. Leafeon and Garbodor. We had a full art trainer. We've had like three or four full art Pokemon. And quite a few VMAX. But yeah, no alts quite yet. Gyarados. V. Boxes haven't been like too slow in terms of hits. There are still hits coming out. No alts though. I would say about average for like the amount of hits besides the alts. Yeah, lacking the alts so far. Lilligant, evil. One move and no ability. Yeah, that's pretty bad, Jacob. That's pretty bad. That's actually really bad. Like, just like never gonna be used type thing. Especially for a VMAX. Never had even really realized that. Bag on apple pie. I usually only... I have like a lot of water decks. I don't ever... I don't think I've ever built a fire deck, so... I never even really looked at Flareon. Altaria Stoutland. Actually, I do have one Charizard deck. I do have one. I do indeed have one. Zanias Resolve Amphros. What's up, JN? What's up? Uh, Kyrum Hollow, Dragon type, Golduck, Spider. Yeah, that'd be bad. Hopefully not. I see a Venusaur behind me, about to eat my head. That'd be bad as well if he took a bite. Evil. I'd be uh, crushed. Senescort Chandelier. Interesting. Ribbon Badge, Tropius. Like both of them, you have to have Jacob. The duo. They work well together. <laughs> yeah, no spider, but there is a Venusaur that, uh, if you did take a bite, I would be in trouble. Ooh, wow, Brett, you called it! Noivern alt! <laughs> there you go. You called it, Brett. Alternate arts for dragon type. Noivern V. Congrats there, dragon. It's a sweet looking card. And we can get this one magged up for you. Really awesome hits. Congrats, dragon. Very cool. You called it, Brett. Nice hit there. Dragon type. You brought the alt, Ryan. Thank you. We needed you, man. You brought the alt for us. And Kogus Traps. Gotcha, gotcha. Nice, Jacob. No way. <laughs> no way. Jordan, I just read like the first second of your message. Hold on, let me read that fully. <laughs> what? What? Jordan. Oh my goodness, please buy more. <laughs> Send us some, Jordan. We need some. Please buy us a case. Jordan, do they cost like a million dollars a box? Or is he still selling them at like market price? <laughs> oh my goodness. Teddy Air Sudge Rampa. That's so sick, Jordan. I heard that is indeed an error that's happening up in Canada, though. Oh my goodness. <laughs> 500 Canadian a box? What does that come down to, USD? Like 400? Pyroar? 
That is still worth it though. That is still worth it. So let me read what you had again. Two Gengar V all. Oh my God, Espeon is big. Nine rainbows, one box. Oh, we got a crimp card. Crimp card, hop it. Here you go, grass, crimped card. And we got Drilladon V. No way. 400 USD or so, okay. <laughs> oh my goodness, Jordan, that's so cool, man. That's so cool. A little bit less than 400, gotcha. Jeez, that's nuts, man. Well, congrats, Jordan. Apple Pie, Articuno Hollow. Yeah, that's a pretty good price, I feel like, still. That's sick, Jordan. Pincer. That's sick, man. I would love to... Oh, man. I don't know if I would buy one still. I think I would, though. For 400, that seems worth it. That seems worth it. Time pull, amp, apple pie. That seems really worth it, actually. I'd love to have a full case sealed, though. Oh, man. <laughs> ah, I would love to have a full case of those sealed. Holy cow, two Mew rainbows? Yeah, that's nuts, Jordan. You probably have, like... Um, so what, those alts are like 100? Those four alts are... Those four alts cover your box. The four alts cover your box. The two rainbows are all profit. <laughs> Uh, treasure energy, my low tick. Yeah, Jordan, if he is, like, looking to sell cases, I'm not sure if he is. Um, you could definitely send me a message on Discord. We'd love to get, like, a case or two. But, I, I mean, he might not even be looking to sell them like that. But we'd probably be willing to pay something pretty close to that, yeah. We would love to get a case or two, though, for breaks. But, yeah, if he's not looking to move them, that's also completely understandable. It is something we'd be interested in, though. The, the only reason we would be interested is because you can actually identify that it is an error case uh, before even ripping the packs. So you can know that it's an error case ahead of time, which is pretty sweet. But Jordan, I think you're in Discord. You could always shoot me a message. Ooh, nice, an Umbreon VMAX. Dark type. Congrats. Very nice. Congrats on that. Yeah, that would be a, a super fun random energy style break. The boxes are guaranteed to be god boxes from that case. But that's so sweet, Jordan. Uh, Smeargle and Gigalith. All right, let's get to it. Next one. But yeah, that uh, local card shop hit the jackpot, I would say. <laughs> they hit the jackpot. Yeah, exactly, Ryan. It would be really fun. It would be really fun. All right, empty. <laughs> Jacob. Uh, Fletchender, Stoutland. Come on now, there we go. Yeah, it makes sense, Jordan. I kind of figured, man. If anyone is actually, like, lucky enough to get their hands on those, Raichu Hollow, a lot of people aren't really going to, like, want to move it and stuff. Uh, Regaliki, Shift Tree. Uh, Rufflet, Reverse, Wishy Washy. That's pretty dang sweet, though. Dang, Ryan, that's always the worst, man. I'm sorry. Rabombi, Dialga, Hollow. Nice. <clears throat> that's always the worst. When you're actually willing to go higher. <laughs> what? <laughs> Jordan, I just keep reading these messages. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I uh, got Leafy on VMAX. Nice. There you go, Grass. I just keep reading the messages, man. That's craziness. It's so cool, man. But yeah, you're up in Canada, and of course that's where uh, this error is like identified right now, pretty much specifically to Canada. It was like a Canadian distributor that had all these error boxes and stuff. That's so sick though, Jordan, that you were able to get in on that fun. And yeah, I would say um, your box was well worth that. Got Noivern V. <clears throat> Here you go, Dragon. 
keep going. Copycat apple pie. Dino Tropius. <clears throat> if only Jacob. No, I'm pretty sure like literally like most people that get those right now are like not really looking to sell them. <laughs> to be honest. Those error boxes. Can't really blame them. Can't really blame them. Yeah, for real, Jordan, that would be nuts. But Fusion Strike is still fantastic. <clears throat> Evil Redrago Hollow. But, oh, man, I would love to have one of those um, error cases sitting in my closet for a few years. Holy cow. That would be, that would be like the ultimate investment. Articuno, Gigalith. I know, Ryan. Right, all the hits are in Canada. They forgot to send them to the English packs. Right, man. Yeah, Mike, this has been out of hand, man. That last touchdown is something, all right. That's nuts, though, Jordan. <laughs> That's so cool, man. Uh, Smeargle. Congrats again, Jordan, on that. That's a sweet find. Like I said, those things are pretty much like, I don't even know, like a Bitcoin right now. <laughs> Everyone's talking about it. Eldegas Hollow. Literally everyone. Got a Drake Results. Electric. I just realized that Travis Kelsey threw the touchdown. What are the Chiefs even doing? They're just like memeing on them now or what? I said, all right, we'll just have Travis Kelsey throw for the touchdown. We'll have our offensive linemen catch a touchdown. Like what is going on in the Chiefs game? Hiram Salamance Hollow. Travis Kelsey passing touchdown. Number one, Rodrigo Milotic. Jeez, he's, a, he's having a killer day on DraftKings now. <laughs> Digging gloves, Seismitoad. Got Raihan and Talonflame. Yeah, only a handful of close ones, Dan. That is correct, unfortunately. Wow, great hit, Dark. Full art, Umbreon. Congrats, Dark. Awesome hit, David. Beautiful card. Had the VMAX just a few packs ago. Congrats on your full art, Umbreon, now. There you go, David. Doing well. Doing well for not having an alt. Rainbow Trash earlier as well. Oh, speaking of rainbows, Zanaya's Resolve. Rainbow Trainer. There you go. Nice. Daniel H., another hit for you. Rainbow Zanaya's Resolve. Very cool. Uh, congrats on that one. I totally forgot that there was one tomorrow, Dan. Lilligant. Totally forgot there was another one tomorrow. Pretty cool. A Monday night game still even. Volcarona. Go fire type on the Volcarona. Cardinals for you, Mike. Nice. Shopping center, wishy washy. Like to see Kyler turn up for a little bit in the playoffs. Uh, bigger off. Slacking hollow. Shellgun and Altaria. Sableye, Smeargle. Not too bad there at all. Copycat. Sweet looking Sableye card. On to the next one here, guys. Good luck on it. Nice, Dan. There is a chance indeed. Dorilodon. Go Dragon. 
Yeah, never out until it's over, man. Especially now that he's back in the game. Nice. Good luck. And exactly, they should be throwing the ball. <laughs> they should be throwing the ball. The evil. For some reason, they're still running it. Jacob was just commenting on that earlier. So, if uh, multiple people are picking up on it, that's usually not a good thing. Bravery, Gigalith. That's usually when you know there's some interesting coaching going on. And Tentacruel and Drampa. Plus 5,000 chance right now on the Steelers. <laughs> well, it's always worth tossing down five bucks if you want to throw away your money. Treasure Energy and Mars Shadow Hollow. <laughs> Chief's got this one, though. Unfortunately, not a close one tonight. Sweet Coon V. Very nice. Oh, it's a parlay as well, Dan. Nice. Nice Sweet Coon V. Yachts! <laughs> oh, that's funny, Yachts. <laughs> no, I've been there, man. I've been there. There's some $5 bets that are very, very low odds to hit. But it feels good at the time. Reverse Pikachu. Gorgeous. I've been there, Yachts. <laughs> Took that personally, he said. That's funny. Hope you're doing well tonight, Yachts. All right, close out the last pack. One more box here. Got Rayquaza VMAX. Nice. Another one for Dragon. There you go, Dragon Energy. Nice Rayquaza. All right, the last one of the case, guys. Come on, let's find one more alt. Maybe a pair of alts in the box. As we close out the case. Good luck here. Yeah, it kind of stinks. I think you said yesterday that you were a Steelers fan. Um, it does kind of stink. Um, seeing Big Ben have to go out like this, you know. Just getting absolutely crushed. Hey, there's Claypool, Dan. I see him. Any alts yet? We just have a Neuvern alt. Just a Neuvern alt so far, Chris. On to the last box now. Neuvern alternate art so far. Um, then we had a Leafeon rainbow. We had a Garbodor rainbow. Zanaya's Resolve rainbow. Gold Stadium. Uh, another full art trainer, and then something like three, four, five full arts. Umbreon full art, Glaceon full art. I'll do a recap after this box as well. Shift tree, Altaria. But yeah, just the single alt so far, just one. Hoping to grab one more here in the last one. Uh, Naked, Milo Tuck. <laughs> Fair yachts. Fair. Got Ludicolo, gorgeous. Nice, Jacob. Let me know what it ends at. Let me know what it ends at. Curious. Articuno, hollow. I saw that silver debut even does really well. The Trey Lance was more expensive than I thought as well. Comparatively to the Mac. Got uh, Golurk. Here you go, Psychic. All right, guys, let's close out the last box of the case. Personals, then, after this, about an hour wait time right now. Gyarados VMAX. New one there for water. Nice. I forgot Gyarados was in the set still. Sometimes you get caught up with all those evolutions. You forget about Gyarados, you forget about, um, you know, like Neuvern, stuff like that. Trevenants. Nice, Yachts. Awesome. Very cool, Yachts. Woobat, wishy washy. You might be beating me. I have the Celebrations Charizard. Not too much else, Yachts. I've got a lot of the Pikachus. And pretty much nothing else. <laughs> My celebrations luck has been a lot of duplicates. Dino, Moltres, Hollow. Like I said, I was lucky enough though to get one Charizard, so no complaints there. But other than that, pretty much nothing. No kidding, Jacob. I just get outbid at the last minute. Leafeon, full art. Nice. There you go, grass. Very solid. Yeah, usually what happens to me, Jacob, when I'm bidding on something 
it'll just like be like the last like three seconds and then I'll try to just toss in my bid and then I'll lose by like five dollars I'm like all right <laughs> sounds good even though I would have probably like bid more on expensive stuff at least like hundred dollar plus that's been my luck always crystal cave pincer I never have a high enough max bid it feels like yeah it goes nuts the last 15 seconds Jacob leafy on V that's how it's always been though man even I remember years and years ago when I used to I sold like some used golf clubs on eBay and stuff like that like years ago like six years ago probably um, yeah it's always the last few seconds the last like 30 seconds it could literally like double in price sometimes it's nuts Appleton Got Gordy. Gorgeous. Yeah, those are pretty much the two toughest to pull. Yeah, it's correct. Tampu Lele is super tough. Shining Magikarp is also pretty tough, Yachts. Shining Magikarp is a tough hit. But yeah, you said it. Those are two of the tougher ones there. Tapu Lele does not come out much at all. Got Drake is all VMAX. Electric, there you go. Nice Drake is all VMAX. But yeah, you did tell me that in the past. I remember that. Move out of these base quick, guys. We'll keep it going. Exactly, yeah, it's exactly. That's pretty much um, the same point that Jacob was making over on the YouTube chat. Pretty much the same thing he was saying. Different wording. Shift tree. But yeah, pretty much summed up what he said. And what I was thinking as well. Pretty much summed it up there. Woo buff it, Tropius. It's got its advantages, but there are some disadvantages for sure. Seismitoad and Seismitoad. 710, was that the final? Nice. Yeah, you've gotten some really nice prices, Yachts. Lombre, Drampa. Uh, there's a couple of items where, like, I've missed a really, really nice price by just, like, a couple of bucks, you know? Those are always the worst. You miss a really nice item by just a dollar or two. Milotic. Ooh, Drago Hollow. Yeah, exactly. It's called sniping someone. Yep. Yep. I see a hit here in this stack. Hold on. I see another one here as well. Let me move these to the hit stack for the recap later. Ooh, nice. Full Art Golurk V. Psychic. There you go. Full Art Golurk. Congrats, Psychic. Nice one. Another Full Art. It's been the Full Art case. Ooh, nearly picked there. Jeez. Hop it. Talon Flame. You got to put in the time, though, as well with eBay. You got to put in the time. It does take some... Some time, some effort to actually find those listings that uh, we're describing right now. It definitely takes some time. UPC, yeah, I think so for sure, Yachts. 100%. The thing about it, Yachts, um, Celebrations has like multiple different items. It's got the ETBs, a lot of different collection boxes, and it's got the Ultra Premium. The Ultra Premium is by far the most premium, or like the most high-end, I guess you could say. Garbodor V, very nice dark type hit. So I would probably expect that one to go up the fastest, as well as um, it is the most limited of the products. So for those two reasons, it should go up faster than just like a standard Celebrations ETB. So yeah, I think it's a good, good way to put some cash. Amphros. Been considering buying a sealed full case of them. The four box case sealed. I've been considering uh, trying to find one of those. Sableye, Marshadow, Hollow. Um, but yeah, in addition, it's got the, the big cards guaranteed, the promos, exactly. And then there's still Celebrations packs um, and a wide variety of other packs as well, like Vivid Voltage, Chilling Rain, uh, some other really nice packs. 
Uh, Dialga, Sharpedo. I mean, if you can afford a case of Ultra Premium, it's, it's worth it, I think, to always have a sealed case of a product. It's nice to have that sealed case. It'll have a little bit of a premium. Um, but like I said, then you have to buy four at once rather than buying, you know, just one. Uh, but if you were going to buy like four single ones yacht, I, I would encourage you to try to find a sealed case. If you were like considering buying a few of them. Flapple. Uh, but yeah, case of ultra premium would be quite the investment in my opinion. Good time right now as well. Toy catcher, shift tree. Probably going to get out of hand fairly soon. <clears throat> and like I said, they're pretty much already out of prints. There hasn't been a round of those for months now. The ultra premiums. Over two months, I would say. Flappy, Raichu Hollow. Yeah, you have to always analyze the downside. Yeah, it's exactly. You have to always analyze the downside. Do you think it could get below whatever price that you're buying them at? Ampharos and Gigalith. And if it can get below whatever price you're buying it at, by how much can you lose, you know? Always important to consider not only the upside, but also the downside. Yep. Metacham, fighting type, nice. There you go. Yeah, but if you're if you're doing that much time, like you just said there, no doubt in my mind that'll play out fine. Pretty much no doubt. Probably one of the more safe things you could invest in in term of in terms of a sealed Pokemon product. One of the more safe options. Crustal Liliant. Move that crimped card into the recap as well. Pyro, L the Gas Hollow. Toy Catcher. And we got two remaining here. Seems correct, Jacob. Ursaring, Salamance Hollow. Yeah, yeah, it's I hear you. You like to be more patient with your things. I hear you. Makes sense. Drowsy. And Smeargle. All right, that closes out the full case. Let me do a quick recap for everyone that was involved. Appreciate everyone that did hop in the full case. Number seven here. All right, we got a Crim Topip, uh, Metacham V, Garbodor V, Golurk V, Full Art, Drilladon V, Pikachu Reverse, Dracozole V Max, Leafeon V, Leafeon V, Full Art, Gyarados V Max, Golurk V, Rayquaza V Max, Suicune V, Drilladon V, Volcarona V, Zanaya's Resolve, Rainbow Trainer. Umbreon V, Full Art, uh, Dracozalt V, Noivern V, Leafeon V Max, Grass Type, uh, Umbreon V Max, Noivern V, Alternate Arts, there it is, the one and only Alternate Arts, Noivern, Dragon, uh, Flareon V Max, Sylveon V Max, Rainbow Garbodor V Max, Dark Type, Umbreon V, Suicune V, Full Art, uh, Lycanroc V, Glaceon V Max, Rayquaza V, Gyarados V, Sylveon V Max, Volcarona V, uh, Golurk V. But left here, Espeon V, Glaceon V Max, Turffield Stadium, Gold Card. Got Garbodor V, Rayquaza V, Glaceon V Full Art, Leafeon V, Espeon V, Terrilodon V Max, uh, Trevenant V, Noivern V Full Art, Rainbow Leafeon V Max, uh, Zenai's Resolve Full Art Trainer, Glaceon V, and we got it all started with the Trevenant V Max. All right, all right. Thank you again, everyone. Appreciate it. We'll get those all protected and sent right out to you guys. Thanks for hopping in the full case. Sweet. That as well, Jacob, sometimes works out. Exactly. Grabbing them via the group break style. Exactly. Snag the promos in that way. You said it. You said it. I'm sorry, Dan. I missed that. I missed that. I'm sorry. Claypool was inches. No. For sure, Yachts. For sure. I hear you. I hear you. It's a good way to be uh, diverse in that way as well, Yachts. It's good to be diverse. Across your investments, whatever they might be. Always good to have that diversity. All right, let me upload that full case, guys. Sweet. The night is not done. The night is not done. I will be starting personals now. 
Personals always follow the group breaks. So once we get through the end of the group breaks, uh, we always rip personals after that. So a couple hours of personals here. If you are looking for a personal, get that order in. It's about an hour wait. I got uh, the order is going to be Luis, Jacob, John, Andrew, and Justin for personals. Let me check out what I got coming up. Cryptid Nation 2, two of them. Hidden Fate CTV, Sword and Shield Booster, and then Charizard Chasers. Okay, so I have to go grab a couple of different things, guys, for the personals. I need a Kanto box. I need a Hidden Fate CTV. The two cryptid nation all right sweet so thanks again guys for hopping in the group breaks tonight appreciate that um uh, jacob i'm gonna have those tomorrow night monday night so there will be a round of those um for monday <clears throat> and then there might also be a new group break with metazoo on wednesday as well that would be listed by the morning that would be listed by the morning so yeah, only booster boxes in stock for the evening of Cryptid Nation Second Ed. There will be some more Nightfall in stock tomorrow as we have a little bit more arriving. Um, and then, like I said, we will do after that Cryptid Nation as well tomorrow night. Uh, I don't have a template for that, Jacob. We've never done that before. We don't do that... Um, by the style because it's only 15 a spot by the uh bundles there that's why i'm going to combine it with nightfall like i said for 40 it'll be four nightfall and four cryptid nation tomorrow night do, do, do. all right there's nothing else I need quick. Uh, I'm going to need some Burning Shadows as well, actually. Burning Shadows. And then, Jacob, we might be trying on Wednesday as well. Um, I already have it on the back of my phone case. Impact Energy Style and Tiered, potentially, on Wednesday. Ah, 8 Second Head. 8 Second Head. I get what you're saying. Um, what would that break down to then for the box, though? The only problem, then, Jacob, that doesn't work either because... There's eight, eight would get us to 16. There'd be four packs left over at the end. Can't do it that way. Has to be a full box. We could do 12 maybe. I could set it up for 12 tomorrow night. That would really be the only way. Or nine as well, 12 or nine. But eight would not work. 12 or nine could though. Then the box top would be between those two people. Yeah, I got you, Jacob. I got you. We could do it with either 9 or 12, though. And then Box Topper would be between either 3 or 4 slots. I could set that up for tomorrow as well. There'll be a couple of different bundles in that way. Alright, be right back, guys.
read some of these messages. That's crazy, Yachts. That's nuts. I can't believe it's quite that much of a markup. I did not realize that. Wow. Like, way more than I thought it was. Set this here. All right. Add box toppers to brakes or just sell them separate. Yeah. Yeah, I get what you're saying, Jacob. I get what you're saying. I just feel bad about taking away a box topper. So let's say that we did like um, like four bundles of nine for a box, whatever price it might be. I just feel bad taking away the box topper from the four people that like bought packs from the box then, that's all. <clears throat> right now, Jamal, right now. Yours will be coming up, Jamal, um, in about 20 minutes or so. About 25 minutes, probably. About 25 minutes, you will be up. Let's do this one. Good luck, Luis. Get it going here. Two Cryptid Nations. How's it going, everyone? Caleb here with Layton Gaming. This time for Luis C. Got two Cryptid Nation second edition booster boxes. Good luck on these, Luis. And yeah, it's always just the order that they come in, Jamal. Um, whatever trading card game that might be. <clears throat> whatever trading card game that might be. Um... It just comes at whatever the order comes in, we do them right in order. So, like I said, I got this one here for Luis, then I got Jacob, and then I got you, John, after that. Good luck on your bundle, man. Yeah, that's what I mean, Sean. It should stay with uh, whoever's grabbing it from that box, exactly. That's how I feel as well. Yeah, so just a little bit, about 25 minutes or so. 25 minutes or so. <clears throat> And empty. All right, let's do this. Good luck. I see what you're saying though, like your concept though, Jacob. I get exactly what your concept is there. Trying to break down the packs and then use the box toppers in a fun way still. Fresno Nightcrawler's full to get it going. What's up, Kimmy? How you feeling? What's going on? Figured you've probably been catching up on some sleep, hopefully at least. Hope you're doing all right. Sewer Alligator Reverse Hollow. And Luis, good luck on these, like I said. Thanks for getting the personal cue going tonight. Jacob up next. Getting Fates ETB, Jacob. Good luck to you, man. Uh, Chupacabra. Nice full. Congrats. Black hole shard full. Very nice. And a box topper. <laughs> Slide rock bolt to reverse. <laughs> Got trip Odero reverse. I still can't believe that last night, Jacob. It couldn't have gone too much better. <laughs> couldn't have gone too much better. Unless we would have like hit those players for that number to 11 card. I don't really know how it could have gotten a lot better. It's pretty dang sick. It's tough to hit autos like that in Mosaics. So. Flatwoods Monster Reverse. The color was unfortunately kind of a whiff. Unless you're like a Jameson Crowder fan. But assuming you're not. Uh, Snow Wasset Reverse. Babe the Blue Ox Reverse. Ooh, Leaning Tower of Cryptid Nation. That's what I mean. That's what I mean, Jacob. Or like someone you've barely heard of, like Sean Merriman. Like, that was a good linebacker. That was a good linebacker, but, you know, not who you're looking for ever. Flatwoods Monster Reverse. But yeah. <laughs> I had watched multiple cases on release day, not first off the line. Uh, Fresno Nightcrawlers. That's why I wasn't fully familiar with all those first off the line parallels. Uh, but I had watched a good amount of uh, cases on release day when I think it was Rich Ripping. Uh, Uncle Sam full. Very nice. And there was there was a ton of like, yeah, like you said, random Colts autos. Yeah. Marlon Mack and then like a bunch of other random Colts and 
Yeah, these guys that are barely on the roster anymore. Uncle, uh, walking Sam now. Nice. There you go, Luis. Yeah, exactly. Leaf Metal Autos. Yeah, that's a fair way to put it, I guess. Fresno. Reverse. So, yeah, it was pretty sick uh, with that first pack. <laughs> it was like, no way. Uh, Funeral Mountain Reverse. I had a good feeling, man, but I just didn't actually think it was going to happen like that. Hands even got a little bit shaky. I watched the replay uh, this morning. Black Cat Reverse. Earth's Core Reverse. Ah, I gotcha, I gotcha. I could do that. Ghost Deer Reverse. I'd be down, Jamal. John, I think it is. I'd be down. Sounds fun. Black Hole Shardful. It was nice to see like a Rogers and stuff too. Jordy. Jordy and Rogers. Nice, John. Yep. Thought so. Uh, Forest Gods Amberful. My Twitch name is like also nowhere near my first name. So, <laughs> yeah. Gotcha though, John. Sounds good. Can do just that for you, man. Chessy full. <laughs> I can do just that. Got Chupacabra full. Wow, heating up. Congrats. Yeah, I got a Hidden Fates ETB after this, John, and then your order is after that. So close out this one here, the second box. Do a Hidden Fates ETB for Jacob. I got you after that, man. <clears throat> so good luck. Uh, Tizarok Reverse. You get to watch some Hidden Fates as well after this. Bet you like that set. Black Hole Shard full. It's a great set. Yeah, there was like that nice Lawrence as well, Jacob. Uh, Blood Ruby full. I know people are like way down on him right now, but that silver introductions was pretty cool looking. Snally Gaster reverse. I know people are like way down on him, like I said, but still, you know, good player. Uh, Walking Sam reverse. Uh, I'm in probably go over to MetaZoo general chat. It's Fantasy Freak 00. If you go over to MetaZoo General Chat or Pokemon General Chat or just General Chat, you'll find me in one of those. Unending Fire Crystal. And it's Fantasy Freak 00. My picture is um, a Hollow Charizard, base set unlimited Hollow Charizard. Forest God's Amber Reverse. That's a card that I bought a long time ago, actually, with my roommates. Pretty crazy story with that one. <laughs> yeah, yeah that, that brings back a lot of memories. Wow. Uh, Tizarok Full Hollow. Just looking at that Discord picture. That's uh, that's crazy. Yeah, so um, basically what happened. Um, me and my roommates, I think this was sophomore year at college. Pretty sure. Um, Uncle Sam full, very nice. We uh, had gotten a message from one of our other good friends uh, that said he had one of his employees at work was looking to sell Forest God's Amber Reverse. A bunch of his Pokemon cards from uh, when he was just like younger and stuff like that. Eternal Snowflake Reverse. Very cool. Uh, and let's get on to the next. Uh, let's get to the box topper first. And so it was um, It was kind of like a cool option. He had sent us like a very, very small portion of the binder. And we could see that there was a hollow Charizard from base set. And then ooh, Ocean there. Nice. And then we could also see that there was a first edition Lugia. So we were pretty interested in going to check out more of the cards and see what he all had. Um, <clears throat> and there was, there was some really awesome stuff in the entire lot. But some of the highlights, like I said, were that Hollow Charizard. And uh, there was also a Hollow Venusaur. They said Unlimited. The first Ed Lugia was nice. Uh, it wouldn't have graded well, though. Probably a PSA 6. A lot of the cards, unfortunately, were like PSA 5, PSA 6 quality. Uh, but we were able to pick it up for a pretty decent price at the time. A couple hundred dollars for the entire binder. <clears throat> pretty fun stuff. We drove there, though. Um, let me tell you, that was what really made this story interesting. We decided to drive there kind of like at a, at a very, very, like, 
abrupt time. We really wanted to try to get to the cards and he was really like wanted to sell so he could keep working on his car. He did some additional money for the project he was working on. Uh, so we just went that day, like that hour, and it was like a pretty bad snowstorm. And it was like 45 minutes away. Uh, Flatwoods Monster, Full Hollow. I will never forget this. Uh, <laughs> But it was it was nuts. My my roommate John was like super super down. We wanted to do it really badly. We were gonna like split the binder and stuff, and then uh, we were planning to sell some of the cards and then keep some of the cards and stuff. Beast of Busco reverse, and uh, so we decided let's let's just go. But it was like a crazy bad snowstorm. Like it took us probably 45 minutes to an hour. What should have been like a 20 minute drive. Um, it was really bad. Mermaid scales full. But we did end up getting the binder, and there were some, some sweet cards. I've got a few of the cards still, but some of the cards uh, we did sell off as well. Tizarok Reverse. Like I said, our goal was kind of uh, try to get back some of our money and then um, keep a couple cards as well. Beast of Busco full. Very solid. We pretty much paid probably like 75% to 80% of eBay on like most of the binder. There were some cards in there that were... Unfortunately, we were hoping they were going to be better conditioned than they were, and then once we actually were able to see them and stuff in person, Flatwoods Monster full. Um, unfortunately, a lot of them did have like some decent hollow scratches and stuff like that when we actually got to check it out. A little bit more whitening, and the edges were a little bit rougher than we expected. Space Penguins Reverse. So that was a little bit unfortunate, but it was fun. It was fun. It was. It's kind of crazy. Trip Odero Reverse. It's a pretty intense uh, storm that we were driving through. <clears throat> Bigfoot. Nice. Full hollow. Very solid. Congrats on that one, Luis. Nice big, nice Bigfoot. There you go. Forest God's Amber. Full hollow. Black Hole Shard, Full Hollow, nice. Chessy, Full Hollow, wow, very nice. It's kind of nuts though to see um, and look back and stuff like that on how the market has changed over time. I love looking back at like the screenshots on my camera roll and like the pictures I took of cards a couple of years ago from uh, my collection and stuff I was buying then. It's just crazy to see how those things have like changed, how they've gone up in value, down in value, Beast of Busco reverse. Uh, there's this one screenshot on my phone that always gets me. I have back-to-back -back screenshots of, um, there's an Evolutions booster box on eBay for like 130, buy it now. And then there's right after that, the next screenshot, Lizard Man reverse is a Cosmic Eclipse booster box. Uh, that's also like 125 or something like that. And I think I was considering buying those, but then I never ended up buying them. Uh, Blood Ruby full, like a couple years ago, obviously, closer to when they were, uh, shortly after they were printed, year or two after. Uh, but it, it's crazy to look at that picture and just see what the buy it now was then. Forest Gods Amber Reverse, that uh, opportunity I unfortunately missed out on. <laughs> Bigfoot Reverse, very nice. Congrats on that one, another Bigfoot. Just had a full. Go. Loveland Frogman, nice reverse hollow. I mean, those were those elite sets a couple years ago. That was the, the hot stuff. Blood Ruby reverse, Hidden Fates, Cosmic Eclipse, Evolutions. Some of the most popular packs then. Now some of the, the most popular uh, older packs to rip now. Earth's Core full. Beast of Busco Reverse. Oh, wow, that's nuts, Nick. Yeah, I was going to say, that's the Luca class, 18-19 there. So, that's uh, that's huge for basketball stuff. Chupacabra Reverse. But yeah, basketball and football, those can, those can be even more extreme. Like, way more extreme. Where it can literally be a couple hundred that can turn into a few thousand, exactly. 
uh, slide rock bolter full hollow less likely to see some kind of um uh growth like that with uh gaming but you definitely still see the growth just uh you know it does, it's at the same magnitude honestly death beam full very nice but of course gaming uh boxes come in a little bit cheaper of a price point nice death beam full very cool oh yeah i mean i've ripped like can't the canto power boxes like plenty of those a couple years ago nick for myself bigfoot reverse would be nice to have a couple of those around for sure evolutions etbs i used to rip those not even really smart compared to the canto power uh, yeah for sure but this stuff was like way more affordable got black hole shard reverse like you're saying with your uh basketball example Gigi Bird Reverse Solo. Snally Gaster Reverse. Yeah, for sure, Nick, for sure. Exactly. And I've got some sick cards from Evolutions and from the Hidden Fates that I opened and stuff. Exactly. Snally Gaster Reverse. And I'm very happy with those cards. Exactly. Funny Man Reverse. For sure, man. I hear you. Nice Sam Sinclair. There you go. Nice one, Luis. Sam Sinclair full. Ooh, that's pretty nice. That is pretty nice. Trey Young is one of those guys, man. He's just like a super talented shooter. He's going to be around for quite a while. That's nice, though, man. Chupacabra full. Nice one again. There you go, Luis. Solid. Open some sleeves quick. Yeah, Silver Select, especially like a couple years ago, was much um, much tougher to pull and, and has some great value. Snow Asset Reverse, especially a couple of years ago. Maybe not like as much with the football this year and stuff, but previous. Cactus Cat Reverse. Yeah, sounds like you were ripping some then, Nick, so you're familiar with that concept already. Uh, Flatwoods Monster Reverse, even like Concourse as well. I know, it's crazy, Yachts. It's nuts. It's nuts. McDonald's or Taco Bell or Subway? Ooh. Quetzalcoatlus reverse. I'm a Taco Bell guy when it would come to those options. Yeah, Kimmy as well, Taco Bell. All right, closing it out, Luis. Box topper. A lot of votes for Taco Bell. Wow, you got to vote for McDonald's now. Jeez, the chat's going crazy. <laughs> yeah, I think, John, I'm going Taco Bell, though. I think. <clears throat> All right, box top for Luis. Raining. There you go, Luis. Raining for you. Nice, man. Appreciate you, Luis. We'll get those all protected and all of them sent right out to you. Thank you again, Luis. Jeez, nice, Nick. That's fair. That's fair, Jacob. That's fair. I would agree with that. I would agree with that. All right, upload that real quick to the YouTubes. Ripping a pair of Cryptid Nation Second Ed Booster Boxes. Dang it, I was trying to go the no typos. Couldn't do it. One at the end. Hardy's Breakfast. I don't even know if there's any Hardy's around here. Had some of those up in uh, the rural areas of Wisconsin. Not really in the city in Wisconsin. But the smaller towns have them. Not really sure if there's any down here. Haven't seen any yet, to be honest. All right, Jacob, good luck. And then not bad after Jacob, guys. Only about 20 minutes. So if you're looking for a personal break tonight, feel free to get it in. LeightonGaming.com. About 20 minutes. Ooh, see, then I'm going Chipotle. Then I'm going Chipotle. But honestly, then I'm going Qdoba. <laughs> to be honest, I'm a Qdoba guy. If you're going to give me all of these options... That's possible, Jacob. I bet you're right. I bet you're right. Oh, forgot to write a tag for this one. Let me do that quick.
Yeah, you and uh, you and Nick were thinking the same there. And like I said, guys, not too bad right now on the wait time. About 20 minutes. Get that personal ripping for you. Yeah, this is pretty much what I was just talking about. Yeah, it's exactly. Exactly, man. Ooh, I would uh, see that depends now just because the problem with the local Mexican restaurant is Like it just takes the time, you know, I can just get Qdoba in like a couple of minutes I Can get Qdoba literally just be right back home in the same amount of time It would take me to eat at the restaurant wait for the bill to come out all the other stuff You know wait for the food to come out of course so it's tough <laughs> right over to biscuits and gravy for present that's a legitimate food choice right there but one that i always forget exists jacob good luck let's do it ah fair fair yeah so that happens sometimes if that's like your only option somewhere that can definitely happen 100 percent. good choice jacob appreciate you as always let's do it yeah exactly it can just ruin it in that way that's nice nick yeah sometimes there are those really nice places um i had one of those in milwaukee i don't have one reliable one here yet but yeah man i hear you there is uh some nice ones up there for sure let's do this yo dan that's awesome man congrats dan congrats excited for you man that's sick dan excited for you man all right, Jacob, let's do this. Hidden Fate CTB. Jacob P, good luck, man. Let's do it. Not the usual intro there. Got distracted by Dan. <laughs> let's do it, Jacob. Good luck. Hidden Fates. <clears throat> Appreciate you, man. Fair, fair. Fair. Chick-fil-A is not a bad option either, but even that would get old fast. Fair. Yeah, the dining halls can be sketchy sometimes in college. That's for sure. Hidden Fates. Got the uh, Moltres Zapdos and Articuno. Promo birds card for you, Jacob. Nice. And then there is the uh, sleeves. Yeah, I hear you, Yachts. I went to um, uh, college for uh, the first two and a half years in person. And then after that, it kind of got shifted to COVID, only online. And now I'm finishing up my final year actually online as well. So yeah, I don't really eat at the dining hall or anything anymore. And I don't live on campus. Um, but yeah, it was, it was interesting freshman and sophomore year yachts. I heard you. I hear you, man. <laughs> it does get old fast. You're eating a lot of the same things, unfortunately. Ooh, nice start, Jacob. Guard shop shiny. Very nice. I will say, sometimes there's a couple of like respectable like sleeper meals at the diner hall and stuff, but if you don't get one of those, you're kinda out of luck sometimes. <laughs> and I'm not a very picky eater as well. Garchomp, shiny, nice. Mew on the rare. But the repetition is what kills it. Jeez, Nick, that's brutal. That's really far, jeez, Nick. I'm sorry, man. Got Jesse and James reverse. Golem. Nice, Yachts. Nice. Yeah, it would be in person for me normally at this point. Um, I switched to online after I got the job uh, down here. I moved across the country down south. Uh, used to go up um, to school in Wisconsin. But now I'm uh, stationed down here in Florida. And I'm finishing up my last uh, semester of my senior year now. Just doing it online though. Giovanni's Exile. There you go, Jacob. Very nice. I figure it would probably be better to just finish online yachts than try to, uh, try to like transfer to a new university and then have to try to transfer credits. So I stayed with the same university that I used to be at in Wisconsin, um, even though I moved to Florida. I figured it'd be best to just uh, keep it going and finish it out online. I would prefer in person, though, for sure. Jolteon, Arbok. 
really would. All right, Jacob, come on. Big full art shiny. Where's it at, man? Uh, Brock's Peter City Gym and Brock's Training Hollow. Yeah, no, I just stayed. I used to go to uh, University of Wisconsin Whitewater, and I just, like I said, literally got the job right at the start of my senior year. So I figured I would just do the last year all online. It's been going good. The first semester was fine. Got a hollow fairy, wheezing. But yeah, that was one thing I considered, but I feel like I probably would have just gotten like smoked with having to just have to take a bunch more new classes um, because tr uh, credit's not transferring correctly. Exactly, exactly. It would end up holding me back and I don't really want to have to take more than just this last year. Finish out the business degree, sales degree, whatever. Celesteel. There you go, Jacob. Celesteel, I have to do it every time. <laughs> I have to. And a Raichu GX. Nice, Jacob. Celesteela and Raichu there. Yeah, you said it. You said it, man. All right, still looking for the full art shiny, Jacob. Good luck, man. Come on. Big one. Big one. Come on. Ooh, beauty. Tapu Coco. Nice, Jacob. That's so sick. The golds are tough hits, and they are gorgeous cards. Congrats, Jacob. Tapu Coco GX. Nice. Let's pair this one up with a full art shiny now. That'd be huge. Congrats on the Tapu Coco. Beautiful card, Jacob. Nice one, man. Really flashy. Jeez, if I look at this too long, I will get a headache. <laughs> Legitimately. That is so flashy. Nice, you have a Tapu Lele. Nice. That's sick, man. That's sick. I think there's three of them in the set. Should be Tapu Finny as well. All right, two left. Come on, if we can pair that with a full art now, it could turn into a good box quick. Oh, nice. Nice, yeah. It's awesome. Ooh, Jacob. Nice one. Greninja. Full art shiny. Heck yeah. Let's go, Jacob. One of my personal favorites in the sets. Very nice. Congratulations, Jacob. Great box of Hidden Fates. Very nice. Congrats on the Greninja. Very sick pulls, man. Uh, Butterfree. And one more. No problem, Kimmy. You're welcome. <laughs> You're welcome. Lapras. Zapdos Hollow. All right. Thank you again, Jacob. Appreciate that. We'll get those all protected and sent right out to you. All right. Just got to upload, and then I got John coming up next. Fair, Yachts. Fair. Like I said, Yachts, I literally lived in Wisconsin for uh, 21 years, pretty much. I'm 22 now, so my whole life. So it's it's a nice change, honestly. Kind of got sick of the cold up there, to be honest. Always was kind of a goal to move away from it. And John, good luck on the Sword and Shield Mixer. Looking for Salamance VMAX. Let's find him, man. Let's find him. Let's find that rainbow. Yeah, it, it's never I've never been able to wear shorts really on January 16th before so it's pretty dang weird <laughs> it's pretty dang weird like when I say never I mean never 
Literally never. Hey, Dan, thank you, man. As always, Dan. We'll catch you later, man. Have a good night, Dan. See you tomorrow. Have a good day tomorrow as well. Yeah, correct. Yeah, it's correct. Yep. Used to top load a little bit and stuff. Yes, sir. Had to learn the ropes. A lot to learn. Looks easy just opening the packs, but there is a lot to learn on the back end of it. And there's actually a lot to learn on the, the opening the pack side as well. You want to do it in a way that people will enjoy. Got to learn that stuff. <clears throat> ah, Tapu Bulu as well. Yes, Jacob. Correct, correct. I didn't know if he was in the set, but you're right. He is. Is that the pink one? I don't remember anymore. All right, good luck, John. <laughs> How's it going, everyone? Caleb here with Leighton Gaming. It's time for John N. Got ourselves a sword and shield mixer. Let's do this. Chilling rain, battle styles, and evolving skies. John asked for something special, so... Um, how can I do this? All right, I got an idea. So you want me to show you all your hits at the end. So I got an idea of how I can do this, John. Very, very strategically. Um, so it's going to be... Wait, what? We got two code cards? What's going on, John? We got two code cards in this pack the heck okay so i'll do the pack trick here i guess um and then this will be the hit here so what i'm gonna do is set it down i'll show you all the cards quick and coughing and then i will reverse uh sleeve it here and we'll leave it there let's do it keep going <laughs> next pack <laughs> right man Okay, so put those in the front. That's gonna be the hit slot. We'll save them all for the end, exactly. Maw while reverse. Keep it facing the Layton. And last one, this requires extreme focus. Good luck. As we do get closer and closer to the hits. Uh, put the code down quick. Two, three, four. Front. It's gonna be the hit here. Cool, and then I'll toss that code in your pile. Good luck, John. Woo, Buffett. All right. Let's start showing you the hits. Good luck, man. So this is the evolving skies hit here. Good luck on it. Drampa. There you go, rare Drampa. Uh, battle styles hit here. Centiscorch. And the last one for you, John. Uh, Doug Trio out of Chilling Rain. There you go. And I'll get you one bonus hit as well, John. Uh, there's only three bonus hits left, though. So, <laughs> little mix here. We'll go with that one. And John also got you a Geo, dude, from Fossil. Nice. 20 year old set there. Geo, dude, from Fossil. Near mint condition. There you go, John. Appreciate it, man. We'll get those protected and sent right out to you, man. Thanks again. All right, let me get that uploading. Hey, thank you, Yachts. Thank you. Appreciate it. Yeah, I do pretty much run everything. Correct. I am the only breaker. Um, I list all the breaks. Uh, yes, all of the above, pretty much. <laughs> I schedule the breaks. And yeah, pretty much. Um, but Rich has kind of given me the power to kind of go ahead and do that. So I appreciate that. That was kind of fun. Yeah, that was kind of fun, even though the hits were meh. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> it was a little bit... A uh, fun way to open just the three-pack bundle for John. Thanks, man. Appreciate it, John. Hey, appreciate you, man. No problem. I'll have those right out to you. But yeah, of course, they still give me a lot of help, Yachts. But in terms of, like, some of the actual breaking, it is me. And then, yeah, in terms of, like, the listing and stuff, I do that. But it is helpful because I know, you know, what the people are liking, what's hot and stuff like that. As I'm the one always ripping it. <clears throat> for sure. And it also helps uh, accommodate what everyone's looking for as well in that way. You kind of take the people's suggestions and play with them a little bit. As we're very early into this as well, yeah, it's only been around for, what, four months or whatever? So. Compared to, like, whatever it is, ten years? <laughs> 10 years, 11 years, something crazy like that. Hey, appreciate it, Yachts, appreciate it. Yeah, I tried to do my very best to 
give the website a look at least a few times every day. Yep, even on the days off and stuff. Yeah, for sure. Um, I'm going for just marketing with a sales emphasis, but I've already taken like a lot of business management classes and stuff like that, as of course I'm about to graduate. So yeah, so I hear you. I've definitely learned about some of that similar stuff. All right, good luck, Andrew. And let me just upload quick as well. I know I have to do that. Totally forgot there. And I just have to go grab a couple more Burning Shadows packs before we do I'll get on to the next one for uh, Justin. And actually not bad on the wait at all, guys. About 10 minutes or so. So if you're looking for something, feel free. About 10 minutes. Uh, so I had to take like just the bare minimum accounting. The bare minimum accounting. I took... Um, two of them i think one of them was manageable because the professor was very good very good really really good teacher uh, she was just fantastic the other accounting class was uh, just like passable because the um content was just horrible um and then stats classes i think i took like two as well once again i had one really good professor and one that was, you know, not too helpful to making the course better. That's kind of what I learned in college, though. My experience really depended on the professor, to be honest. As silly as that sounds and as stupid as it is to blame it on one person, my experiences across my classes really did depend on the professor for a lot of them. Some classes I wasn't expecting to like that I actually really liked because of the professors. Some classes I thought I was going to enjoy that were extremely difficult because of the professors econ was incredibly difficult for me barely passed that one <laughs> yeah but that's true it does it really does uh shape you in that way like you said yeah it's exactly very true you have to learn in that way exactly learn to adjust manage in that way all right good luck andrew how's it going everyone caleb here with Layton gaming it's time for Andrew P. Got ourselves a Charizard Chaser. Good luck, man. Evolutions and Burning. Two Shining Fates. Let's do this. Yo, what's up, Jimmy? What's up, man? Closing out the night here. Closing out the night with some personals. We just finished up the group breaks. So just ripping some personals. Yeah, for sure. I do as well. Stone Jorner Shiny. Nice one to start, Andrew. Yeah, I do as well. Volcanion. Like, to the best of my ability, though, yeah, sometimes there's just... The professor isn't on there, so kind of just got to go in blind then. But, yeah, I do the same thing. It's pretty pretty essential, I would say. All right, Andrew, good luck here. Snob. Cramorant, there you go. Two for two on the Shining Fates. Cramorant V. Yeah, exactly, exactly. You said it. All right, Evolutions and Burning Shadows. Good luck. We'll do the burning first. I think I did just get another order as well. We'll check and see if it is a rip it or a ship it. Good luck on the burning. Uh, Panseer, reverse. Alolan, eradicate. Rare. Like to buzz. All right, evolutions time. Good luck. Yeah, correct. You need to have that above like three or whatever. Yep, exactly. Exactly. It depends on the college, of course. Uh, Beedrill Reverse. Wow, nice ending. Full Art Dragon IDX. Great way to end, Andrew. Congrats. Awesome evolutions hit. No Charizard there, but a great Dragon IDX. Full Art. Congrats from Evolutions, man. Nice. We were just talking up Evolutions. There you go. There's a beautiful card from it. And we got a Pokedex, Poliwhirl, full heal. All right, thank you again. Appreciate it, Andrew. We'll get those protected. Sent right out to you. Very nice. I'll load that quick. For sure, Yachts. Iconic set to open. Even just looking through those commons and uncommons. Nice one there, Andrew. 
Great evolutions card. Couple of uh, hits out of Shining as well. Not bad. All right, Justin T is gonna have three Charizard Chasers now. And then Daniel H going with the Chilling Rain Box. Nice. Great choices, guys. Let me uh, grab a couple of things. I think I have to go grab a couple of Burning Shadows packs quick. Uh, and then we can get right to it here. Check and see if I have any in here first. Congrats again, Andrew. And not bad on the wait, guys. About 20 minutes right now. 15, 20 minutes. Just feel free to get an order in. Can get that personal ripping. Gotta go grab Burning Shadows and Chilling Rain. One sec. evolutions one more shot that would be sweet yeah that would be sweet wow that would be really cool Yeah, just keep looking for it, though. That's all you can do, man. You never know how an opportunity can show up. <clears throat> you literally never know. There should be everything here. Justin, good luck, man. Charizard in every pack. Could you imagine? <laughs> oh my goodness. How's it going everyone? Caleb here with Layton Gaming. It's time for Justin T. Got ourselves three Charizard Chasers. And thanks Justin for grabbing up some group break spots tonight as well, man. Appreciate it. Got two, four, six total shining, three uh, total bundles, two in each bundle. 
And then three burning, three evolutions. That would be literally, I would quit. <laughs> I would have to retire. If I pulled 12 straight Charizards, that would be nuts. I don't think anyone has ever pulled a dozen Charizards in a row. All right, good luck, Shining Fates. Come on. Gotta do it right off the gate, right off the rip here. <laughs> Some high expectations from uh, Justin tonight. Wide Vettel, amazing rare. Hopefully that can do. And a Dreadnought. <laughs> nice, amazing rare first pack. Wow, that's sick, yes, yeah, that's sick. Honestly, that, yeah, that is something that only a very small amount of people like actually have the um, like mental state to do something like that. Like I could not do that. I would not, um, I just wouldn't feel right, you know? Wheezing hollow, my stomach would hurt the whole time, my hands would be shaking the whole time. You couldn't pay me enough to try to pilot my own plane, but there's like a certain amount of people that have like um, that mental capacity that drives them to do stuff like that as well. It's crazy. Rowlet. Ooh, a nice full art. Alchemy V. Full art there. Pretty cool, Justin. Nice. <clears throat> Rusted shield. For sure, for sure. Yeah. Yeah, you'd have to be ultra focused. No, no kidding. <laughs> Rusted shield, Zarud. Exactly, and eventually, exactly. It just becomes second nature. 100%. 100%. I don't doubt that at all. Uh, Grookey. Beyond Mega. <laughs> fair, fair, Justin. <laughs> fair. Yeah, honestly, Daniel, that's like another thing that can definitely be uh, for sure, man. For sure, Daniel. You got to know what you're doing. You get in those situations for sure. Wow, that's pretty good, Yachts. That's pretty dang good, man. Uh, Eldegoss Reverse, Boss's Order. Oh, <laughs> jeez, man. That's nuts. All right, three Burning Shadows. Good luck on these, man. Dude. Yeah, that is that is wild. Fifteen hundred. I mean, it's probably necessary, of course. Got a Lucario reverse holo. Pass missing. Couple more on the burning shadows. Uh, a lonely Grimer as you Meryl. Yeah, yeah, I used to drive some uh, larger vehicles at my uh, one of my older jobs um, when I was doing like landscaping and stuff. Some larger trucks that had trailers and stuff, like F450s with trailers. So yeah, I hear you, Daniel. You can get in those situations where the traffic's just not right. You know, Scolipede reverse. Ooh, hollow vial film on the back. There you go, out of the burning shadows. All right, let's heat it up at the end with the evolutions. Let's do it, man. Always down to rip evolutions. Good luck, man. Justin T, three evolutions here, closing out the three Charizard chasers. Let's find one of those there Charizards at the end. Good luck. Wow, there it is. Reverse Charizard, boom. Yes, very nice. All right. So here it is now, guys. So one of my goals, like big, big goal, I would love to pull a reverse Charizard um, and follow it up with a hollow Charizard in uh, the same pack. It's very possible. It's not very possible. It is possible. Um, so you can get the reverse in this slot. The slot behind this could have like a full hollow hit still. So hopes and prayers. I really, really want to do this sometime. Uh, pull the reverse with the hollow. So let's see. Got Starmie. Fair enough. <laughs> Fair enough. But very nice. First evolutions. Reverse Zard. Congrats. Congrats. But that's why these are so fun. It's crazy. So like I said, that's the reverse hollow slot. You can get that Charizard there. Um, and then this is the hollow rare or better slot. So hypothetically, if you are really lucky 
I know a couple of people have done it online. Uh, you can pull that reverse and follow it up with a hollow zard, which is just like, how? <laughs> you know? Craziness. Uh, but congrats, man. We will get that one magged up for you. That's awesome. Congrats on that reverse Charizard. Very sick card, man. And we got two more still. What a start, though. What a start. But yeah, one day I'm really hoping to do that. Pull that reverse and then follow it up with a big hollow. Oh, we got the break card. Starmie back again. <laughs> Starmie is back for some more. Break card. And far-fetched. Blastoise Spirit Link. And the last one. Good luck. <clears throat> last pack. Magic. Got Professor's Oakint. And Slowbro EX. Nice. There you go, Justin. Slowbro EX to finish it out. And we'll actually finish it out with a bonus hit as well. I only have two left here, so... <laughs> And stop. Good luck. Oh, nice. Slow bro. First Ed from Fossil. There you go, Justin. Very sick. And then Daniel, you'll get whatever uh, the other bonus it is. There you go. Congrats. Nice. Couple of uh, Slow Bros to end it out. Look at that. How far it's come. This is where we started. First edition Slow Bro. This is like the Slow Bro rookie card, actually, right here. Uh, this was the first ever time Slow Bro made a set in Fossil. Here's the rookie, um, and yeah, crazy to see how far we've come with these ultra advanced artworks, like this one here, crazy. Congrats again, man, appreciate it, and awesome reverse. Good stuff, man. Always nice to see a reverse Zard. Three Charizard chasers. True, Jacob, true, I'm just saying with uh, the Charizard itself. But correct, that does happen when in evolving. Yeah, but I just mean with the Charizard. Specifically, um, pulling a reverse and a hollow is ridiculous. But yep, exactly. It does for sure happen. Usually a couple times a case, I would say, in evolving. Yep. Good point. It would just be kind of mind blowing, though, to have a pair of Charizards in your hand like that, you know? <laughs> I think I've pulled a reverse before with a Mega Charizard in the same pack. Pretty sure I had Reverse and Mega in the same pack, but I'm not sure if I ever had, like I know I've never had Reverse and um, Full. Yeah, thank you, Sean, I'll get that in just a sec. And there was one earlier tonight I have to add as well, 329 there on the counter. Appreciate that, and Daniel, good luck, Chilling Rain. Holy cow, that's crazy yachts. I would just say no thanks. <laughs> that's crazy, man. Truly. That's nuts. Get you that Snorlax, Daniel says. I'd be down, man. I'd be down. Let me get the box. I did just grab a full case. Get my knife. Open up that full case quick. Where did I put it? There it is. That's nuts, Yachts. That's, that's just, no thanks. That's just a big no thanks. <laughs> All right, Dan, good luck, man. One shilling. No, for sure though, man. I saw your message earlier, Dan. I had a big hit right when I pulled it, or when I saw your message. I could not imagine a semi though. Like I said, a 450 with the trailer was plenty. That was plenty. I couldn't see out the back window either, which kind of sucked. But, yeah, no. Yeah, go ahead. Feel free to order something. Nothing after Daniel. So, definitely some space. Feel free to get something in. Nothing after Daniel. Only about 10 minutes on the wait. Anyone, feel free to get something in. Good luck here, Daniel. How's it going, everyone? Caleb here with Layton Gaming. 
It's time for Daniel H. Got a Chilling Rain ETV. Or a uh, booster, that is. <laughs> Not an ETV. Good luck. Let's do it, Daniel. Looking for the Golden Snorlax, he said. Great choice. I know, yeah, it's exactly. Exactly. That's just crazy how, like, two people can just have, like, a completely different mindset. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> let's see, Justin. Let's see, indeed. Wow. I'd be down, man. Empty there. Good luck. Keep these going. Rillaboom and Whalerin. Avery. Oh, for sure. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, it's, that would definitely be like a huge confident boost. Like forever. Bangers! Woo! There it is. Get that mag right away, Daniel. There it is. Congrats, man. Let's go! Woo-hoo! Already! It took no time. Wow, like two packs. Literally like two packs. Unbelievable. <laughs> Heck yeah! Heck yeah, Daniel! Heck yeah, there it is. Golden Snorlax. Boom! Wow. Oh yeah, very nice. Really good centering. Yeah, it does have nice centering. Maybe just a little heavy on the bottom, like a tiny bit. Left to right is nice though. Very nice, let's check out the back quick. Yeah, just a little bit heavy on the bottom, like I said. A little bit heavy on the bottom compared to the top. No whitening, though. Congrats. That's got a chance at a gen. Good chance. Congrats, man. Really nice. <laughs> wow. That was awesome. Took just a couple of packs. I saw the gold coming in the pack right when I opened it. <laughs> I saw there was a gold. I was just hoping, man, that it could be the Snorlax for you. And it was indeed. Congrats, Daniel. Wow. Nice one. I'll toss that back there for now. Congrats. Let's go. Literally just two packs in. So many left. And let's find an alt, man. Let's find an alt. <clears throat> yeah, the god pack was pretty funny, Flip. The god pack was pretty funny. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, Mareep. Surfetched. Yeah, we had a god pack earlier in Nightfall. That was fantastic. <laughs> right, Yachts. Got cast form, Obama Snow. Congrats again, man. That's so sick. Just a couple of packs. Right out of the fresh case as well. Very sick. What a way to start. Hopefully a good case. Congrats again. Uh, Haunter, Zangoose. That's one of my favorites to pull as well. Get him better on camera here. There we go. Definitely one of my favorites. Look at him shine. Woo! Look at him shine. That is so nice. Look at him shine. Yeah, Brandon, for real, man. Ooh, Celebi VMAX. Nice card, Daniel. Very nice. Yeah, for sure, Yachts, for sure. And if you're familiar with the sports card channel, Yachts, where they um, have, like, the start of the breaks and stuff like that, have that little slideshow, we're planning to have one of those in the future. Yeah, that might be a good one for that. That's a tough-to-hit card, man. That's only the second time we've pulled that one from Chilling Rain. Uh, and it, it's taken a lot of cases to only get two. Metagross V. Yeah, exactly, exactly, Yachts. We're planning to have one of those in the pretty near future. Maybe something to add in there for sure. Whirlipede, uh, Hatterene Hollow. Yeah, thanks. We figured as well. Yep. So, Brandon, yeah, one thing that my uh, university does that's really nice 
um, is they have a rental system, so we just rent them. And then we have to return them at the end of the year. So that's pretty sweet. Uh, Cacleon, you don't actually have to buy any textbooks ever. Malamar, Whalerin. Because it is pretty painful having to purchase them. Especially when you use them for a couple of months and then... Or you don't even use them sometimes, it feels like. Molt Tresby. I, I especially don't use them. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I'm not really a textbook guy. I get scammed on textbooks, says Yachts. Yeah. Yeah, there's a really good system at all the Wisconsin universities where it's rented out. Uh, Thunderous Hollow. <laughs> oh, Daniel. Hey, I hope so as well, man. Larvesta Obama Snow. Good luck on it, Justin. Saw that order come in. Good luck, man. I appreciate it. Got something stuck here. Santa Con to be mine. It's nice. Yeah, I, I hear you, Yachts. I hear you. Uh, shop it. Cobalion Hollow. Oh, wow, Brandon. That's pretty nice. That's really smart, Brandon. That's really smart. There it is. Still shining back there. Fire resistant gloves, Asmussen. <laughs> so Charizard in every pack is still a possibility. <laughs> oh, man. That would be a glitch. That would be a really good glitch, Justin. <laughs> uh, Inke, Zev Striker. Once again, I would be retiring. <laughs> oh, wow, that's nice as well, Yachts. Yeah, that's really nice. Serena. Oh, for sure, for sure, yeah. Yeah, the whole idea of it is you're just taking other people's work and, yeah. <laughs> the whole idea. Zeb Strika. There's always multiple parties around, along the way that probably don't have, like, fair use and stuff. I'm not going to pour it onto one person. They are definitely scams, yep. Clara, Doug Trio. I'd love to pair this with an alt art. Maybe the Blaziken VMAX alt. That's a card I've never pulled. Blaziken VMAX alt. The Wacky, Shaman Hollow. Love to pair it up with that, Daniel. Sawsbuck, Gallade. <laughs> the heart thinks differently than the mind. <laughs> Ooh, we got something stuck again. Ooh, Blaziken V Full Art. Ah, yes. Nice full art, though. A little bit of a tease, though, I would say. Great full art hit, though. Congrats. Celio. I turned off that game a while ago. Yeah, it's, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I turned it off a little while ago. Once the Chiefs hit 42, I stopped watching. Uh, Sawsbuck. I was hoping for some closer games. A lot of blowouts in the first round, unfortunately. That's alright. Hopefully they get closer as it goes on. Weezing, Cinderace Hollow. A little bit left here. Fair. <laughs> Fair. I uh, got Zapdos V. Nice. Melanie. Crap Lock Talo. Brawly. Golurk. Reverse Talo. And got Lipard V. Nice, grab a sleeper, Lipard. Solid. Uh, score bunny, Bennett. Chest plate at the back. Uh, Sabal and Volcarona.
Pasmussen, and Amphros. Wow, this box has not had a lot besides that Snorlax. I'm not going to lie, Daniel, unfortunately. It had the Snorlax, um, and not a ton else, though. Yes, Daniel. Steamy Reverse, Pasmussen. Um, correct. We are going to get that stuff uploaded to the site, Daniel. I'll probably work on that on either Tuesday or Thursday, one of my next two off days coming up. Um, I'll work on getting... Um, we have, like, mags that we can list, sleeves. We also have, like, um, like Ultra Pro sleeves and stuff like that, and stuff like that for playing the games. Uh, so, yeah, I can work on some of that stuff on Tuesday and Thursday. Uh, TCG Player is not bad, Brandon. TCG Player is pretty respectable. Volcanion V. There you go, Daniel. Yeah, I know, man. That's what I was saying earlier, Yachts. It sucks that he had to go out like that. But that's how most quarterbacks go out with a loss, <laughs> unfortunately. Mareep. Chrysalia Hollow. And the last pack. Come on, some more magic. Got Swirlix and Zeb Striker. Well, congrats again, Daniel. Slower one, other than, of course, that Snorlax Hollow. Congrats again, man. Appreciate it. And um, I'll get you one bonus hit as well. The last one is going to be Blaine's Growlithe. Very nice, man. Congrats again. Appreciate it. Wow. <laughs> Incredible. Yeah, exactly, Daniel. Exactly. Um, so just, I would advise you, Daniel, just hold off like a day or two because there's going to be um, a little bit different of a variety of supplies on our website. Um, so for that reason, we will, uh, I would probably advise you just hold off like a day or two. I can get that stuff up on Tuesday. Um, but yeah, exactly, Daniel. All you have to do to qualify for free shipping on that stuff is as long as you have an order that's going out, uh, we can still ship all that stuff out for free, whatever you might need. I know, I saw that flip. That happened right in front of Lane's section. Lane was at the game. That was happening right in front of him. He said that uh, um, the guys in front of him are throwing chicken tenders on the field. And I said that's pretty expensive. <laughs> pretty expensive. Yeah, appreciate it, Daniel. Appreciate it. I'll keep you updated. No problem, man. My pleasure to pull one like that. One of my favorite ever cards. Uh, yes, we probably will. Yes, we will. The stickers that you see there on the mags, we likely will have latent gaming stickers uh, within a month or so, probably, I would say. Those will be awesome. They will have that galaxy theme color on them. It'll say Leighton still. I know, it's funny, Flip. It's funny. But chicken tenders, man, at a, at a game are expensive. <laughs> They're expensive. Yeah, so pretty excited for that, Yachts. That'll be sweet. Jeez, man, the Metazoo packs make my hands extra dry. Holy cow. We've been using, like, additional cream. Justin, Evolutions Booster Box. Holy cow, man. This is going to be a great time, Justin. Let me find one. Don't know if it's in here or not. It's, might be in the safe. Be right back, man. Yeah, Evolution's full booster box, guys. Coming up next for Justin. Going big. That is true, Flip. That is true. <laughs> That's fair. That's fair, man. <laughs> uh, yeah, he's not in here. I'll be right back. Let me go grab one. Those are in the safe. Let's find a couple Charizards. Let's find a couple. I saw the, the video earlier about Evolving Skies, Sean. I saw it. I haven't watched it, though. I just saw it pop up, the recommendation. I'm excited to watch it tonight.
I have a feeling, I think it's about Evolving Skies. Uh, the most recent video. I'm pretty sure it's about Evolving Skies. I haven't watched it yet though. Although I probably shouldn't watch that. Otherwise, I'm just gonna end up buying more Evolving Skies. <laughs> so I should probably just like, delete that video so I never watch it. Although he's just gonna tell me it's not a bad thing. All right, Justin, good luck. Let's do it. Evolutions time, let's do it, man. How's it going, everyone? Caleb here with Layton Gaming. It's time for Justin T. Got ourselves an Evolutions booster box. Oh yeah! Let's get this thing going, man. Best of luck here. XY Evolutions. As good as it gets in the XY era. Full booster box for Justin T. Good luck, man. And appreciate it, Justin. Uh, I will leave them in the booster box, actually. Slide that there. So that looks beautiful. Let's do this, man. 36 Evolutions packs. Uh, this is going to be an all-card ship as well for you, unless you don't want them. But it will be all-card ship otherwise. Uh, we will get you all those sweet commons and uncommons uh, from the sets. Like the Charmander, stuff like that. Good start. Reverse Charmeleon, first pack. And a Dugong. Nice reverse Charmeleon. Pack number one. Hopefully a sign of uh, some more fire type hits to come. Shall see. Got a Magmar. Seems to be fire a lot. A lot of fire so far. Beedrill. Seems to be a lot of fire. Weedle, Reverse Hollow, Farfetch'd behind that. Revive. Exactly, Firebox would be great, Justin. <laughs> exactly. You're thinking the same. Diglett, ooh, nice, Hollow, gonna be Zapdos. Very cool. That's that base set unlimited reprint of the Hollow Zapdos. Nice, Justin. Beauty. Love all these hollows. Seeing them again are just uh, some great cards. Really nice. Congrats, Zapdos Hollow. Charizard Spirit Link at the back. Growlithe Reverse. So many fire hits so far. Starmie. Oh, nice. Secret Rare. And McCunies to Duo. Secret Rare. Nice. Haunter. Blastoise Spirit Link. Eating up a little bit now since that Zapdos. Good to see. Pikachu there. Ooh, nice. The break card is going to be Ninetales. Ninetales break card there for you, Justin. Uh, Raticate behind it. Magmar Venusaur Spirit Link. Another fire type hit. Holy cow. one here. XY Evolutions. Got a... something stuck here to the grass energy. What's it gonna be? Oh, very nice! Mega Pidgeot EX. That's the full art. Mega Pidgeot. Wow, beauty. There you go. I knew there was something stuck to that grass energy. Congrats on that hit. Mega Pidgeot EX. Beauty. Starting to heat up. Next one. Should be a good game there, Sean. Should be a good game. Coughing reverse. Dugong. Got nice reverse Charizard Spirit Link. Solid reverse to get. 
got the shiny Charizard and the non-shiny on the right. Actually, a pretty dang good reverse. Congrats. Oh, and Mega Venusaur EX. Fun pack there. Nice. Congrats on your Mega Venusaur as well now, Justin. Good stuff in that pack. Pokedex there. More sleeves. Eating it up. Keep it going. Have I ordered cards off YouTube? Yeah, I have. Yes. I have. What is the question? Yes, that's the problem with it, Flip. Exactly. Exactly. Caterpie. Mewtwo. Rare there. Most of the stuff that I order off TCG um, is going to be cards that I don't at all care about what their condition is. Not at all. Like, if they're cards for my deck, if they are cards for... Um, uh, what else was I going to say? If they're cards for, like, my PC, but I don't care about the condition... Like sometimes certain stuff applies for that rule uh, but if it's like something i'm looking to put together like a nice like mint uh like complete set i probably would find somewhere else just because you will get near mint cards there will be like a white ding usually stuff like that they they will be near mint they will not be mint metapod reverse Ooh, a hollow nine tails nice congrats on the hollow nine tails Yo, nice Minecraft. Big hit for you, Minecraft. Congrats on the hollow nine tails now. Nice one. I love nine tails. Keep these going. Yeah, you said it, Flip. That's pretty much the biggest disadvantage. Magikarp reverse hollow. That's sweet. Dug Trio. So many great cards and evolutions. And nothing after evolutions, guys. This uh, box here. For Justin, nothing after that. If you're looking for something tonight, feel free to get that order in latentgaming.com. Let's keep this going here. For Justin, Magnemite, Reverse, and an Arcanine. Uh, Super Potion at the back. Almost halfway, not quite though. Actually, quite a few packs left before halfway. Jeez. Quite a few hits. Not bad. Electabuzz Reverse, Electrode Rare, and Kakuna. Nice Minecraft, good luck. Pull something else sick, man. Yeah, no joke, Cha. No, no joke, man. Justin, you are not wrong. Let's change that, man. Kakuna, got Slowbro EX. Just had one of these for you earlier. Slowbro. Yeah, no joke, man. You're not kidding. He's holding out. But like I said, we still got 20 plus packs. There's 21 left. Good luck, man. Holding out, but plenty to go. Come on, what is going on with this pack? There we go. It's Charmander at the front. Unbelievable. <laughs> Don't even know what to say about that one. All right, good luck. Keep these going. Misty's Determination, Reverse, nice. Beedrill, another Misty's Haunter. See something shiny. Tell yourself something nice, Minecraft. Nice flip, that's awesome. I think that's the same for many people. Ooh, nice, Mewtwo EX. There are a lot of iconic Kanto Pokemon in this set. And of course, the commons and uncommons are reprints from Base Set Unlimited or whatever you want to say, Base Set. So it's it's sweet stuff. Sweet stuff. High quality, for sure. Yeah, for sure, Flip. That's very true. There was a time, but not anymore, that's for sure. Got a hollow fire. They're teasing us. They are teasing us. And we got Farfetch'd. A lot of different ways, to be honest, Yachts. Executor. Nice secret. There you go. I don't remember. This specific one might have been through DealerNet, potentially. Not too sure. Nice hollow fire. A lot of stuff comes from distribution. Some stuff comes from the secondary markets. Really does depend. <clears throat> 
Ooh, that's a nice card. That's a really nice card, Minecraft. Really nice. Your hands are hot tonight, Minecraft. We need you open up the packs. We got Machamp break. There you go, another break card, Machamp. Very solid. Dog Trio. Magmar. Uh, 775 on the website, Jimmy. 775. That's pretty much right where the market price is on it as well. Nice Machamp break. Yeah, 775 is pretty fair to where the markets. I've seen some quite a bit over as well. Uh, Ghastly Reverse. Star Me Rare. Professor's Oak Hint. They used to be at like 11 or 1200 about maybe 10 ish months ago. Misty's Tears? Which one is that, Kimmy? Is that the one that's banned in Japan? <clears throat> Or is that not the one I'm thinking of? Got a de-evolution spray and an Arcanine. Yeah, that as well. Yeah, it's exactly. Exactly. Evolutions is like one of the most faked sets, honestly. That's, that's very correct, man. It's one of the most fake sets. Got to duo... And Raticates. Yeah, that's what I mean. Unfortunately. Unfortunately. <clears throat> it's banned from PSA? Um, Potentially, Kimmy. There's someone I can message on Discord that could potentially have that card. There's someone I know that has a huge Japanese collection. So I could let you know, Kimmy. I'm always talking to him. Uh, Machamp. Nice. Hollow. Very cool. If you remember some random time tomorrow, just shoot me a Discord sometime tomorrow as well. I'll try to remember it. I'll message him at some point in time, see if he's got any. Nice Machamp Hollow there. But yeah, I'm familiar with the card you're talking about now. Uh, there's not enough clothing on the, uh, trainer, I'm pretty sure, Brandon. Pretty limited clothing on the, uh, Misty trainer. I believe. Polyweg, Electrode, I don't know if there's any other reasons. Yeah. <laughs> exactly, like Kimmy said, she's not really wearing any clothes. It's a really weird card. <laughs> it really is. I can let you know, Kimmy. Wow, very nice, Justin! Reverse Charizard! The holdout has ended. The holdout is over. Ooh, well centered as well, Justin. Nice! Congrats. Very nice. What's behind it? Ooh, Mewtwo, that's a sick pack. That's a sick pack, man. Two powerhouses right there, Justin. Two absolute powerhouses. Reverse Charizard and a Mewtwo. Very cool pack, man. I'll take that one. Good stuff, Justin. Congrats. Congrats. He indeed did show up. Holdout has ended. Pretty cool pack, like I said. We'll get that one, Max. Um, to see a Mewtwo as well there. A couple of iconic Pokemon there. Mewtwo. I'll get that Mewtwo sleep quick as well. You are having a lucky night, Minecraft. Holy. Yeah, there definitely is, Brandon. Across other trading card games, for sure there is. For sure. For sure, man. You are 100% right. Tangela, Blastoise EX. Uh, but you gotta remember. Nice Blastoise. First Blastoise. Yeah, nice. Potion. You gotta remember, Brandon. It's supposed to be like a kid's card game still. So something like that is like pretty, pretty dang... Um, uh, like, scene is like obscene at that point. Okay, let me make sure, Kimmy, it's the one I'm thinking of. Yes, correct. With Star You, or Star Me. Like I said, pretty limited clothing. <laughs> what is it, like Japanese gym heroes or something? 
uh, Nidorino Reverse, Dugong. Is it a hard card to find? It can be. Um, it can be. It's not extremely expensive, but it's uh, a lot of people like having it. It's not like ridiculous though, Yachts. It's desired though, it's desired, I'll say that. It's not impossible to find, but it is desired. And it's, it's old as well, it's from an old Japanese vintage set. So it is old. Uh, Pidgeot Spirit Link, and a Polyrath Hollow. Nice, another Hollow. Polyrath. Look at him, he's ready for battle. Very cool, Polyworld, Porygon. Nice. Hollow hit there, Justin. Ooh, nice! Reverse Pikachu. Congrats, man. I love this card. Reverse Hollow Pikachu. The Yellow Cheeks. Nice one there, man. And Beedrill. Very nice. Congrats on... Ooh, and it's Secret Rare Executor. Nice. Very solid hit. Was it a recent ban or was it always been banned? Um, I'm pretty sure PSA hasn't accepted the card for a few years. I don't think it's too recent. I think it's kind of been like a cancelled card, you know, cancelled for like a little while, honestly. Yeah, Brandon, I just had, uh, I was talking about that in Discord earlier today. And right at the start of the stream, uh, what is it, Legends of Arceus or Arceus Legends or something like that? Yeah, it's gonna be sweet on Switch. I'm just finishing up Pearl, I have a little tiny bit left. And so I'll be ready for it, yep. It looks awesome though. I like how you can like, the Pokemon like come at you and stuff like that. It looks sweet. Uh, hollow Water, Farfetch'd. True Flip, yeah. Zapdos Reverse, very sick. Nice one. Yeah, fair, Brandon. Fair. <clears throat> Makes sense. Nice reverse Zapdos. Dragon IDX as well. Nice. Congrats. Nice one. Dragonite. And a Zapdos reverse hollow. Very cool card. But that definitely makes sense, Brandon. We got three left. Energy retrieval, Starmie. Yeah, that's what I mean. Yeah, it's, it is kind of cool because they'll never be more graded. So what's out there is out there. Yep. At least by PSA, that is. I'm not sure if Beckett accepts the card still. Few to go, man. Brock Grit. Eradicate. Metapod. Alright, how many we got left? I see two. I see three. And an empty box there. Alright, three here. Uh, not too bad, Dylan. Uh, I got one booster box after this. About ten minutes or so. About ten minutes, Dylan. Feel free to place an order. It'll be ripping about ten minutes from now. Ooh, nine tails reverse now. Nice card. Beauty. Uh, Doug Trio, ooh, Flying Pikachu, Secret, Coughing, Misty's Determination, nice. Flying Pikachu and Ninetales. Uh, two packs remaining, good luck on this one. Onyx, Reverse, Dugong. The evolution spray. All right, last one. Hey, thank you again, Justin. Fun time ripping this many evolutions, man. Really appreciate the order. Ooh, Trousy reverse. Nice, another hollow at the back. Hitmonchan. Nice. I love this uh, hollow background as well. It is indeed clean. Very cool. And Charmeleon. How would I do a collector's chest? I would just open it. Just open it. Open all the packs for you. You'd get everything besides the chest. 
everything but the chest ships. If you want the chest, you have to order a ship it. And if you do want the chest, let me know. I can put it in stock for ship it. Like I said, everything but it ships otherwise. The stickers, the notepad and stuff. If you do want that actual lunchbox, let me know and I can stock one for ship it and then we can ship it to you sealed. All right, all right. Thank you again, Justin. Appreciate it. We'll get those uh, protected. Sent right out to you, man. Yeah, it is always fun. It is always fun. 36 whole packs of it. I'll update that counter in just a second. Let me upload the video first. To the YouTubes. That's pretty dang hard, Brandon, to be honest. Pretty dang hard. I think I've pulled just as many of those as like some alternate arts. The full arts and evolving are pretty tough hits. Not gonna lie to you. They're just as hard as an alternate art hit, I would say. If that's really the only card you want, might as well just buy it, to be honest. I mean, there's so much else in Evolving, which is nice. Of course. So much. But yeah, that specific card is one that you... You could go cases without seeing it, honestly. Just because, like I said, there's just so many hits in uh, Evolving that it's tough to narrow it down to just like a couple of them. Just too many. Never too many, actually. <laughs> I take that back. I take that back. All right, Jamin, coming up next. I think it's Crypto Nation second hit. Alright, Jamin, good luck here. Appreciate ya. Uh, the only problem with that, Yachts, is we have, like, just a very small amount of them left. So it's probably not something that's ever gonna go down on our site, unfortunately. To be honest with ya. <clears throat> a majority of the time we use those for group breaks as well, to be honest. It's a really fun group break because there's a lot of uh, awesome promos and stuff. So we do usually just use them for group breaks. Uh, we offer it for personals, but um, we don't have a ton left considering that that's something that we are never going to be able to get again, unfortunately. It's not going to be printed anymore. Good luck, Jamin. Let's do it. There's just like certain products like that always. Let's do this one. How's it going, everyone? Caleb here with Layton Gaming. It's time for Jamin L. Got a Cryptid Nation second ed booster box. Good luck. Let's get into this. Yeah, and like I said, it also just comes down to the fact, yes, that unfortunately once we do go through like the, you know, like dozen or whatever the heck is left, um, a two dozen, it's just never going to be something that we are able to get more of. Never going to be printed again. Good luck, Jamin. Let's do this. Yeah, for sure, Brandon, for sure. Like I said, um, full arts and evolving are honestly just as tough in it as in alternate arts. You see just as many, like if you open a case, you'll probably see just as many alternate arts as full arts, like really close. Um, if you're talking about like VMAXs and stuff like that, then it's definitely more possible. But full arts are actually pretty tough hits nowadays. Pretty dang tough hits. Alright, good luck here. Jamin. 
get into this for you. Got Mermaid Scales Reverse. <laughs> That's funny, Yachts. Hey, appreciate you, man. Appreciate you. And appreciate the late night chat as well. Piazza Bird Reverse. Nice. Always fun. Keeps the stream nice and live. All right, nice. Got Dylan coming up next as well, then, with the Darkness Ablaze booster box. Good luck, Dylan. Got that Darkness Ablaze booster box coming up next. Ghost Train. Nice, Jamin. Full hollow. Congrats. Tough to hit. Ghost Train. Nice, Dylan. Good luck on the Darkness. That'll be ripping right after this box here. Got Fresno Nightcrawlers Reverse. Oh, for sure, yeah. It's, and it's uh, very active earlier in the night when we do get those group breaks and stuff popping off. Fresno Nightcrawlers Reverse. Uh, from that set, it's been a booster box or two at least now at this point. Earth's Core Full. It might be two booster boxes without one. Maybe. Which is pretty dang good because that Charizard is only like... Uh, I would say like every like two or three boxes it pops out. Uh, nice growth full hollow. But yeah, for sure. Sometimes when it does get later into the personals and stuff, uh, yachts, it can get a little bit slower for sure. Or eternal snowflake reverse. Eternal snowflake reverse. Fair, Brandon. Fair. Unending Fire Crystal Full Hollow. Nice. Very cool. Ooh, Hodag Full. Very solid. Very solid. The YouTube is also always way more popping than the Twitch yachts. I feel bad you're always kind of all alone over there. <laughs> YouTube chat is always a lot more active. <clears throat> Funeral Mountain Reverse. But yeah, appreciate it, Dylan. Good luck. Own party over here. Right, man. Right. <laughs> Funeral Mountain again. Reverse Hollow. You're holding it down for us, yeah. It's Chupacabra Reverse now. Nice, Jamin. Uh, Squink. Reverse Hollow. MetaZoo has been crazy in terms of uh, in terms of what, Dylan? But yeah, I would agree. <laughs> no matter what you're saying, I would probably agree. GG Bird reverse there. It's pretty dang hot um, in terms of like, just like how much of it we've been selling, I guess. GG Bird reverse. Uh, the singles as well on the marketplace are, are doing really well. They're very desirable. People are, a lot of people are looking to put together complete sets. Black Hole Shard reverse. So yeah, it's it's been hype for sure. Got Snallygaster Reverse. It's been hype for sure. It's got some really awesome concepts though. Uh, Slide Rock Bolter, Full Hollow. There are short print cards, which are awesome. It, uh, it makes for a huge chase, short print cards to 100. Uh, so that makes for a huge chase. You get a hollow or a reverse um, foil in every single pack. So that's nice. You're never gonna go without a foil. Hodag Reverse there. And uh, yeah, I think uh, a lot of the beasties, which is like uh, the characters, look really nice. Uh, currently, we do ship all cards on these. Could be changing in the future, but currently, yes. Banana Man Reverse. Yep, we do ship all cards on this one. Walking Sam Reverse. I do just get right to the hollow, as we've seen all the commons and uncommons many times. Uh, mermaid scales reverse so i do jump right to the hollow skip the comments but they do all ship still currently yep hugging molly reverse that's that's facts yachts yeah the the emotes are all on twitch for sure loveland frogman very nice full hollow congrats nice card there go jamin frog for you congrats on that loveland frogman Second Ed, very nice.
Uh, Snallygaster, full hollow. Very cool. <laughs> What's up, Owie? Enfield Monster Reverse. Black Hole Shardful. Another full, get that out of here. Box Topper at the end, Jamin. Matlock's Reverse. Nice, Dylan. Good luck on it. Trip O'Darrow Reverse. Yeah, right. Always got that loose pack or whatever. But a whole booster. Nice. Good luck. Blood Ruby Reverse. Very nice. <laughs> Yachts. I hear you. <laughs> That's funny, man. I hear you. Hoop Snake Reverse Hollow. Nice purchase, though, man. Got Metal Man of Alabama Reverse. Yeah, that's correct, Sean. That's correct. Slide Rock Bolter Full. Nice one. And an Earth Score. Reverse. All right, last one. Good luck. Let's close it out. Cryptid Nation, second edition. Nice, Dylan. Nice. Anything special? Guess anything could be special, depending on you ask. <laughs> right in the last pack, Jamin. Ocean. On the back in the box topper. There you go, Jamin. Appreciate it, as always. Get those all protected and sent right out to you, Jamin. Thank you again. Yeah, it makes sense, Yachts. Yeah, makes sense. I think that's a good choice. I think it's a good choice. We had that talk earlier. <laughs> they are not going to believe me. <laughs> that's funny. That's funny. It's all right. I had to tell my parents I was trying to move across the country to play with cards. So, yeah. Can't go any worse, right? Just kidding, it actually didn't even go bad. <laughs> but that's very true, Dylan. It used to be like two hundred dollars plus for a decent amount of time. That's very correct. Used to be over two hundred dollars, even like 170, 180 a booster box. When it first released, it was more obtainable. Um, and then it had a quick spike. And yeah, it, fa it fell back down a little bit. And it's a good time to get a whole booster box, exactly, 140. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's exactly, it's, yeah, it is. And it takes a lot to be in the loop as well. A lot of research, knowledge, time. It takes a lot of that. Resources. Those resources are all valuable. Oh, nice, Dylan. That's good stuff. I was never able to keep that sealed myself. Maybe for like a couple weeks and then I would just uh, open it. <laughs> for myself at least. Get that darkness ablaze guys, we'll get it going. still and that's still dang if i mean if you've only been in for that amount of time even having some hidden fates is pretty dang good
All right. Make sure that's uploading. It is. And good luck, Dylan. Let's do it. Yeah, you said it. This set used to be quite expensive. <laughs> that's happened in the past to many people, Dylan. You are not on an island there. Certainly not on an island. Many, many people that's happened to. Good luck, man. Let's get it going, Dylan. Appreciate you. How's it going, everyone? Caleb here with Layton Gaming. It's time for Dylan S. Got a Darkness Ablaze booster box. Good luck on this. And guys, about a 10-minute wait right now. If you are looking for something still, check out the homepage of the website, LaytonGaming.com. Be live about another hour or until the order stops. So get something in soon if you are looking for it. And good luck, Dylan. Darkness ablaze. There she is. Let's do it. Yeah, hoping for a Charizard V Max. That would be fantastic. I know it's painful to think about stuff like that. It can be painful. Complete that. Cool. Good luck. Darkness time. Yeah, hopefully it's the one. Exactly. It's painful though, Yats. You're right. <laughs> uh, Skarmory. Reverse hollow. Kangaskhan hollow. Can you go with the Kangaskhan? Denny. Um, electric. I don't think so for Pokemon Yachts. I don't think so. Could be incorrect, but I don't think so. Reverse Kangaskhan. Swanna. Kangaskhan kind of start here. Bunch of them. Kangaskhan everywhere. All right, next one. Looking for Charizard V Max, of course. Tyranitar, Excelligor. Yeah, and they picked some great designs as well, Yachts, to go ahead and choose that. Hollow Charizard reprints. It's a great choice um, on that card. And then also going with the base set Pikachu. Another very popular card and uh, a safe choice for sure. Dedenne. Hollow Blaziken. Having some sweet reverses and hollows, but got to get over to the hits now. Yeah, they couldn't have done too much better on the selections of uh, the Pokemon that they did pick. Got Scizor V. Nice. Metal type hit. There you go. Scizor V. Very nice. Scissor. <clears throat> Celebrations is fun. It is fun. It's nice seeing reprint cards that are just like completely unobtainable. Like that Umbreon uh, Gold Star in real life. Uh, like the, uh, not real life. <laughs> the original copy of uh, the Umbreon Gold Star is like thousands of dollars. Like tens of thousands of dollars. Uh, Dracovish Hollow. So having a nice reprint copy that's, you know, like $30, $40. It's awesome. Allows people to still have something sick like that in their collection. Say the same about that minty uh, hollow Charizard in the set, Mr. Rhyme, and then many others in the set as well fall into that same category. Exactly, exactly, Yachts. Dartrix, S. Cavalier. Slow start, but lots of packs. Not stressing yet, Dylan. Slow start, lots of packs, man. Come on. Ooh, turn it around, Mew V. Nice. There you go, Mew V. Very cool, Dylan. Love some Mew. The OG Mew V as well. He got that reprint in Fusion. This one's uh, the OG. <laughs> Very nice. There you go, Dylan. Exactly, Yachts. Yo, what's up, Giannis? I think it's Giannis. Shinotic, Del Caddy. Welcome, welcome, thanks for stopping by. Ripping through a Darkness Ablaze booster box right now for uh, Dylan. 
Got Sinisty and Hippodon. Nice, Giannis. Same, I hear you. Same. <clears throat> you probably love the channel. We do random energy style breaks here. Really, really fun concepts. Random energy style. Oh, we got big parasol. Nice. Gold card. Beauty. I love gold. Nice one. Congrats. Big parasol. Nice. The umbrella. Gold card. Beauty. Nice hit there. From Buskin. Code there. Saki, gotcha. Easy enough. Keep these going. Struggle gloves, Excelgor. Oh yeah, the Mario and Luigi, yeah. PSA 9 and 10 are just, they've just been pretty much going like this, you know? <laughs> They're just going up in price yachts. That Mario and Luigi Pikachu, man. Oh, those are some great cards though. What a great collab. Two of the most iconic franchises. Ooh! Full Art Stunfisk. Nice. There you go. Beautiful Full Art Stunfisk. Nice card. But yeah, you said it, man. Those are cards that are literally just, you know, just been ticking up, it seems like. Nice Stunfisk there. We're heating up now. There we go. Good stuff, Dylan. Good stuff. Uh, Sir Fetch Reverse Sanfros. Rare, non hollow. this out here man good luck first half getting to the end of it swana yeah yeah it's like hypothetically like where are those two franchises going you know got larvitar and talent flame all right second half here good luck now let's get into it dylan half number two of the booster box darkness of blaze and like i said guys if you're looking for something tonight I do not have anything after Dylan, so appreciate it, everyone. Blaziken Hollow. Been a fun stream tonight as we did just hit seven hours. Appreciate that. If you do want something, feel free to get that order in at latentgaming.com. I can get it ripping after this box for Dylan. We are wrapping up the night here. Exactly, man. And they have so much, like, Pokemon has so much beyond just the cards. You know, the games, the plush, uh, plushes and stuff, muck. It really does. It's always going to carry um, the franchise beyond just the cards. Looking for this guy. Come on. Looking for that guy there. What camera do we use? Uh, a pretty fancy one. It's a Canon uh, Vixia HFG50. I think it's like 1300 or something for the camera. It's a pretty high-end camera. We got a Crobat V. Nice. And we just use like Logie cameras on the desktop monitor for that uh, face cam and stuff. Nice Crobat V. But yeah, we do have a nice, really nice Canon with a um, uh, nice upgraded lens as well for the cards. Rich really likes to take care of uh, the camera in that way, my uh, boss. <laughs> likes to make sure we've got some some quality equipment for the streams, of course. So yeah, it's a, it's a nice one. Nice one. Quick focus on it and stuff like that as well. Great picture. Uh, Staravia and Gothio. And I stream through OBS and stuff like that. Yeah, it is pretty crazy. <laughs> Gothita, my low tick hollow. You should see the camera, Kimmy. Seriously. I'm going to send you a picture actually after the stream, right after the break. You have to remember, Kimmy, this camera has probably been through uh, probably three plus years of card dust. There is dust on here that will never come off. I can assure you of that. Panpour, Copperaja Hollow. Come on, Dylan. Got to heat it up a little bit at the end. I would imagine this one's been around a while, though. Flaffy, Lugia. Yeah, right, yeah, it's right. I've been there, man. I've been there. Now I learn to just pull the trigger and live with the consequences. 
Spinarak and Lipard. A little bit left, Dylan. Diglett, Wigglytuff. Roostering. Uh, Clink Reverse and Darmanitan. Old PC. Manectric. Golasopod Hollow. There you go. Another Hollow. Come on, Dylan. We need some big hitters here at the end, man. Come on. We need that big Charizard to close it out. That would save the box. For sure. That would save it. Good luck here. Always, man. Always. Another Stunfisk. There you go. Another Stunfisk. Stunfisk V. Little did they know, though. <laughs> exactly, yeah. <it's, laughs> exactly. Yeah, he said he needs the Charizard. Exactly. Come on. No VMAX yet, though. No VMAX cards at all yet. So maybe we do have him coming. Come on. Let's see him. Ooh, Sizor VMAX. There you go, Dylan. Eating up a little bit as we get to the end. It seems to be a little bit bunched up. Sizor VMAX. Nice. Dylan, there you go. Keep these going, guys. A little bit left for Dylan here. Got Houndoom now. Wow, really heating up. Houndoom V. All the hits are coming out the last few packs. There you go, Houndoom. Zuelius. Laron. Surfetched. Steeny. Ooh, Hollow Sweet Cream. Nice. Yo, appreciate it. Appreciate it. Thanks for stopping by the website. Appreciate it. We're just closing up the stream here tonight. Um, and there's actually not a lot listed on the site compared to usual, to be honest. Um, in a second, you'll get a look at the tonight sheet. Uh, that'll show you all the breaks that we already had done tonight. Since we already had sold out all the breaks and stuff, there's no longer any on uh, the site. But yeah, we do stream, man. We stream five days a week, every day except Tuesday and Thursday, starting at 6 p.m. Eastern each day. And like I said, I'll give you a look at just a second at all the breaks that we did complete tonight. Uh, Darmanitan there at the end. Dang it, Dylan. No Charizard, man. I'm sorry. Fun stuff, though, still for you, man. Appreciate it, Dylan. We'll get those protected and sent right out to you. Thank you again, Dylan. So you can see right there in front of you now, uh, that is the Tonight Sheet. Uh, you can see there all of the different breaks we did. So we started it out uh, with some Pokemon. At the start of the night, you can see we did a Fusion Strike and Evolving Skies 2 Booster Box break. And you can see random energy. So a lot of the breaks that we do on the channel are random energy style breaks. Um, the way it works is you buy a spot in the break at just a fraction of the cost of what the boxes would be. Um, and then I'll do a random and stuff like that. All of the entries in the group break will get whatever um, random energy that they land in the random. And then uh, from there, they can go ahead and chase after those cards for the boxes. So you can see we did that with Cosmic and VMAX Climax. We did that with an Ultra Premium. Uh, then we did some of those other TCGs, Cryptid Nation um, and Nightfall. And then we did a little bit of uh, Tales of Aria, a full case there. That's Flesh and Blood. And then we did a triple booster uh, earlier tonight. That was a really fun one. Burning Shadows, Unified Minds, and Ultra Prism. Random energy style, like I said. Um, and then Evolving Skies, full case. That's one of our more popular ones. Do those um, a lot of the nights we have group breaks. So for example, with Evolving Skies, full case, it's usually a break that has seven spots. Um, and instead of buying like a full Evolving Skies booster box for yourself, you can buy one break spot at like $112 a spot. And uh, from there, then, um, you would have a spot in the break. One of those seven energies would end up yours, and you would get to chase after those hits for the entire full case of booster boxes. Oh, nice. The evolutions. Nice. Also a great choice, Saki. Great choice. 
We just ripped one of those actually earlier this evening. Jamin coming in with another order. Let me grab that. Crypto Nation second ed. Um, but yeah, I will actually be listing some more group breaks after the stream tonight. And those group breaks will be for Wednesday night. So yeah, give the website another look like tomorrow or Tuesday. Okay, so there's quite a bit of stuff up there right now, but there will be uh, more stuff up there in the morning. Hey, appreciate it, appreciate it. Yeah, it always takes a little bit of explaining. I know random energy style breaks are not like something that um, everyone's familiar with, but yeah. So we do group breaks on Wednesday, Saturday, and Sunday, and then a little bit of personal breaks after. That's what we're on right now, personals. Like I said, wrapping up the stream here tonight. Going about another hour. <clears throat> and then, uh, yeah, Monday and Friday, always just personal breaks. No stream Tuesday, no stream Thursday. And it's free shipping on the entire site, um, no matter where you live, domestic or international. All right, Jamin, good luck. Let's do it. Let's do it. Appreciate it. How's it going, everyone? Caleb here with Layton Gaming. It's time for Jamin L. Got a Cryptid Nation 2nd Edition Booster Box. Let's do this. Good luck, Jamin. Hey, Yachts, see you later. See you later, Yachts. Appreciated the chat. Have a good night, man. Appreciate it. Like the Charizard counter, thank you. <laughs> thank you. That's been an idea that I got pretty recently, in, or pretty much when we started the channel, the Charizard uh, counter. Yeah, we got to run it up quite a bit with like VMAX Climax. That really helped um, get us a bunch of Charizards. So hopefully when Brilliant Stars releases, uh, we can keep pulling a bunch of Charizards. All right, Jamie, good luck. That would be great. Uh, we're giving uh, five Charizards away when we get to 500, so been chasing after that now, that 500 number. <clears throat> Alright, and an empty box. Yeah, we offer free shipping, it makes it easy. The price you see on the, uh, the site is the price you pay. Yep, free shipping anywhere in the world. Makes it easier that way for everyone. Price you see, price you pay. And no tax either, unless you live in the state of Florida specifically. Uh, hoop snake reverse. You do unfortunately have to pay tax then. But yeah, otherwise, uh, no tax and no shipping. Joint snake reverse. Keep these going tonight, everyone. Ooh, wow, Jamin! Full hollow Mothman. Boom! Oh, yeah! Wow! Congrats, Jamin. Great start to the box of Cryptid Nation 2nd Edition. Congrats there, Jamin. Very nice. And like I said, guys, if you're looking for an order, only going to be live about another 45 minutes at the longest um, or until the order stops. So get something in soon. Congrats again, Jamin. Great start. Sinkhole Sam Reverse. Flatwoods Monster, nice full hollow. Very solid card there. Uh, to be honest, I don't know the reason behind that. <laughs> I'll be honest with you, I don't know the reason behind that. I don't remember how that works. Chupacabra, full hollow. Oh, that would be a good question for my boss, Rich. I don't remember exactly how it works though, but there is some, uh, there is obviously a reason behind that. <laughs> That's funny. That's really funny, Sage, I'm so sorry. Um, so I can tell you there is a way you can get past it. Hodag Reverse. Um, if he were to use your address, um, if he were to use your address, I think you can get past it. Um, but yes, it's because we are based in Florida, but I don't know what exactly... Okay, so it's just we have to charge taxes then, because it's in-state. Okay, that's kind of what I thought, but I didn't want to misspeak. But yeah, since we're based in Florida, we can't uh, not charge those in-state taxes. Fresno Nightcrawler's full. Nice one. But hey, appreciate it. Thanks for uh, sharing. Word of mouth, always one of the best uh, forms of advertisement. Slide Rock Bolter Reverse. <clears throat> Come on, there we go. But appreciate it. <laughs> Hugging Molly Reverse. And like I said, give it another look sometime tomorrow morning, tomorrow afternoon. Space Penguins Reverse. 
Um, if you check out the break schedule on this site, uh, the break schedule, you can go ahead and see the, uh, the schedule and stuff like that. Like I said, not a ton there right now. When you wake up tomorrow, it's going to be fully updated. I have a full schedule there for Wednesday. <clears throat> Best hit here is going to be the full Hollow Mothman, which we already had. Snally Gaster Reverse. This one right here, Dylan. Full Hollow Mothman. Best hit to get out of Cryptid Nation second ed. That's the chase. And then in the box topper, uh, Chessy Hollow. Very nice. Any of the full hollows are very nice. Um, but then, like I said, um, any of those um big big chase cards would come out of the box topper pack here that would be blue ink and that would be the short print to 100 card dylan sells for something like ten thousand dollars a little bit less slide rock bolter full uh orlando area right outside orlando a popka we do have a storefront as well you can come in and shop in the storefronts forest gods amber reverse right outside orlando though great question Ah, yes, thank you, Sean. It does still have Gaming Almanac as well. Yes. Shrippo Daryl Reverse. Yes, thank you. Forgot about that, Sean. Hey, that's sick. That means I don't have to list for Saturday and Sunday, really. That's nice. It's already done. That's pretty sweet. Quetzalcoatlus Reverse. Keep these going here. Nice, Bigfoot. Congrats on that Bigfoot full. Very solid. Congrats there. Nice Bigfoot full. <laughs> That's funny, man. That's really funny. That's really funny. <laughs> that is funny. Yeah, Instagram is a great spot to stay up to date with really all the news late in gaming, though. Jersey Devil Reverse. That is funny. So how did you stumble upon us late into this uh, fine Sunday night? Metal Man of Alabama. Nice card. There you go, Jamin. And like I said, nothing after Jamin. If you're looking to get something in, only a little bit of left, a little bit of time left on the stream tonight. So get that order placed soon, guys. Medium's third eye full. And then remember personals tomorrow night. Begin at 6 p.m. Eastern time. Oh, nice. Wow, that's incredible. <laughs> that's incredible. Unending fire crystal reverse. I'm shocked by that. Would not expect that. Uh, Chessy full. Very solid. I mean, I'm assuming you watch like a lot of Pokemon content. Uh, stuff like that. But still, I wouldn't quite expect that. Channel has only been around for a few months. So. That's awesome. Giant Salamander Reverse. Hey, sweet. <clears throat> Slide Rock Bolter Reverse. Yeah, I mean, that's nice to see, though, that our content is making it into that uh, algorithm with uh, Pokemon and stuff. Forest Gods, Amber. Full Hollow. Oh, yeah, I hear you. I pretty much uh, just come here, <laughs> you know, rip the cards, go home, learn more about the cards, watch cards, buy cards for myself. <laughs> yeah, I hear you. It never stops. Never stops. Always trying to work on my own collections. For sure. And a black hole shard. Nice full hollow. Keep these going here. Hoop snake reverse. <laughs> well appreciated. Snow wasset reverse. And an Enfield Monster Reverse. Got four left and then the box topper, Jamin. And like I said, nothing after Jamin. So we're wrapping up tonight. If you'd like something, please place that order soon. LeightonGaming.com And appreciate it, guys. It was a fun night of group breaks as well. We had some awesome hits. Good amount of alternate arts tonight. Um, what else do we have? I feel like there were some crazier pulls. Oh, we had that Golden Snorlax in Personals. That's right. That was nice. Jersey Devil Reverse. That was sweet for Daniel H. Big pull for him. One of my favorites as well, Snorlax. Sinkhole Sam, full hollow there. And one more and then the box topper. Good luck here, Jamin.
Flatwoods Monster Reverse. Nice. All right, all right. Let's get to the box topper, Jamin. Good luck. Cut this one, of course. Like impossible to open a pack with one card in it. Foolish idea. <clears throat> What's it gonna have? Ocean. There you go. Come on, back to back oceans, Jamin. Really? Really? Thanks again, Jamin. Appreciate it. Nice Mothman full. We'll get those all protected, Jamin, and sent right out to you. Thank you again. All right, sweet. Sweet, sweet. Let me refresh quick. See if there's any orders. All right, so nothing in the queue right now. If you do want something, feel free to place an order as we are wrapping up this stream tonight. Yo, what's up? What's up, X? Raku. <clears throat> Upload quick to YouTube that last break. And thank you again. Like I said, I'll stay live a couple more minutes tonight. And then remember, we are back tomorrow night at 6 p.m., guys. Back tomorrow night at 6 p.m. Thank you again, Jamin. Cryptid Nation, second ed. How you doing tonight, um, X? <clears throat> what ETBs we got in stock right now? <sighs> Pretty much everything in terms of like a modern ETB. Pretty much everything. I'll drop you a link here to personals, Pokemon. You can check it here at this link. I'll stay live a few minutes for you, no rush. Nice, good to hear me as well, just wrapping up the stream tonight, but also doing well. Just uploading quick, and like I said, I'll stay live a couple more minutes to see if another order does come in tonight, and we will uh, get that ripping if it does. And then personals resume tomorrow night at 6, group breaks will resume on Wednesday. Group breaks resume on Wednesday. I'll have those listed guys shortly after the stream tonight. I'm gonna go home, make my chicken nuggets, and uh, yeah, work on that. Yes, correct. Uh, right outside of Orlando. Right outside of Orlando. Apopka, Florida. If that helps you. I think your friend said that you might be based in Florida. <clears throat> and we do have a storefront as well. Um, of course, we do break online, but we also have a storefront open uh, every day. Uh, 11 to 6. Not far from, or far from you, unfortunately, it sounds like. Maybe. <laughs> oh, wintergreen. Oh, nice. Never mind. <laughs> That's close. That's close. Nice. Yeah, you'll have to stop by sometime. Um, if you want to find the storefront, look up Leighton Sports Cards. And then it's uh, the same building. Leighton Gaming, all the stuff here is all in the same building. Just look up Leighton Sports Cards on Google. It'll come up that way. It's the same address, same building. Everything is in the same place. Yeah, nuggets are reliable, man. They're reliable. I said I'll stay live about one more minute tonight and then like I said we return tomorrow night 6 p.m. Eastern thanks again everyone fun stream about seven and a half hours tonight appreciate it <laughs> I know that's hilarious that's hilarious that's just somehow uh, that's sometimes how it goes though yep but yeah your other friend had stopped in uh, Saki just a couple minutes ago really interesting that's really interesting actually because of the mural in the background sure enough yeah, it is fancy looking. It is indeed fancy looking. I'll kind of zoom in here for you. But there's Venusaur you can see there. You got the trainers, uh, the Team Rocket trainers in the background. Nice to see those. And then I can pan it, hold on. Give you a look a little bit at the left of it as well. One sec. You can see there's the rest. It does look pretty dang sick. <laughs> it does look sick, man. back over there all right I'll wait another minute like I said thank you again on stream tonight yeah it looks awesome 
Um, had a TikTok artist. I believe the name, if I remember right, is T-R-V-N-C-A-T. -T. I think that's the name on TikTok. She had uh, completed the mural for us in like a week, like crazy. Actually like three or four days, not even a week. Ridiculous, but yeah, so sick. For sure, we'd love to have you sometime, for sure. Like I said, it is open every day, the storefront, 11 to six. And when you're looking for the address and stuff, just search Layton Sports Cards. Instead of Layton Gaming, it'll come up better if you search Layton Sports Cards. So that's actually the larger part of the operation. <clears throat> Leighton Gaming, yep, just a small uh, part of it. But like I said, it's all the same building. Find it all there. Yeah, that worked out well. <laughs> We've got pretty much every single thing that we sell online and then a couple additional things as well, all in the storefront. There's a couple of like tins and stuff like that, Hidden Fates tins, um, some recent Sword and Shield tins and stuff like that. Any go-to sports? Yeah, I love sports as well, besides just gaming cards. Um, so I'm a pretty big fan of uh, my Milwaukee teams. I used to live in Milwaukee. I like the Brewers and the Bucks a lot. Um, and then I like football as well. I'm a Browns fan when it comes to football. But yeah, I don't know what my favorite sport is, I guess. But I really do enjoy baseball, basketball, and football. Outside of just like Pokemon, Metazoo, stuff like that as well. So yeah, I collect a little bit of sports cards and... Uh, mainly gaming cards though, but I do collect a little bit on that stuff. Lions fan, yeah. We haven't had the best, uh, haven't had the best few years, man. <laughs> Browns, Lions. I hear ya. I hear ya. Alright everyone, thank you again. Awesome night. I really appreciate everyone filling up all those group breaks that we did tonight. Uh, really fun time ripping those. I love ripping Cosmic. Love ripping that triple booster of Sun and Moon that we did earlier tonight. And appreciate all the good people in the chat, as always. Thank you again, everyone, um, for the fun stream tonight. That will do it for the evening. Remember, guys, we are back at you again tomorrow night, 6 p.m. Eastern. Uh, so we'll see you then. And yeah, we hope to see you sometime in the storefront. Um, I usually get here at like 4 p.m. on the days I'm streaming. Um, but yeah, anyone will be here to assist you in the storefront anytime uh, between 11 and 6, any day of the week. <clears throat> all right, all right. Thanks again, everyone. We'll see you tomorrow night. And remember, I'll have those group breaks listed by the time you guys wake up tomorrow for Wednesday. Thanks again. And remember, Almanac is on the site as well, breaking next Saturday and Sunday. Thanks again, everyone. We'll catch you again on uh, tomorrow night, 6 p.m. Eastern start. We'll see you guys then. Thanks, everyone. See you, Sean. Uh, see you, Owie. See you, Kimmy. Uh, XR, uh, Raku, I think it is. Have a good night. Saki, have a good night. Appreciate y'all you guys stopping by, and we'll see you guys again tomorrow evening. <laughs>